Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to the uh, early stream of all time. I don't remember a day where I've just woke up and been live at 2 p.m. What, what is going on? Uh, I don't even know. Good morning, everyone. Uh, the U.S., you're still awake. That's crazy. Australia, you're still awake. That's crazy. But hello, Europe. Hello, everyone. Welcome to a new stream. 
We have one hour until the rally car update drops. It comes with new action keys. It comes with a rally car. It comes with landing bug fixes for the snow car. So this is like a massive update. I made a video yesterday talking about what it might entail, but but we got a lot of things we gotta <laughs> go through before and after the update. I think one of the first things I want to do is, is build a couple of maps, so then we can compare landing bugs before and after and, and whatnot. And then there's going to be a campaign with 25 new maps with the rally car. Uh, we're going to see how all the physics work. Then uh, we'll take it from there. A cup of the day today is probably also rally car. So, uh, so today's a big day. <laughs> kind of crazy, no? Kind of crazy. Squanchy. Thank you for the one year. Welcome back. Thank you for the resub. Thank you also, Ayona, for the 53 months. Cup of the day is rally car and first place gets goodies. Well, I, 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 I gotta win then. I gotta collect. Like, I already got a goodie bag from them. I already got stickers. I got a, a t-shirt. Um, I, I went climbing the other day in one of the t-shirts they got me. And the Just teach. in time, why people are happy? Hazy mood. Thank you for the 15 months. Let me know if this alert is annoying, by the way. Um, because I can probably. I tried to. Uh, I really tried to change the sound, but it didn't happen apparently. Um. Now I went climbing in one of the the Trekmania t-shirts I got, and it was a terrible idea. <laughs> because I felt when I was climbing that people were staring at Yo, me. how's it going? Oh, who's this nerd climbing? It's like climbing in an Overwatch t-shirt, you know? Uh, what if I just remove this and save? And then I remove I rally excited again. this. You are also rally excited? Wow. Wow. We're all rally excited. I'll confess it is a bit annoying. I should have been able to mute it now, but can you still hear TTS? I have successfully done one step in this process of being a streamer. Anyways, hopefully it works. Because um, if it's just TTS, I think that's fine. Aro, thank you. Thank you, silly dude. Thank you, Kanawana Gasaki, as well. Hi, Wertul. I'm excited to see the new car. It's 8.45 a.m. in the USA. That is early. I mean, you're up super early. Clickbait stream title got me hyped for Rally Car, but I gotta wait one hour, Sag. I don't make the rules, but it would be weird if this stream title is forever up with like, at 4 p.m. Exactly. it's gonna happen. And then people will look at their, their watch and they'll be like, oh, this car isn't out yet because it's only 7 a.m. and I don't even know. I put a timer. You can see when it's out. Uh, and uh, thank you. Thank you also, BMX Frog and Captain. Ten Guys, months, let's Jesus. get in-game. Let's get in-game. We have one hour to create some experiment maps before the landing bug update. I'm curious to see with the snow car just how significant it's going to be. GG. I'm going to build maps that just farm landing bugs on the current snow car patch. And then we'll test those again later after the patch and see if it's better. Like, is it faster? Can you now beat basically any snow car world record? Because if you don't know, I made a video about this. Um, the snow car hitbox is one of the most comical I've seen in all of gaming. It's it, 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 it almost unacceptable, but they are fixing it now. <laughs> Wait, uh, do you have your stick out for the rally car? I do. Nah, I do. Sticks out for the rally car. I do have my my trusty joystick. Um, for for three thousand two thousand three, bong. this was a huge accomplishment to make a a car this realistic. I think, but they just ported the same hitbox into TM twenty twenty, and what you can see on these images is the original. Let's freaking go! Snow car hitbox outlined in orange. So, if you look over there, for example, uh, do you see these blobs under the car? You, you would think it kind of just follows everything you see visually, but no. Everything you see here can collide, and particularly this area that's outlined in, in like red. Very small, probably. Um, that's where landing bugs happen. It's just three O's. It's just three big O's, three big Omega Lols. 
And I think what they're doing now is fixing the hitbox to be more um, uniform with the design of the car. <laughs> and then you say crazy that Nadeo was lazy? Pr maybe with the port into the game, but I think also, in some way actually, they did it the right way. Because they ported it in, they let people give their feedback on it without actually changing anything, so you're not wasting any time. Like, for all they knew, players could love the landing books, but that didn't happen. And when that didn't happen, they were like, okay, we'll fix it. Your old snow car PF map is going to be screwed? I feel like any press forward map, you just got to eternalize with, uh, with a video, because uh, sooner or later, they do all uh, break. But I saw your 10-minute uh, one, Nebula. It was really cool. Holy early stream, trying to catch the stream while working. So excited for the new update. Just gotta rush home after work and, and try the rally car. I mean, I, I, I am very excited too. I, I think people kind of got me wrong in that I'm complaining about the new car. I think it's gonna be great. I think it's just a lot of Trackmania players are like, a little worried about what keyboard players will do. But, um... But we'll find out. We will find out how viable it is, how big the differences are. Um, there's a Norwegian saying that you shouldn't feel sorrow in advance of something bad happening. Like, excited for the new. You content. should only feel sorrow when the bad thing happens, and the bad thing hasn't happened yet. <laughs> <laughs> it's no megalol, a megalol, a megalol car, yeah. Am I going to watch F1 on Saturday? Um, probably not. I'm waiting for the next season. When things are interesting again. Um, wait, does that new season start on Saturday? Wait, is it a new season on Saturday already? Oh, so it is. Okay, no, but then I'm interested. Then I'm interested. Thank you for that. Then I'm interested. Because I didn't Twitch think it was baby. interesting with the old season. Okay, cool. Ali, thank you for the nine months. Nice to see you. Uh, although, this is the only place I can really see you, because in real life, you'd be too short. But, alas, thank you for the nine months of support. Thank you, Mattis. Thank you, Alfonso. Here's what we're gonna do, guys. <laughs> if you don't know, Ellie's like 140 or something. Uh, 140 centimeters. Like, so, yeah. And funny, haha. <laughs> What we're gonna do, we have one hour. What we're gonna do is just build probably the worst map that I have ever created. I want this to be a landing bug simulator. And the best way to do that is to make a terribly uncalculated drop, or in fact, several. But I think we need to- the great content, keep it up. I think we need to make some tests. So the first thing I wanna do is just build a press forward map. Oh, sorry. We're just going to build a uh, long press forward map. And this is literally just a test Down if... 17 months go by quick. Snow Excited car acceleration is different. I want to see if the snow car acceleration is any different. Uh, isn't this supposed to have like... No, it's here. Snow. Okay, so if I set this... Wait, if I just place it here, does it... Overlap. Ah, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So we're just gonna press forward. I'm not gonna do any other input. I just want like a clean... We'll compare it to this later. Uh, Yukiru. Thank you for the $3. Sport car believers from Trickmania Sunrise. Sport car? Is that the coast car? I've always hated the coast. Dried grapes. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mr. Jammin as well. And Valton. Okay, 14683 for a press forward. We are going to save this map and then we're going to make more maps. One moment. Computing shadows. World record. True. True. That is a world record. Okay, snow car test one. All right, beautiful. Now. We're gonna make more of these. For almost two years, but only recently figured out how to sub with Prime. Love the content, hyped for rally. Thank you for the Prime. Sack the Zephyr. 
Thank you also, Svinhagen, Galaxy, Waterdoggle, and, uh, and Eric. Sound. Green timer's making you very happy. It's just pure dopamine. Very special day today. Okay, guys. This needs to be awful. So what about this? I mean, this... This makes me feel a certain type of pain in my chest. Looking at a map like oh, this... No. The Trackmania update release at the same time as Norwegian football friendly match. I wonder what I will do. This this makes me feel some kind of like I'm committing mapping sense. Oh. Ugh. Ugh. I'm sorry you had to watch that. I am sorry you had to watch that. <laughs> that was powerful. 160 speed down to 100. Hello, Wurti Chan, Sugoi Kawai Desunaya. Okay, Hopefully this was. that was enough to make chat cringe. Yeah, that hurt as well. Okay, snow car test number two. And then we're gonna. What we're gonna do is make like a, a longer one with like five in a row. Okay, snow car test number two. I asked Nick about good your mom jokes and he said you once called his mom the Danish opening. Smiley face. <laughs> uh, we were in fact playing chess. And I said, Danik, have you heard of the Danish opening before? And I said, no, what's that? And then I said, yeah, it's your mom. And then he never knew what to say afterwards. And he's since tried to make a better your mom joke, but I sincerely believe I have won the game. I sincerely believe he can never recover. So sorry I forgot to cancel. Feel free to vips me my refund. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. That is not gonna happen. But I appreciate it, uh, Jacob. Okay, guys. Is this five? One, two, three, four. Let's make one more. Five landing bugs in a row. And of course, you can... So what I want to do is actually get one landing bug time on this and one non-landing bug time. So I can compare them. I hate perspective. Am I missing again? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I mean, this is... And let's actually place checkpoints. Only for giving us speed splits. One hour left. Oh, the timer doesn't even... Wait. Can I just do this now? And then set this to... Hang on, guys. I'm fixing, I'm fixing. Oh, that looks a lot better. Less useless numbers. 12 months so well. Let me just place it better. Okay. Nice. Thank you for the one year! Halal cut. Thank you also, Shirul. Congrats, Henrum. Mr. Speedy Streamer Man. And older. Thank you. The trophy is right there. That's the trophy we got for the Streamer Awards. It has a nice place on the shelf now. For all the rest of, uh, of, 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 of time. Hopefully. Uh, checkpoint. Checkpoint. This is going to look ugly. I'm sorry. It's just modern art. Here we go. Add milliseconds? I don't really think we need them. Press forward, right? Oh god. I mean... Okay, I'm gonna move that check... I don't... This would break my test map completely. Let's... Put that there. Okay. Waypoint, sign him up. Yeah, if anyone is looking for maps for their competition, if you want, like, eSport ready Trek Mania maps, um, oh, we lost 100 speed. 31 months of virtual crashing into the finish block. I mean, this is... How fast do you think... Oh! How fast do you think we will go on the updated version of this? So this was a... This was a 27 press forward. Now... I can try to do that without crashing, and we might get like a 24.
I can I can try to just not crash, you know, but still get the lightning bugs. I think it's gonna be like a 19. 19 second run. Oh, this landing is particularly horrible. I mean, this is only 26. Or, yeah, 26. Let me actually try to perfectly avoid landing bugs. Oh, do you guys have game sound? Maybe not. Oh, you have a little bit. Okay. Very faint. Faint game sound. Okay, so it is possible to somewhat avoid these landing bugs by tilting the car a bit. You see I'm gaining speed here. This is what players traditionally do to avoid landing bugs. But I think even with perfect movements here, you will still be slower than the new car. The new um, landing bug update. I, I, I think no further than like a 25 here is, is possible. What are we trying? Uh, we're trying to make maps that farm landing bugs. Because, I mean, everyone's focused on the rally car. And I'm also excited about the rally car. But they are fixing the snow car landing bugs. The snow car will not landing bug on the next patch. And I'm very curious to see how, how much faster it is. So, we will check that. Oh! Big landing. Okay. Yeah, 26.9 20, and, and 26.40. Okay. So you can... Press forward was like 27.5. Driven perfectly, it's like one second faster. Okay. Cool. We'll save this one too. Was this number three? It was number three. There's a situation you guys might be familiar with. As well, that I'm really curious about. Which is the third map in the current campaign. Uh, neurotic Wow, thank you for the three months. There is um, a bug you often get on this map. Right at the... Um, the tiny drop here through the checkpoint. If you just don't steer, you usually get a bug. Okay, well I didn't now. But usually, you just get a huge bug here that slows you down. You guys might have experienced this. And what players do to counteract it is to steer just a tiny bit. But I'm very curious if just going press forward now will be possible and even faster. Just, uh... Yeah, there. <laughs> this bug right here. Took me three attempts to get it, and it makes no sense if you don't know how the snow car hitbox looks. But when you look at these drawings, what's just going on is that this huge blob here is colliding with the ground. And this'll be, this'll be resolved. So I want to try to go back to this map as well after the release and see whether or not I am getting landing bugs or not. Uh, you guys can see the game. But yeah, that's what's happening. Huge blob just boop and you crash. Bro had the graphs ready. What do you think? You think this is some unprofessional stream? What about 17? I mean, 17 is comical. I'm not sure if I can get the bug here uh, that quickly. Oh, I can actually. I think I can. This map is known as like the worst one to get unranked. Let me open this in the map editor. It'll be a lot easier to show what I want to show there. Uh, official. Does someone want to take my donk for a walk? <laughs> I mean, that honestly sounds like a privilege. If I wasn't at work, I'd love to. I wonder, will the new snow car be oo or oo? Monkerham. Hopefully it will just be um, snow car shaped. That's that's what I think the car should be. Uh, do I have... No, I don't have respawns here. So the reason I wanted to open an editor is just to spawn out a checkpoint with speed. Yeah, guys, I am at work. I woke up today, 
I made a thumbnail about racing game. Then I wrote about a racing game and now I'm playing racing game. I am at work. This is this is my life. <laughs> so this jump right here is notoriously horrible. It's notoriously bad because you just land on one of these blobs and your car acts like a trampoline. Like the car, let me see if I can show this. Like imagine you're playing this in ranked, right? Okay, you just want consistency, you don't want to go too fast. You try to land over here. Okay, wait, didn't happen. Yo, uh, Halden, thank you for the $20. Ever tried the Maltese soda kinney? It's a bitter herbs and orange soda, similar to Italian chinato. Delicious. I've actually never been to Malta, but if I ever go, I would love to try it. Kinato. Oh, Kinney. Kinney. I'm gonna try to remember this. Okay, we're gonna spawn here and see if we can, um... Can get these, uh, bugs. It shouldn't take that long. If I just jump straight, does it happen? No. Guys, did they give me the patch early? Very excited for the update. Gonna be hard grinding and getting both my uni papers submitted tonight. Ooh, that's exciting. It's a lot of work. Oh, see here? Do you see this hop? Like the car? And sometimes you get these where it just hops out of the map. Ooh. When am I gonna destroy Chad again with 1,070 V emotes? Is it worth it? April 1st, maybe. You know, the, the, the rally car update was kind of pushed all, all of a sudden. It, it was supposed to be April 1st, I think, but they moved it forward. And I do wonder if it was for the simple fact that they didn't want the April Fool's <laughs> jokes about their car. Look at this! Whew. You're playing ranked? And you get this? Bop! <laughs> it's wild. So this landing bug, if this is gone, this map will be a lot more enjoyable. Deoxys and Crispy B and Gosling. Grande abraço from Portuguese community virtual. Grande abraço. I forgot what this means. I forgot this language. But muito obrigado. They had to change plans after Germany legalized cannabis for 1st of April. Could they not just delay it 19 days? Are the Germans talking about this? What a wasted opportunity from the German government to finally be cool. They wait 19 days? Excuse you! Rumble! Gifting 50 subs? Holy sh- thank you! <laughs> Moved to Australia two weeks ago so have missed almost every stream. Thank you, I appreciate Glad that. Glad to finally catch one cheer 1000. And also, Fridge Fernando with the thousand bits. We have struck oil. Norway has struck oil for the second time. Thank you guys, I, I appreciate that. <laughs> Just like the government, I will not share stop. this with the I people. My I will invest it all and promise that I'll give it in the future, but never will. It's just like the oil fund. Uh, Kezebrot and Sozo Wannabe, thank you so much for the prime. 16 months, let's go. <laughs> Get us wild. Thank you guys. Uh, well, what I think we're gonna do with the remaining 47 minutes, is this wrong, guys? Is it wrong to open the old Trek Mania and play the old rally car for a bit? Am I wrong for that? Would it be fun to, like, get a little bit of a head start? Do it with joystick? It's almost like I feel like I should wait, you know? It feels like opening a Christmas present a little too early. 
But but that's what I'm kind of thought about doing today. Granati and Janik has done it. All right. Grand abrazo means a great or big hug. Oh. Portugal Carolio. Embrace abrazo. Aha. Uh -huh. It makes um, it makes sense. Thank you, Richard. Portugal Caralho. Okay. I'm opening the old trick mini game. is the birthday of the mustache German man. I think that might be why. Granati is watching my video. We can also watch Granati watch my video and give my takes on it in real time. Make a map where you compare snow car on sausage. Ooh, we could do that too. I mean, that that is notoriously buggy as well. Um, one moment. Do 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 do. One sec, guys. Is my joystick uh, connected? I don't think it is. Uh, uh, uh. Wait. Oh, it is. Okay, perfect. So this works. Nice. Alright, so. Let's hop in. Let's hop in. Um, here. Alright, guys. We're in United Forever. We've got... Love your videos. Keep oh. it up. We got a lot of rally maps we can play. I think I want to play some of the more complex ones because I doubt they're going to be that simple ones. I doubt the maps that we're going to play in the campaign are going to be that simple. Maybe. Maybe we could play Rally C1. Maybe that's where we'll start. So this is the rally car. Uh, do you guys have game sound? Wait. Oh, you do, but it's super loud. Okay. <laughs> Set this the horn. What a banger. Banger sound. Okay. Uh, so, let me first just play on keyboard, okay? I'm just gonna play on keyboard, and I'm gonna show you how this car works. With keyboard in this game and no action keys, this car slides all over the place. And I mean, like, all over the place. It is incredibly responsive. It feels like trying to tame a dragon I to drive this car. I don't much TM myself, because but this new update sure looks interesting. At every instance, if you tap the steering too much with 100% steering, it will slide, it will get a bad angle, uh, etc. And I play this update instead of revising. The yeah. difference when you play an analog device is like night and day for this car. With action keys, I do think you'll get close to what um, analog devices can do, but let me just uh, complete a run here. <laughs> okay. So that was stressful. Uh, quite a lot of mistakes. We got, we got a gold medal. Okay, I gotta beat author. Wait, I gotta beat author on keyboard. Hang on. All the author medals are driven on keyboard in this game, I think. Can't lose to Hylus from 2008. So like, just don't want to touch the grass. Although there is an exception to this rule, which is that grass on the right side of a road in this game does not slow you down. But grass on the left side of a road slows you down. Uh, so yeah. And uh, I, the the idea behind this is that in this game, only the left set of wheels check for what surface you're driving on. The right wheels don't. So if you have your left wheels on a road and right wheels on grass, the game thinks, oh, this guy's on a road, he's fine, no slowdown. But in newer games, this is not the case. 
<laughs> but in the old Trek Mania, this is the case. Best month for new action key update. So you can just drive touching the grass with the right wheels and the left wheels on the road, you're fine. Okay, this is a good start. Heck. That was bad. Oh, yuck. But yeah, you can see, I, I really don't have a lot of control on keyboard. This might be off time. It is, okay. But let me try to show you how much easier this would be with an analog device. So I'm using a joystick. I'm not going to have, like, any dashboard or anything up, but I'm using a joystick. And let's see. Why oh, skip the author sound? Oh, you're right. Sorry. Habit. So with, with smooth steering, it is possible to just no slide everywhere. Oh. Heck. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Not useless. Not useless. Not useless yet. Keyboard. First try, a little, little warm up. You might want to break here to get a no slide. I don't remember what I had break bound to. Hey, what you will? Nice grip on your big juicy joystick. Ah. Uh, wait, what's my break key? Okay, this button. Okay. Stick cam? Do you guys... I should just get a new camera. I can't believe I haven't done this yet. I should have one camera for my face cam and one for my joystick. But uh, th this car, believe me when I say, with any form of analog input, is a lot easier. Okay, I almost jumped out of the map, but it's still fine. PB. In, like, my third try. And I still lost a lot of time at the end. And probably at the start. I think the world record is like 27 seconds. But I can tell you, I am not steering more than like 30-40% throughout all these turns. And that keeps the car in a state where it has full grip, it's not sliding, and that gives you more speed. If you're transitioning to joystick anyway, couldn't you transition to wheel and remove it from your desk but not playing? It's just a hassle to play wheel. And it's so much more physical than driving with a... Like when you're driving a car in real life. Be honest. How many times have you streamed in your streamer award shoes but haven't said anything? Uh, a total of zero. Although I will be using those shoes when going to like family gatherings or parties and stuff like that. Like formal events. And I will look dapper. Let's check what the world record is. World record 2707. So we're still missing a lot. I can actually want to watch the record from Shock and see. Shock Rally C1. Oh, wait, Rally C1? Alright, so you can see, he's driving with the right wheels on the grass, because that's fine. Game doesn't care. Full speed up here, actually taking a bit of a slowdown. Then releasing... Oh, this is really good speed management. Big brake tap. Big brake tap again. Beautiful turn. Ooh, and then small air time reduction. And again, small air time reduction. That is clean. Rukov and Alex Vet and Noin and Pro and Kine Internet. Thank you. And K Nice and Vladimir Lich. Easy to beat? Dude, I think... I think Trek Mania players are in for a real wake-up call. That they're going to be de dethroned when these old-school United players start picking up uh, Team 2020. Like, it's already happened a bit with Sander and Roa and stuff. 
but uh, you know, there, there's more pros like Shock. That if they start playing now, we are just. Whew. We're no longer going to be the top dogs. Okay, I improved. Maybe I should do uh, official runs. Did you see the newest history for granted? I did. I kind of want to rewatch it though on stream and talk about it. If Mr. HFG is okay with it. At some point. Not today, we have quite important matters today, but- Oh! Big hop. Let's get a banger time in official mode. Lurfty, thank you for the 21 months. The elders are coming back, yeah. Don't prime to use your prime forget boys. What does that what? No idea what that means. Oh. Okay. How do you have so many coppers? Cause I I used to win competitions. Like I've won RPG competitions where there was no physical like money prize pool. But the prize pool was in coppers, so I've won like a hundred thousand coppers in tournaments. That was what it, uh, how prize pools used to be. And then the biggest flex you could do, because tournaments always needed coppers, the biggest flex you could do back in the day was that you donate your coppers back to the prize pool next year this and then rewind them. Chat. Give me all your primes now and everyone will be okay. So this used to be the meta that like, okay, there's a huge RPG cup, let me donate back like 80k and then win it back again. This was spent my whole solid. Life by 5,000 points. With Prime. Okay, 7,000 points. You. Getting a world record on this gives you like 2 million points. But that was top 300 in official mode. Although many people have better records that are not in official mode on this. Are you playing keyboard? No, this is joystick. Keyboard, the best I could do was 29 seconds. Although I'm a rally papaga, so. Oh. I love updates cause after Show I the always joystick. get a bit better. Alright, let's see if we can get a PB with the joystick cam. Let's put it here. Let's put it here, chat. The joystick camera. You do gotta see how to uh, how how gentle you gotta be to get good rally times. Like I'm just Hello. barely moving it. It's very gentle. And then you can get these no slides. Remember when we were kids and we did that thing? Good times. New content, same word you. Oh. I don't remember uh that much from when I was a kid. I thought I'd remember I personally more. don't like the idea of being punished for steering 100% all the time. Glad the game gets good content with these updates too. Yeah, no, I think a lot of people agree with that. Like, uh, it's, it's cool that they're adding more content, but... And, and a lot of people will say like, oh, how could people be so dumb to play keyboard in a racing game for 10 years and not realize it's worse? Your hands look nice. Really nailed it. Thank you, Bacon. Edition. But yeah, the, like the argument is like, how could people be so dumb to think that they would be competitive in a racing game for 15 years? And only now realize that keyboard is worse? Like, what? But then the other side of the argument is... Stadium became the most popular Trackmania Thought game for late, a good reason. But looks like I'm 30 minutes early. For the, for the specific reason that it was so easy to pick up, so easy to play, and so accessible for anyone with any device. That's why nobody really played Rally that much for the first, you know... Or, let's just say, after Stadium released. And Stadium was really competitive on keyboard. 
but now these cars are being added into stadium. And I think that's what people don't like. It's like, hey, we have our environment. This used to be all device friendly. And then you have these cars separate. But when these cars are merged into the new game, it's like... There is no, uh, <laughs> there's no way for keyboard players to avoid them anymore. If they end up being in a couple of days, being in campaigns. Yeah. Great start. Oh. This turn shocked it insanely well. No, this Two was a beautiful years. run. That was a 27. Would be nice to get a 27 on this. This looks insane, yeah. Will it give Analog Keyboard a try with the new update? Absolutely. I really liked playing Analog Keyboard when I had the steering... Um, ...curb change. That was really enjoyable. So that might be what I prefer compared to this. So it's also easier to change from analog keyboard to digital input mid-run. Oh, it's gonna be only like 500 faster. Okay, yeah, small PB. Isn't it a bit like mouse and keyboard being objectively better on FPS games? I mean, yes, but like, take a game like Call of Duty. You have a huge market on console. A lot of people in Call of Duty are upset that console players get huge aimbot. Not aimbot, aim assist, but same thing. But it makes the game a lot more, you know, accessible for their big audience on console. And I think that's a good quality of life change that they've done, and this is a 27. Is that top, like... Okay, 20k points! Top 126. I am still so far from shock, though. Okay. Do we go uh, next map, guys, or do we, um... Try for one more PB here? Because I think I want to play a road map. Dirt is so hard. And so bumpy. I think that's the main problem here. I don't expect the new rally dirt blocks to be so bumpy. So let's find something with a lot of road. Can we play a run on keyboards? We can see how it behaves. Uh, yes. Should I do the same map for comparison? Let me do the same map for comparison. And I can also put the cam back. Oh. Put the cam back. Imagine there's a one-to-one -one remake of the map you practiced. <laughs> Doubt that will happen. But yeah, here you can see. I, I got a 29 earlier and felt that was a good uh, keyboard one. Here we go. This is where it's going to start hurting. Yeah. Full slide. <laughs> okay. So, so painful. <laughs> Low speed, you're fine because you don't slide that much, but then a turn like this and you're just so screwed. Although, look at this. I'm keeping up. Okay, not, not anymore. And this is no action keys. There's no action keys in this game. Was well, keeping up, yeah. Yeah, it's still a 29. You're just not tapping fast enough? But how? I think what we're seeing is experience on keyboard versus just control on analog steering. I mean, I got a 28.4 here or something. That's not that bad. 28.3. That's not that bad, considering that's 100% steering. 
if, if this was in um, this map was in the new game, I could probably get close to my PB with just regular action keys. Going to play keyboard or joystick? Uh, I'll I'll figure out what I prefer when we <laughs> when we see the the card and everything. Let's try this map. Silo, thank you. Hobo behind you. Thank you so much. Dodge and Mike the Sixth and Binu and Celix. Okay, we're starting on this map on keyboard. Uh oh. Yeah, I mean these might be pain though. The road turns. Because on road, it's extremely sensitive to your steering. To start sliding. And anytime you see those skid marks, I basically lose speed. Let's try analog keyboard. <laughs> this is analog keyboard now. Ah, oh, I mean, that's hard. Okay. How much rally car have you played in the old game? Basically, none. The first time I tried it was when they announced it. But beyond that, I have not played much Rally. They announced that it was coming to the new game. This map looks great so far. I like this. Uh-oh. What is going on here? Yeah, this is gonna be full joystick abuse. Let me do one more keyboard run, and then let's go to uh, to joystick. We got, oh, I skipped. We got author time. This is Trackmania United. This is the uh, Trackmania United Forever 2008, and one of the early games where Rally appears. But um. I think it's gonna be really cool in the new game. Oh. Just gonna not crash here. Okay, that. Oh, that's pain. And it's so avoidable too, I think, with just. a little bit smoother steering. On grass, by the way, like this, your speed is capped to 150. But this is penalty grass. And I don't know if this is the case in the. in Check Me in 2020. Let's try Joystick now. Streamer knows all input devices. Honestly though, having the ability to adapt based on what map you're playing, is a good thing I think. I'd equate it to like, having the ability to play multiple instruments, and then just seeing what the song you're performing requires. Joystick overlay right? How am I gonna get a joystick overlay? I don't know how I'm gonna set that up. I wonder if I can get this first turn full speed without crashing. A tap break. Oh! Okay, so far I'm doing worse. But I have managed to avoid my crash. And now, just no slide, overpowered. We get a small PB. Use a mirror behind me to reflect my joystick. So you want me to do what the... the cam girls do. <laughs> but so you can see my joystick. We take cam girl technology and we import it into Trickmania channel. I mean, the cam girls have honestly scientifically solved how to show as much as possible at once. <laughs> There's a lot of info on their overlays. It's not that, uh, not to be taken for granted. So close to being good, I think. Yeah, this uphill, I need to like... If 
find out how to knock Rouse. If you get TMNF, do you also need to get a Canyon? Lagoon and the other ones? Are those worth buying? Uh, I think Canyon is a really cool Trickmania game. Lagoon is kind of... Uh, not one of the most liked environments. But, um... Most of those games don't have a big online scene anymore. So if you're getting them, it's mostly to play the campaigns. The official ones, I think. To just experience different types of Trackmania gameplay. But the ones that are most played online is Trackmania Nations, Trackmania 20, uh, 20, and Trackmania 2 Stadium. Have decent online communities, though. And the rest are sort of campaign games. Okay, guys, let's go into official mode. We've gotten our prep, let's let's do some official mode runs on this. 20 minutes left till the update. And yeah, good question in YouTube chat. My my analog keyboard will profit from the um new action key changes that they've announced. So that's why I'm really curious to try analog keyboard again. Also your rumble. I didn't see if you said anything earlier, but again, thank you so much for the uh 50 gifted earlier, really kind. Really appreciate that. I mean, you have to be able to skip a corner here. And then, no slide through here. Okay, didn't get it. Ow, landing bug. First time catching a stream after three years of watching. Don't tell my boss that you're on my second monitor. If your boss walks into the room, I will tell him that I'm your newest client, I am interested in buying your product, and you are actually just a genius salesman, okay? That goes for all of you. Like, let me know if your boss walks into the room, I will, and just pitch me your product, I will seem very interested. We can make a deal, you and I. Chat. I mean, I am- wait, is this faster? Okay, I think I need to watch the record. Because I am, uh, gaining time in weird places. My boss is in the room, I am a joystick salesman. Oh! Well, you've come to the right place. Uh, I'm a jo I like- I like joysticks. Your boss already asks why you watch? Because you can't miss out on Trackmania- Trackmania news. Huge Trackmania updates. I feel like Shock has like all of these records. Every single one of them. What does he do here? He goes, yes. Okay, he does break tap here. A small break tap here and then look at that speed. Wow, okay. Aha, uh -huh, he can cut across there and oh my god, he full speeds through there. And just look at the steering. Are you seeing this? Guys. Just imagine playing keyboard in this next turn, okay? <laughs> and look at the input display. <laughs> I think you're screwed. I think you're screwed. That's like just just touching it a little bit. That's like 25% or something. He's so fast. Jitter tap. If Virtual reads this message, I will be happy. Keep up the awesome content. Ballsy. I hope you are very happy. Thanks for being part of the stream. Okay, so he did break here. He broke very late though. Braked. And then small break tap to get this, and then hop with a lot of speed. I didn't get speed. Here, here. Oh my god, we're so fast. And then he went over this mountain. Gibby? Ty. Okay. I am missing 1.6 seconds. My boss just came in. I sell Trickmania and Trickmania accessories. Wow. 
Well, your boss should be pleased to know that I am uh, Mr. Wirtual, ready to buy five like to offer products. You the opportunity to buy 1,000 pairs of our newest product, Chower Socks. We think you might be interested. No, but I actually would. If you sell shower socks, the ones that have the, like, the trampoline ones, you know? That have the grip, the grippy socks. The anti-slip socks. If they're also, like, waterproof for the shower, I I'm... I I'll be your customer. I will invest in your... I'll... For 10% equity, <laughs> I am ready to buy five socks. <laughs> oh, okay. I want to get a mid or low 33 here. That'd be a good time for me. So far, gotta remember with these leaderboards, still guys. Haven't given up on the shower socks, eh? Uh, no, I'm a, I'm still a believer. The thing about these leaderboards is like they've been grinded since you know 2008. So it's gonna is it's a lot harder to get a good time on these maps than like current um, TM 2020 campaign maps. Although those again are also really competitive. But I'm not expecting to get, like, top tons here and there, because that's just not going to happen. But maybe it will in the rally campaign, when it comes out. Oof. Yeah, no, reset. Ow. Chrome Claw, thank you so much. Thank you, Cal, as well. Burke, 43 months, and Crimson. Hello. Unhinged streamer shows his joystick live, buys 1,000 shower socks, continually crashes car. I don't know if today is the day to have this argument again. But I am not unhinged. There are valid reasons for showering with socks on. In some occasions, not all the time. You don't need to uh, unfollow and report me to the government. In some occasions, this is valid. Oh, that's beautiful. No, 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 no. Example. This is my favorite example. You've been out skiing, okay, in the winter. It's cold. You're getting, like, not frostbite, but when you get inside, after skiing, it feels like your nails are gonna pop out. Uh, you get this tingly feeling in your nails. You go in to get a warm shower. And... Your feet are freezing. If you keep the socks on, then the socks will absorb hot water, heating your feet quicker and getting rid of the nail bite, as we call it, the nail bite. Quicker. But how do you wash your feet? Well, you just take them off after your feet are warm and then put them in the wash because they're going in the wash anyways. This, this is perfectly logical. And then you have warm feet, you're gonna have clean socks after laundry, and a happy life. Yapping. The saucer block test? I think we'll just uh, skip it and just try a random saucer map after. But thank you for the reminder, regardless. Joel. Take your feet off. You take, you take the socks off your feet. Don't be pedantic, chat. You know what I mean. You will never shower with socks. People in my community have tried it and then sent videos of their feet in the shower with socks on. <laughs> uh, unsolicited, by the way. I did not ask for this. But on occasion, I just get these in my DMs. Unsolicited shower sock videos. And the feedback is... 
not that bad. Like, that's, that's the main feedback I've heard from people. Ah, oh, it wasn't that bad, actually. And you bully me for being small? We should focus on the real issues at hand and bully you instead for this. <laughs> I am unbullyable, Ellie. I am unbullyable. I know my worth. And I know what I enjoy in this life. I feel like living without having showered once with socks on to try it means you haven't really lived at all. Is hill at start of grass area cuttable? Also wet warm socks was my nickname in college. But, you know, maybe the problem for Ellie is that she's shorter. So she's closer to the smell of her socks. Whereas I'm so tall, I don't really have this issue. But I can see how when you're short, like this, this might not be as viable. It might be a big problem. I beg you to stop, please. Alright guys, where are we? Where are we? New update. A beautiful day. To, uh, to play Trackmania. Despite our differences. Our difference in opinion on, on socks in the shower. Play 08 before the update. But then I'll play for five minutes, and you know how long that takes. Only ten minutes left. I gotta get one clean run here. I want 20,000 points on this. At the minimum. But it's so hard to survive. A run without sliding. You guys wanna see the the camera again? I, I hope this shows just how how little I have to see. Like look, right? Look how gently I'm searing and how easily the car slides. Like in this next turn. I'm not steering a lot, and there I didn't make it. But if I if I steer more than it starts to slide, so there's a very fine like sweet spot you gotta hit. And I think this will be easier in Trackmania 2020 when you can see your steering percentage. Because then you'll know what like number costs you to slide out. Here it's all feeling. Ow. Two inside. Living without sliding in mayonnaise means you haven't lived as well. I don't- I- I- I do think you actually- I would like to... argue the opposite. I think sliding around in mayonnaise is a sign that much of your existence has been in a state of psychosis and that you might not be that well and that you haven't experienced the real world you have been living <laughs> you have been living in a dream a, a bad dream a nightmare I don't know why people people wear watches now, we have phones. You're actually so right. You're actually so right. You're so hey, right, Vlad. Work keeps me from catching the streams and unfortunately I will have to dip here in about 30 minutes. But wanted to pop in to say congrats right. on the stream rewards and to have fun with the new car. It'll be looking forward to the VOD. Yo! Awesome, yeah. Do check out the VOD. When does the up to drop? In seven minutes. Wait, oh yeah, wait, hang on. Sorry. Yeah, it's actually in eight minutes. But I gotta uh, open the game in seven minutes. Who 
Okay, good start. No! What kind of landing is that? Wait, does the number 15 on my timer get skipped? Is this happening? I do not know how to manage this. <laughs> Fire watch? Thanks, thanks. What game is this? Answer please, this is Trickmania United. Released in 2008. But if you're gonna pick up Trickmania, I suggest picking up Trickmania 2020, which is the new one. That's the one most people play. It's on Steam and Ubisoft and all. 14 was skipped? This is how you know I'm a speedrunner. Even my countdowns are faster than most people's. Corruption, Horse Girth, Splinter, Vasifus, and Jip. Thank you guys all. Oh, this is beautiful. I just want a PB. Hup. Rally car when? Waiting. There's a literal big green timer on screen. It's gonna be out in five minutes and we PB, huge PB, minus half a second. 14K points. Okay. Yes, okay. I don't know if you guys knew this, but the, the joystick can also twist these ways. Do you see this? I could bind this to some other form of steering, but I haven't done it yet. But I wonder if I could have, like, digital input that way. I found out recently. That's a ban? It's- it's not- it's- I'm- I'm competing with the top of the- top of the line device for this environment. And Nadeo has allowed it. It's not bannable. Ow. How can a timer be bugged? 412 got skipped. Guys, 311 right now? Looking kind of tough. Three eleven is gonna get skipped too. <laughs> Poor timer. Oh, that's a good break tap. Okay, I'm understanding this more. No, so I need to... I need to dodge all the mountains. Rip. Now 210. When are you going to fix your nails? I vote for purple nail polish. Joel. I think I'm just gonna... I mean, I could ask my sister if she has, like, nail polish remover. But I think I'm just gonna let these, uh... Slowly chip away until they become normal. Ah, uh, okay. Th this is so, um... Something we're not getting into now, but... For this mountain, uh, th this mound, sorry, this ledge, you gotta hit it on the right side. If I hit it on the left side, I think I always get this weird tilt. Uh, two minutes though, we can try to PB. One last time. Oh, Combined this is Cam 1? To activate action keys. 
Wait, Cam 1 in this game is so far. Why is it so, like, heli helicopter? So excited for the new update. This is wild. This checkpoint sound effect is killing me. It sounds like Age of Empires 1. <laughs> the drums? Bada ba. Bada ba. Tona said they fixed it and it's in the same camera? Okay. Disable. Guys, last one. One last one. And then the update is going live in just one minute. Uh, effectively. Still gotta download the update and, and hop in and stuff, but then we will be trying. I think I'll be discovering it on the joystick. I think I'll be playing it on the joystick. 109. <laughs> just full skip. Okay, okay. Let's get in game. Guys, it's been a long time coming, but in one minute, the rally car is finally here. We're going to discover 25 maps that they've built to demonstrate what the physics are like with the new rally car. It uh, has been polished. There's some differences on ice and plastic and stuff like that. But the car was released for the first time 20 years ago. It's being brought back today. I hope you guys are ex excited as I am to check this out. I'm going to set up a timer and everything. Uh, and then we'll see how this plays. You'd make a real pretty girl? Thank you, Duncan. I appreciate that. If Trekmania ever dies, I'll just pull a Finster. I'll ask Finster for a collab. That's my backup plan. Three, two, one. And the update's here. That was just for the video. We still gotta wait one minute. Sorry about that. Um, cut and then nice. Still gotta wait one minute. Just had to say that for the bit. Yeah. This is how this we is how you make videos, to guys. See how the rally car is in TM two thousand and twenty. <laughs> this is how you make YouTube videos. It's not a pretty process, but it's just how it's just how it is. Okay. Ready when you are, Trekmania. Ready when you are. Unfollow, he's a scammer. Not a scammer. 1559, gotta restart my game. There should be a game update. Mix. Thank you for the five gifted subs. Okay, four shutdown. Restart Ubisoft and everything, and hopefully there's an update, and then we can get in. Take a look at how this works. Yes, one moment. So 25 maps, plus a couple today today on Rally Car. Plus the snow car landing bug update, plus action key update. Like, there's so many things to, to check out. There's so many things to check out. Okay, game's booting. How late is couple of the day? Couple of the day will be in three hours. Guys, I'm gonna start the timer now. Let us get in. 21 months on rally car release day. Does I mean, we... make me a rally car? Okay, wait, we gotta get a good run here. We're only doing this run once, it's a no reset, we gotta start a timer when we boot the campaign. Mute the alerts. You know what, Buckley? Because I appreciate you so much, uh, yes. I will actually do that. Ooh. But that does not mean I don't appreciate you, chat. It's just Buckley, Buckley wanted this for this, okay. Six minutes for the update? Wait, did I boot before the update downloaded? I restarted Ubisoft. Maybe I booted it too soon. 
Because if you have like a this update is loading thing, I don't. Wait. Wait, guys. I'm gonna have to do a quick uh, game reset. Oh, we're getting in. But let's see if it's actually here now. It's two gigs? Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. I have not downloaded that. Okay, wait. I might have to. Yeah. Oh, Lord. I do want to see, though. But it's so slow. Bottom left vision? Oh, I'm on the 23... Yeah, I'm on a 2023 version. Okay. Guys, I, I thought it would just give me the update. This is the one time that I'm excited about an update and I can't even force it. Okay. Uh, manage? Wait. Sorry about the delays. Ubisoft. See if we get in now. I'm excited though. I'm really excited. Rally excited, you might say. Wait, downloading. Okay, okay, it's downloading. Okay, this is where we're at. This is where we're at. Small weight. 25%. How do I not have 100% completion? What am I missing? Complete 10 royal matches? But royal takes so long now that I'm gonna become an old man before I can complete this. <laughs> like, one, one royal game, you're like locking yourself in for life. I can't play Royal. You queue for Royal? And before you know it, before the game's done, your kids have gone to college. Like, it's wild. Okay. Let's go. We're getting in now. Update done. Update done. It's time to play Rally. Royal is a jail sentence. I think that's where we should <laughs> send. <laughs> that's where all the outcasts in society should go. Go play Royal. Repent your sins. Retrieving data. Bro, I have that achievement and I am not even playing. Yeah, no, that's 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 how it is sometimes. Ooh. It's impossible to play on keyboard. You know, a lot of like the, the so the action key change. What I would say if you're a keyboard, bind action key two or action key three. Oh, this thing again. Okay. One moment. Sometimes with this joystick. It makes me uh, stuck on this menu, but I unplugged it, so I'm going to plug it back in after we're in. We got to wait one more time. <laughs> there we go. No, oh, yes. Okay, here we are. Here we are. So play, campaigns, rally discovery. Plug in. Let's have a look, everybody, at how the rally car handles. Should I try on keyboard first, I wonder? Should I try just on keyboard? Keyboard is my device after all. I don't want to just abandon it. I think I will start on keyboard. I do also have my flight stick. I also have analog buttons to bind. But I think we'll start on keyboard and get a feeling for how the car behaves just regular. Like if you're hopping in, if you're a casual player, on keyboard, no action keys, what's it like? Oh, this is the lowest long loading screen I've ever had. Charge-moi. Les joueurs 
et chargement. Un jouet de non evitas. Non vitas. Why is it so slow? <laughs> okay, here we are. Here we are. Okay, okay. So. Okay, I don't know. Th this thing is accelerating on its own. It's living a life its own. Okay, let's try keyboard. Boom. Here we go. Keyboard. Nothing else. Just trust the old keyboard tippy taps. Okay, it feels very responsive. As expected. It feels very responsive. Oh, and... Oh, stadium car feels so slow now. But these are new blocks as well. These are very reminiscent of the old dirt blocks in Trackmania. And I'm also curious how easy the metals here are. See, that shouldn't have been an auth metal, and I agree, and I'm glad they didn't give it to me. Now, I'm gonna bind, and I'm just gonna use action key 2. For 40% steering with this car. I think that's around the sweet spot for no slides. If you're a keyboard player and you're on dirt or road, 40% steer is probably the best you're gonna get. So things like here. And I'm releasing a bit. I'm not going full speed, but the turns are already significantly better because the only way to really gain a lot of time with this car is to not slide. I like that they're like, um... There's hills on the sides of these. This is gonna be hard. It, it will be difficult. But if you can use only one or two action keys and completely solve all the problems with keyboard, then I don't think this is gonna be that bad. Yeah, like, see, this is fine. I'm, I'm driving quite fast for keyboard here. Getting good no slides. I forgot there was a rally car at the end. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> the switches. You know, this is this is one thing I'm noticing already that I feel is that these rings need to be more visible. There need to be like an on-screen warning. Changing car in three, two, one. Because if you don't see these, you're just gonna be thrown off the track like immediately from the new steering. There should be a bigger like visual you are heading for a thing. Okay. I got the off metal on it with keyboard. I do want to switch to joystick real quick and just get a, get a feeling for it. We're not just gonna rush the tracks. I'd rather like take my time and properly understand this. So I played on the joystick. This is now driven on joystick. Just want to see how this feels. Okay, that is a release. Where's my restart button here? Oh, this one. Is the discovery campaign free? No, it's not. You need the $20 a year. Because that was better. How's it like to play stadium car for me here, though? <laughs> oh, that is so weird. Oh, dude, the car changes are going to be so weird. Huh. Yeah, that's something I feel already is... is like, on keyboard, I can kind of adapt to the tapping strength because of action keys. But I'm not quite used to this yet. Better. Okay, let's go next map. Just wanted to experiment with this. Next map. That was not that good, but I was still better than my keyboard one. Back to keyboard for this map. Shorter map this time. Okay. I do already feel that to get good times, you're going to need to use action keys. N no doubt about it. At low speed, it seems to be action key three. And at higher speed, action key two. That's what I would recommend. But for turns like this, action key two, 40% steer. It's basically as sharp as you'd, you'd want to steer for the most part. Go first person. 
Oh, it's the same kind of camera as the snow car. Yeah, I really like camera one on this. Like, the distance to the car feels perfect. Okay, so that was with action keys. Let me try with, with joystick again. I'm not going to play every map on the two, but I, I do want to just see if I can feel a noticeable difference. We're not going to play every map with both devices like this for the full discovery. Just, just you know, testing out here in the beginning. And I think we're going to stick to one of them. So let me sh show you what this looks like, by the way, if you've never seen this. This is my flight stick. And I'm just trying to be very smooth with the movements. Oh, touch the grass a bit. That's not good. Okay, let's go again. You can go so inside on this turn and then cancel. Yeah, that is again better. And I mean, I, I can probably... I mean, I can get a clean run here. I don't want to get sucked, but like, I can get a, a cleaner run. Wait. One more run. Like, one more with just a clean nose slide up the hill. This last turn. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> it's still a PB. Okay, we'll come back to this map. I like this map. It's a very simple map to, like, discover the, the device on. Let's go next. Also, for people asking about the painted nails, I painted them with my friends when I was in uh, LA for Streamer Wars. We all got our nails done together. Oh, Sausage Rally. Okay. This is interesting. And a little hard to control, I think. Again, just using joystick. Now, okay, this is something I was super curious about. So this update, it did not just bring the rally car, it also brought the new action keys, right? And this is going to be a bit dank, but to explain how this works, basically, um, no, that's my brake button. Okay, basically, let me pull up this drawing, if I still have it. Um, I do. Wow. Amazing. Basically, the old action keys was the green line, so if you ever steered beyond 60% to the side, it would just ignore everything over 60. Now the entire range is 0 to 60 when you activate action key 3. So 60 is all the way sideways, and halfway to that is 30%. So you have a bigger analog range. I'm going to try this on this map on, on both keyboard and joystick. And after we've done all these experiments, we're just going to go through the maps. Can you go camp three? I, I tried it already. It's like an internal car thing. Oh, wait, so... Do I even want... Now I'm in action key three? And I'm wondering if I want it even like action key four, because this is suddenly very smooth. I mean, this is very smooth. Almost too smooth. Yeah, you want to go inside on this? Okay, wait. So that is altered. What if I do action key four? This is so exciting to me, though. If this makes the car more playable, that's what I want to find out. Oh, that's... Okay, wait, let's just... Okay. It's smooth. It's too smooth. <laughs> Goodbye, keyboard players. I don't know if it's that bad yet. So far, not that bad. This turn, though, on keyboard, I can see being very hard, because even on joystick, I'm sliding out. This one as well. I keep forgetting where my buttons are, guys, because I'm not used to this. <laughs> Okay, 
Can I get this full speed? Yes, look at that. This is the kind of thing that is going to be very hard to replicate on a keyboard. Just a perfect no slide, smooth, taking the sharpest curve you can that the turn allows. And of course, there's more bumps to avoid and everything, but... But yeah. Very interesting. Next map. I've given up on learning this game, I'll be a watcher. I mean, the curve is a bit steep, but I think it's just like... Oh, this is might, might be just a regular map. Okay, back to keyboard. <laughs> the curve might be a bit steep, you know? But it's also like a cool challenge if you've played the game and it's been the same for a lot of years. To uh, see if you can learn something new. Because I think, for the most part, if you want to avoid rally car and stuff, you can. And if you just want to play stadium car, there's all these new, like, castle roadblocks, like here. To experiment with as well. And this is cool. This is reminiscent of old dirt. And it has this... It's actually really well designed. Because it has this slight outside pull. Like these white edges. It's almost like driving an outside dirt line. So it helps pull you through a turn. If it didn't have that, if it was perfectly flat, this would be a lot less pleasant to play. But these blocks actually assist you in getting a clean turn. Which is nice. Plus plus for that. A short on controller, yes. But Shorty has a lot of good records already. I wonder if he, um... Because Shorty is part of the Alpha Testers. So I do wonder if uh, he's already played these before. Like, before these came out publicly now. Or he might just be, like, instantly picking things up. This is just regular keyboard, by the way. What I'm driving right now. He did? Okay, okay. Yeah. Ooh, small reactor. Okay, that was first try author metal. So if you're playing this and going for the authors, they might not be too hard. Wait, so... On wood. Like, this car does not lose that much speed right now. Like, it doesn't slide as easily. You cannot slide on wood. That's the thing, so it will start tilting on wood. You see this? But the car will never slide. That I actually do like a lot. And maybe this is something that should be done in mapping more. The car really struggles to slide on wood, and that's good. I'm going back to joystick. <laughs> this is a little confusing to keep up with. But, uh... Maybe, maybe Buckley or whoever edits this can let you guys know what I'm playing for each map. Each run. That could be cool. Okay, so that, I want to improve. Because then I have speed for the end, yeah. Oh, and no landing bugs. Can you roll the car if you turn too tight? There is a clip from the trailer where that exactly happens later on. Like, exactly that happens. So, I do think we'll see that. That the car can over tilt. Oh, yeah, like, can you see? I can see that turn. I want to try to get a smooth no slide through it. So far, just trying to not tilt the car too much, getting all the speed I can. Although it is questionable if you can keep it all. That's what I'm wondering. But yeah, very smooth, honestly. Like, that's the thing, with, with... With analog steering, this car feels very good. I do think so. I, 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 on keyboard, so far, I have a little mixed opinions. But with, um... Analog steering, it feels really good to play. Can I keep that? Maybe. Let's go to uh, the next map. We can uh, we can try this more later. Yo, chat. What is this car? This is the new rally car. 
And this entire campaign is basically made to discover the rally car and the blocks that was released with it. So these blocks are all new. The rally car is all new. Ooh. Big break tap necessary there. Same here. This is a really technical dirt map. It might be the case that all these rally dirt maps are going to be very technical. And just, just from what I know now, this is a map I struggle to see keyboard being competitive on. Like, in a couple of weeks, I don't know what the top keyboard time here will be, but... I think the top analog time will be faster. Because of how no slides work. But uh, a good strategy for trying to get good times on, on maps like this is slow down a lot before the turn, so much so that you can no slide through the turn. Uh, and then do that all the way. I'm not used to this type of driving. So it's a little awkward for me to try, but that's what I've seen the top players do in older Trackmania rally stuff. Did you get an ultimate here? Nice map. Is there a new surface? No new surfaces. But we have seen, this is plastic, and we have seen the rally car acts a little different on plastic. Oh, so I wonder, I'm gonna go back to keyboard. I wonder if this is built to showcase the differences between Trek, like regular plastic, and now you go, no. Or? Okay, just rally on sand. Rally the car. These are new blocks too, these uh, roadblocks. This map honestly didn't teach me much. I have not learned much from this. Maybe that's okay. Can you show inputs? Uh, I can show the keyboard inputs, but I keep switching so much back and forth. That there's not much... Um, they're not going to always be accurate. And I haven't updated Open Planet, so dashboard doesn't work. Because I just wanted to get in. So yeah. Ooh. Another Rothmall. Let's go next. 4 p.m. is how much longer from now, chat? This is the campaign. You're, you're seeing it right now. These are the new rally blocks and rally driving 4 p.m. is already here so you've shown up at the perfect time Ooh. oh this map feels again to me like joystick abuse or analog steering abuse oh and that turn I'm interested in looking at This should not be an ultimate. Okay, I like the level of these so far. You need a somewhat clean run, but you don't need to be a rally god to get the ultimates. Which is good. You can get the ultimates in this campaign without being Roa and Sander and Granati. If you just want to get the ultimates and then get out. But I wanted to see this turn over here again, because this one... I'm not sure if you want to take it that high on the wall. I don't think you do. There is no bug slide? No. The only cars that can bug slide are... Trekmania... Uh, uh, stadium. <laughs> stadium... Bay Island, and I think there's one more. But those three primarily. Let's 
So I think you want to break and then try to get the uh, the full road. Or maybe you cut on the inside, actually. Oh, that seems a lot more natural. So you can see just how slippery this is, but here... I wonder if you just go here and then try to get this. Maybe that still cuts too much and loses too much speed. Oh, yeah, I'm sliding all over the place. I'll have to figure it out later, but that is another off melt. Next map. Curious to see plastic. I'm curious to see ice. These are the things I'm looking forward to. The most. This almost looks like those uh, rally maps in the old game. Like very reminiscent of the style with just dirt roads curving in this way. Could actually be a remake, but I do not know the United campaign well enough. This should be first try Othermel. This should be. Oh, it's not. Okay. You need a cleaner run. So here, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so <laughs> out of control on this. No. Is this ultimate? I thought we were close. This probably isn't it either. No. You just play this? No, this is not the same map. If it is, then that's crazy. It's similar. It is C1? No, I mean... No, it's not the same. It has a lot of similar features, but it's not the exact same. It's It almost looks like it's based on it, though. Look at the map name. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay, so we did play this today. Wait, that's crazy. But it's not it's not the same type of turn like the turns are a little different. It's uh it's Close enough, though. What is this one called, then? Two laps, two cars. Ooh. I'm also not going to play against the ghost. So, am I going to drive this on joystick? Let's try. I don't think I'm that good with stadium car on joystick. Oh, my. The car has no turning ability. Like, I have to force it. Guys, I can't. I can't. I'm gonna go back to keyboard. <laughs> I cannot. Okay. Cowards, give us Rally 08. Could be fun. Bump the in-game audio bit. You're finding that Action Key 3 works best? I think it's either Action Key 2 or 3. Depending on the speed. Maybe even Action Key 1 at certain times. Okay... Ooh. I just want to see it with the rally car. This is really not fast enough, but here we go. So you probably have to... Oh, no, this was... The thing about the action key stuff is it's... It's very hard to know which action key you're in. And so you can very easily get confused. 
Like, you tap it twice, and then it's like, oh, now I'm in full steer, now I crash. This map is definitely the hardest one yet. Definitely. But it's still a cool map. Jump up here. Sharp turn to the left, up. On this ledge thing. And then here. Oh. Okay. Action key three. This is something I'm gonna have to get used to because it's a playlist. Optimally, I think I want to do both laps on joystick. But I'm not going to try to get used to that now during the discovery. Here, I wouldn't mind if you can get the author medal with two crashes. People shy. I would not mind if you could drive a 58 and get author medal. But I doubt it. Yeah, I did doubt it. Can you air brake with this car? No. But you can do a left right. Which does stop rotation the same way. If you spam left and right in the air, it stops the car from pitching down. So you can effectively get an air brake. We have to beat the ultimate on this map, you just gotta be very careful in this turn. Crashing in the uphill there really destroys your speed for the next lap. And then you gotta be very careful in this turn. Slow down a bit. Then the next ones are quite doable. Action key three to your keyboard. Tippy tops. Always slow down before the corners. Oh. Or else you'll fly out at the exit of them. And then I could get a 55 here. Okay. What's the author time? I uh, don't know. We'll, we'll find out. I think it's probably around 55. 56, as that's what uh, a clean one is, and would be on par with the standard we've seen so far. But yeah, every time there's a new update, you also have to update Open Planet to see all the author medals and stuff. And I did not do that, I just went in game. <laughs> so we don't have any uh, metal plugin. I don't think. Maybe it does work, I'm not sure. Since I just noticed my speedometer works, and map rank. That's oh, a 57? Okay, that's quite leaning, actually. That is better than I thought. Uh, already, though? Huh. I'm noticing some weird slowdowns in the start of those dirt blocks. I wonder if it's because I'm hitting the hill, and the hill has, like, a different acceleration. But that is interesting to me. And I can- I- I'm- I'm betting that Couple of the Day will feature some blocks like this. Couple of the Day today will be wild, guys. I haven't played Couple of the Day in over a week, or maybe in two now. And this is gonna be my first one back. Probably with the rally car, probably with these blocks. Yeah, if you drive clean, you can take these last corners somewhat safe. And you're still gonna get the medal. 55. Next one. It'll very likely be the rally car, yeah. Bobsleigh rally. Is this gonna save Bobsleigh? What's going on here? Okay, so driving straight. Also ice, by the way. Is it like the snow car? This is the first thing I want to see, if it's like the snow car at all. No. So the snow car thrives sideways, this one looks like it doesn't. Yeah, this one just wanna be, uh, be straight. With the wall. You wanna steer at all? Maybe. But this feels clean though. Pop an action key, action key one or two. And this feels quite smooth. It, it has more control than regular ice. I can actually, with this, see 
ice rally ice full speed being a style because the problem with um the, the problem with the regular ice full speed maps is that is that you don't have enough control but now you might you might just now does it ice slide it does not but you can steer sideways to effectively ice slide I guess you can call that an ice slide. There's a there's a later map that probably shows it. That we saw in the trailer. But on this map it's just about clean lines. Wait, so what do I do when I'm like going down this? How do I um prevent this from happening? Oh you might yeah, when you put the car sideways, it actually goes that way. And it looks like steering in these just loses you time. Like the best you can do is just not steer. With reactor 2? I think so. Yeah, you have to get a small, like, uh, sideways thing like that. Oh, I lost speed. This might be enough for author though. Yes, it is. Rally. <laughs> okay. Rally and Bob's like rally. Map. What was this? Dirt 2024. I think it's like map 15 or so. Could also just be map 11. I have lost track of how far in we are. So this is just a regular dirt map. Uh-huh. Regular dirt map, new blocks. Okay. Yeah, I mean, dirt now is going to be honestly higher skill ceiling. Higher skill ceiling and a lot more difficult. Because you can no slide all over the place in these. You can take ex extreme risks with inside lines around these castle walls. It feels a little like older. Which is a plus plus for me. I think dirt in TM 2020 feels a little repetitive with only outside lines. So if a map that is dirt now has like a little bit of both, I think that's a sweet spot. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, that's not even an author. Seems crazy that a rally car is not supposed to drift. Yeah, it's not really beneficial on, uh, on most surfaces. No, it's not even that um, I'm doing... It. It's not the blocks, it's just that eating a gear at, on these blocks costs more speed, I feel like, than on regular blocks. Like, somehow the grip is a little different. Could also just be uh, brain rot from playing Rally now. But there's a part of my brain that says the grip on these is different. Gotta keep gear three through there. Do quantum slides still exist? They do. But that's what I was gonna bring up is that I don't know if you can actually do them that easily on these blocks. Very curious to see top lines on maps like these over the next days. And then we gotta test, you know, landing bugs. We gotta test snow car update. A lot of things to try. Still not author time. The Ewok thing from Prime. Yeah, this is a strong author time. Nadeo 
have uh, <laughs> delivered a big challenge on this map. Oh yeah, no, that's that's tough. The turns come at you so quickly here. Like it, it really takes some getting used to just how sharp the turns are. I keep bringing it up, but it's like really aggressive turns. Like this one. This is barely off an all pace. Yeah, that beat the ultimate by a tenth. It's a point six here. Thirty four point six. If you're going for this one. Let's also see how far we've gotten. Yeah, that was map twelve. So we're halfway. How different is the handling on the rally compared to the snow car? I'd say it's like 50% more sensitive to your input. Oh, this is wet tires rally. Okay. I mean, it's going to slide all over. <laughs> this is another uh, joystick map, I'm pretty sure. And the player you see in rank one here, Hawk, is a player you might see a lot more. Uh, rank one because he's one of the best rally players Hawk and Nico might be players you're not too familiar with from before but if these guys now start playing this game you're gonna see them on a lot of leaderboards on rally car maps so I'm going back to joystick here let me actually see if I can pull up dashboard I can okay, guys look at how, look at how much I'm steering It starts sliding at around 30%. Wait, what's my brake button? Oh, this one, okay. Like, it's so sensitive to your input. Heck. Almost a clean turn there. This is probably not after time. Wood wiggles with rally car? I mean, the wood wiggles are not faster with snow car. And it didn't seem faster earlier on either with rally car. But it does wobble. Car does wobble. There's that, even though it doesn't gain speed. Okay, so wide setup, and then I don't know if you want to drift a bit in these, or if you just try to keep full grip. I feel like I'm. What is a good analogy for this? I feel like I'm trying to balance on a tightrope with the steering. And if you ever just go a little bit too much to the side, you lose your balance. Like, it's such a precise uh, environment. I'm using a uh, flight stick right now. I'm keep uh, I'm keeping switching a bit between the two, just to see what I prefer. So far, I'm very much so more comfortable with the flight stick for the rally car, but it's hard to switch between these in, in a run. Like you go from stadium car to uh, to to rally car, it's very hard to do both in the same run. 
Yeah, I mean, I can probably do a 30 here with some practice, but that should be out there. Next map. Whether they keep adding rally car or keep adding new cars, it's to provide new content, new uh, new experiences, and I think it's kind of cool. I don't think it's necessarily bad. I just think if you add something like this, you also need to give players tools to deal with them because it is really difficult. And they have added stuff for analog players now, but keyboard will still have the same five action keys. I think that might not be enough. We'll see. This turn is insane, though. I mean, this... <laughs> you have to slow down so much. Okay, so you do want to drift this, I think, and then... Yeah, so now we see, like, the type of crazy maps you can get with this. Where the cars just keep switching back and forth. I think that's what this one wants to demonstrate. Snow car. Hello. Rally car, hello. Hello, nice to meet you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I mean, there was like eight car switches on this map. Okay. Does the track edge provide an extra grip? No, it's still dirt. On those blocks. I mean, cool. Honestly, cool. Cool map. No complaints for me. But the learning curve is... Whew. Very steep. Okay, I survived. That's all I'm after here. So rally through here. And the thing is, is like, we saw this with the, um, with the Snow Discovery campaign. Something very important to remember is that these maps tend to just show off what's possible, but the community often finds like better ways to build things. For example, in the Snow Discovery campaign, there was a lot of like snow car, no slides on dirt. And the community eventually realized like, okay, snow car is fun, but this is not where it's most playable and most approachable. So there's not that many snow car, dirt, no slide maps outside of the um, snow discovery campaign. People will probably end up building maps and the maps you see in couple of the day and stuff that are more, uh, you know, more approachable. These are just like all over the place. <laughs> so yeah, snow car full speed. No, uh, rally car full speed. Okay. I vibe with this so far. Holy. I'm not making that. <laughs> this is so hard. What's the map called? Deep East? I think a reference to Deep Fear. Your issue is that Rally and Snowcar seem to be so similar, it's all about no sliding. They are different. They are uh, quite different in how they, they handle. But uh, no sliding is a thing that's kind of prevalent in all the old Strike Mania cars. But they start sliding at different points and at different speeds and with different inputs. This author time? I doubt it. It is not. So that grass part is very important. The uphill one. Need to go up earlier there too. Oh. These new cars suck, it made me quit the game. It's been like 40 minutes since the update. 
It's been 40 minutes. I think that's too early to call it. Like, you know. Th there's still gonna be regular maps. And these cars take time to learn as well. I think yeah, everyone should give them a try. I mean, keyboard or analog, whatever. Do give it a try. Might not be your cup of tea. I don't know if it's gonna be mine. But, uh, <laughs> but you know. Maybe give it a week. If you don't like this, there's always Nations Forever. Trackmania Nations Forever will not betray you. Some people haven't fully learned the first card, that is true. And that is something I think a lot of old old players and longtime players should remember. When they say things like, yeah, just learn the car. Like, a lot of people find the stadium car to be too responsive. And just crash every wall with the stadium car. If that's you, then that's okay. But people are like, damn, you just gotta play the rally car and you'll learn it. And people are struggling to control the stadium car. Which, by all means, is an easier car. How long the virtual hate ice? About half a year. Half a year to a year. After this game came out, I hated ice and just refused to play ice maps. And then... After that, I spent a couple of months learning it, and then I won an ice couple today. In 2022. Things are learnable, even that the things you dislike. But it does take time. How long until a couple of days? Two full hours. And I remember in the beginning, I hated ice on a misguided belief that it was worse on keyboard. And it actually turned out to be better on keyboard. I am always behind the start. And then here, now I need to get this like tiny, tiny. I mean, that no slide up the hill is just... It's so minimal. And I want to get it smooth. I might try to uh, action key this. I think this is a prime map to uh, use the new action keys with analog input. Because it just gives you more control. You only need to steer a tiny bit everywhere. Let me, uh, let me try to bind action key 3 here. To this button. Wait. I clicked the wrong one? Yeah. Okay. Makes the next khaki more exciting? Oh, for the love of God, I so hope they're gonna separate these. No. No, we are, like, in the khaki, it, it has to be separate. You can make one khaki for all the new cars, but keep, keep khaki the way it's always ha has been. Like, that is a must. Do, do not, do, <laughs> do not add this to my khaki and to everyone else's khaki. That is a sacred, sacred ritual. Why the hell would they separate it? Because khaki has been one way since 2016. They've already separated United khaki and regular khaki. We can have snow car khaki called snackiest snacky. And then we can have rackiest racky, but but do not mix them. God, I am so bad at this loop. This is probably still author pace, so I should just continue. Guys, this turn is impossible. Oh, 
old man refuses to accept the future. Not everything needs to change because they add a new car. I think that's what people are scared about. I think that's the legitimate fear that some people have. The same people who are like, damn, I'm gonna quit the game now. Bye bye. Because they think, ah, oh, the rally car is added, so it has to be everywhere. Every day, couple of the days, gonna have five snow car transitions and three rally car changes. And they're in fact always gonna use all these new blocks that are scary. It's like, no, the game is gonna stay mostly the same, I think. But you will see these occasionally. There, it makes no sense to add it everywhere. Because at that point, you are literally going to turn a lot of people away. Ah. I am an actual skill issue here. But it's okay, because we're all learning together. We're all learning how to control this car together. And what I have realized is I need to be steering quite sharply onto the grass, but still getting the snow slide. Like this. This is what I've been chasing for like 10 minutes now. And there we go. Huge speed to the finish and the off mill. Okay. Next map. Dirt Rally. Let's take a look. Ooh. Ow. If this is just a full rally map, I am already a fan. Okay. Little hard control. We're working on it. Oh, this is so difficult. <laughs> but I think what I have to just realize is this car, you need to tap brake more than on stadium. I just have to get this into my head. You Like on stadium, you kind of expect that like if it's not a drift, you're able to get through mostly fine. But here, just like in real racing, you kind of have to tap brake a lot before a corner to make it. Else you slide. You're just too fast. Like you have to release a lot, you have to brake a lot. There's a lot of acceleration control, which is something that Trackmania doesn't really have that much of. Because, um, I mean, we don't use like like in sim racing, they use analog acceleration. Where the more you step on a pedal, the more you accelerate. Trackmania doesn't really need that, it's just go. Opinion on the car so far is good? Uh, I, I like it. And I think it's, it's fine if it exists in the game, but... Give keyboard players a little bit of an easier time controlling this somehow, and... Um... Don't put it everywhere <laughs> and then it's cool I hope the devs listen to people's feedback because I think everyone wants this game to succeed in the best capacity that the game can oh there's one more sharp turn right it's here also the song is playing and I'm crashing oh no this cannot be fast enough. Now these author medals are made to be quite strong, guys. The, the, these are tough. Let me put on... Um, speed is on. Do you believe they should separate the cars, like in United? I don't think so either, because United kind of failed for that exact reason. Like, you might not know, but... Nations Forever is free to play, right? Check me Nations Forever. And it was hugely successful in 2008. Because it was just like, oh, here's a cool, awesome racing game you can download for free and play with your friends and play online servers and play LAN parties and stuff. In Europe, it was a big success. 
but Nadeo kind of offered so much good content for free, and the content you could get by paying were things like Rally and Desert and Snow Car and stuff, which were okay, but the Stadium Car, objectively, to most people, is the most fun, the easiest to learn. So, people just didn't pay. And it cost Nadeo to almost go bankrupt in 2009-2010. And that's when they were bought up by Ubisoft. If not, Trickmania as a franchise would have probably died them if they didn't get bought by any bigger publisher. And then the first thing Ubisoft did was add something called Free Zone, where even if you played Nations Forever, the free one, every fifth round you played online, you had to wait. And paying for United got rid of that limitation. So Ubisoft was straight up just like, yeah, you're giving out too much for free and people are not paying. <laughs> and this game is unsustainable. I think it's, it's, you know... It's good that it's a little more sustainable now, but I think there's still some... things they, they got us sold. But, but back to my point, that... all that essentially caused Rally and these other environments to not be as much played. And so then, in the years that followed, like, all the World Championships and most of the big competitions were just hosted in Stadium. Because that's the car that people associated most with Trekmania. Also, again, another really good Ultimate here. These are not going to be easy to get. Because you have to learn an entirely new car, probably, and then also drive clean with the new car. I find it so hard to, right now, like, tapping brake and doing a turn at the same time is like too many processes for my brain to do at once. I want to like first slow down and then turn, but I, I, <laughs> I'm struggling. How bad is it for keyboard? Not that bad. So far. But I also want to give it a little bit of time before I... Get a get a full perspective on on what the differences are. Like I'm very curious, for example, if some of the earlier maps will have a keyboard player in like top 100, top 50. That's usually a good measure. How high up on a leaderboard can some of the best keyboard players get with just regular action keys? Is something I'm very curious to see. And if it's not close, then it's a little concerning. What is the author time? I actually don't know. I'm guessing 43 something. Oh. What's better, snow or rally? I think snow car so far. Because it's more approachable. Like, snow car slides at around 60%. Uh, on, on road and stuff. On dirt, less, but still. Uh, rally car just slides all over the place. You see, I'm steering like 30-40% and it's... It's already about to lift off in every turn. <laughs> oh, that was a bad turn. I think this is Ultimate. I'd be surprised if I have to go even faster. I do. Oh, wow. Okay. Guys, this is, uh, this is tough. Now, they all have learned their own car before publishing it. That's for sure. There are some skilled rally players at Nadeo headquarters. Ow. Yeah, this might be too slow. They use wheel. <laughs> It's a 43.2? Okay, okay. That's very doable. I think one thing I also have is like stadium car brain. Where I try to read every racing line as if I'm in the stadium car. 
So a good example of this is like these hills. You actually want to be more on the inside. But on stadium car, that just feels wrong. That feels like you're committing a sin. But in this car, it makes way more sense to do that. Oh, the speed is terrible. Okay. What track am I on? This is a uh, red track, so one of the... Last 10 at least. I think it's maybe like 16, 17. But we're not trying to speed run the discovery. I kind of want to take my time with with each map. And get get a feeling for how this car works. As so we go through each map. Oh yes, if I break a little bit more there, like a tiny bit more. Wow, yeah, if I break a tiny bit more, that turn, I can gain like half a second. Really fascinating. <laughs> We're getting like ankle. Why is that? Oh, we did this. Guys, last stream we were trolling with the timer. I cropped the one hour mark to make it seem like I was going quicker than I was. One moment. Sorry about that. <laughs> we got stuck on a map for about an hour and then we just removed the one. There we go. It's back. Okay. No worries. <laughs> playing controller? No, I'm playing joystick. That's what I'm trying to learn uh, for this car. And for the snow car. It's like if there's a campaign map with the snow car or the rally car, I can control it using this. i show you. This is what I'm playing with. It's a flight, flight simulator joystick. I'm just trying to smoothly turn to get these no slides. But uh, it's a little not used to it yet. Might need to fully commit to it more. But it does work out quite well for this car. Yes, brake more. Oh, look at that. This is exactly what I wanted. No. Oh, please be a point three or whatever. Point two. We got there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, awesome. <laughs> Oof. Okay. This is a tough card to control. Got this map done. Wh where are we? Yeah, map 17 now. Yeah, the reason I want to try to learn flight stick and not controller is that... Um... When you do it with a joystick, you control it with your entire dominant hand versus your left thumb. And for me, I think I'll have better control that way. Is keyboard officially dead? No. No funeral yet. But, um... But I am interested to see over the next days what the top keyboard times will be on different maps. I mean, am I ever gonna get used to this? This is so weird. Oh, not so slippery. Okay. I'm just wondering if I'm ever going to be able to get used to, um... To stadium car with joystick. This is honestly weirder than controlling the rally car, any input device. <laughs> this is very awkward, the steering. And I might have to if I'm going to use it proficiently with maps that have car switches and stuff. Okay, we got through. That was what? Gold. This other metal might be a bit easier. Does look that way. Do you have a lot of practice with the joystick? Uh, no. Only started playing joystick... Like, two weeks ago? So I'm not quite used to it yet. Oh, but this is good. That's good, no slide. And then here... Just full sideways. Okay, that's a bit too much. Wait, can I respawn? No. Why flight stick over analog keyboard? Not decided on that yet, either. I could use analog keyboard. But, um... I mean, should I try that? 
Maybe we'll try that for this map. With the new action key status. So... I want to have... Do I have them all bound? Yeah, I'm thinking. Yeah, I think I do. Wait, so... This is regular taps, and now... If I do this... Wait. No, but these are old. Like, this is definitely old action key. Look. If I press zero here... Let's do... Uh... 20% even. I have it bound. Do I have it? Now this is... Do I have 20%? Yeah, look. I don't know if you can see this. But I'm barely pressing it and it hits 20. And I can still press it more. So the action key change is not in effect yet. Because it hits 20 and I can still go further. You see that? It hits 20 here and look at my finger. I can still go a lot further. Oh, it's because I'm stadium car. False alarm. Okay. All right. No, that that is weird though. But okay, false alarm. So now, wait. Now I'm still. Now I'm using. I mean, okay. Now I'm using regular. Actually, what is? <laughs> but this is this is gonna be more confusing. No. It doesn't apply to regular stadium car. Only the the rally car. I think they did it that way to keep stadium car or stadium mostly the same, mostly unaffected by these changes. Yeah, so... Yeah, so now it's... Wow. Okay, I need to be on alert. Let's try this turn. So here, new action key, break. I mean, maybe? I think what I see myself doing is, if a map has like... Majority stadium car parts and there's like one rally car turn. I'll analog keyboard that. But it feels a lot more jank than um, than just using a joystick. Can tell you that already. Oh, the trigram has changed from ver to PB. I just saw that now. You're right. On my PB goes, the trigram is PB. That's actually a cool change. Good spot. So you don't want to turn the rally car too much sideways on ice or it doesn't give you this uh, nice angle. Also something to note. Oh, and then break here, okay. I mean, that might almost be a wall bang. So we're doing this one on keyboard. Even if it's a bit weird. <laughs> Just to get used to uh, the alternative here. Does anyone know what time we need to beat the author time? Forty-two seven. Very acceptable pace requirement. Because in this turn here, there's a lot. And then here, and a break. Okay, still in a second. And yeah, the thing about using a thumb and stuff, that's only my preference. Most of you guys might be completely fine playing a controller. But I've just never liked uh, trying to steer precisely on a controller. Just gotta find what works for you, you know? Some people prefer mouse, some people prefer joystick. Whatever works for you is what you should roll with. Top 3 is nuts, sub 42, yeah. And they're picking it up so quickly. 
Like, they probably all only spent a few minutes on this map. And then went next to discover the rest of the campaign. But players like Nico have many, many years of, of rally car experience that we're now only starting to try to catch up to, so... We will be a bit behind, that's okay. As long as we're learning, as long as you get better every day, that's what matters. That's close. I think I'm like a few hundredths behind it. I think I am the fastest person who doesn't have the Altermel. What cars are still left? So they are definitely adding the Desert car. Which is also from Trekmania Original 2003. I missed it by a hundredth, okay. They're definitely adding Desert and they are maybe adding more cars in the future. Though I will say at that point, I think it's getting crowded. I think you can have too many cars in the game. Where to a new player, it just feels insurmountable to learn it all. I'd somehow almost like if the cars were seasonal. So like you could have the desert car for a few months and then maybe, oh, let's add this canyon car. Instead of them all being permanent because I feel you can quickly get to a spot where it's just too many. Also guys, thank you for the primes, garlic, dead, and the pedestrian. I have alerts muted for the discovery. Thank you. Map creation could get wonky. True. True, true, true. Trackmania is getting crazy complex, because think about it. If you add one new car, it's not just that you're adding, like, one new thing to learn. You're adding the new car and all its intricacies. So, the new car with wet wheels, the new car on ice, the new car on grass, the new car on plastic. You're adding all these interactions. Okay, you're playing a map and you're going from stadium car to rally car. How does that affect your lines? You know, like... There's so many intricacies to pay attention to if you just add one car. And if you then add, like, four... There are so many variables... ...that the game can quickly just become, like, completely overwhelming. Oh, the gears on these dirt blocks are weird. I do not know what it is yet. But there is something about the geometry of these new dirt blocks that with the stadium car, they feel really weird. Like, why did I lose my gear here? I do not know. I landed with 209 speed. You can keep gear 4 with over 200. Ice slides are on map 19? Yeah, I'm getting there soon. Soon we'll be there. Yo, thank you for the one year! Went by fast, it did. This is a good start. Oh my god. See, I don't understand it. Something is up. But the best Trekmania scientists will figure this out in the next days. Just gotta be a bit patient. Forty-two seven. Yeah, I know we're one hundredth off. It's a forty-two seventy-three the author time on this map. 
That should never gear three. Have you guys also felt this? That the dirt blocks are a little weird? Have you guys also felt this? If you're playing. Like there's something slight there's something more slidey about them. And it causes weird gear changes and weird speed losses with gears. Like it's a more slippery type of dirt. It's it's not the same soil. GeoGuessr players can differentiate between, you know, Brazilian dirt and this is the same thing. This is like rally dirt versus regular dirt. Ow. Okay. It's Mongolian dirt. That is a good ice thing. And then... I just dropped my gear and lost... So much time. We are free! Oh my god, okay. I think I'm gonna go back to controller or analog input. Keyboard was exceptionally difficult. That was just done with regular action keys. But that was, that was stressful. That was not that enjoyable. Okay, so I think this map 18. Okay. Wet. Underwater. Plastic. Rally. Rally Atlantis. This turn, I have to break so much. Guaranteed. Yeah. I like how the car sinks. One thing that's super annoying about stadium car with pools is that it always tries to float. It'd be a lot better if the car just sunk. Like this one. Because I don't think it can water bounce. So you're never going to get these weird water bounces, hopefully. No jinx. Like look, it just plop. And it's very satisfying. Dear God, last map has 63 checkpoints. <laughs> They might have uh, remade Rally E. There's a two minute long rally map in United. Could also be some oh, Trek Mini original remake. There's almost no way to prevent that slide, I don't think. Might just want to give up trying to prevent that slide. Okay, use an improvement. Okay. Gold medal. And we should be getting the author next one. Because this is a very good start. I mean, I am abusing analog input here. This is not right to keyboard. I used to be so loyal too, I was like, I'll never change. 2020 Virtual would be ashamed if he saw me right now. Committing sins against my own tribe. But I can't help but feel it is better. Is the music in-game or from Virtual? No, it's not in-game. In-game music is... is... different. Can you even hear it? 
here. There was a time in 2020 I wanted to learn controller, yes. But I quickly gave it up because I realized I didn't want to be a controller player. <laughs> Had I done it then, I probably would have learned it. Given enough time, but... Oh, you can... <gasps> You can no slide this if you steer like 15%. That is kind of disgusting. Okay. I mean, yeah. I think this is one of the most... Uh, uh, most analog abuse turns yet. What is the model of my joystick? A T16000, I think. But we should blur that name until Thrustmaster sponsors me. <laughs> they have a more expensive one, which I want to try. So Thrustmaster, if you see this, people shy. Let's let's work together. Ugh. Can you? Can you? Can you? Can you? Hmm. Hmm. You might have to slide. Yeah, it seems like just taking a little bit of a slide is better. Otherwise, you're just fighting too much with the car. Also, that is so strange. Why does the car, like, lock onto the wall like that? Like, I could not escape the wall. As much as I wanted to. 45. Still need an improvement, I think. You made an account just so you can watch the stream? That's awesome. Welcome to Twitch. Why are we listening to Trickmania's stock music? Because someone wondered what the soundtrack sounds like. And it feels a bit nostalgic when you haven't listened to it in a while. I want to try one more time to get a proper no slide through this next turn. Just like a 15% turn. Oh, that's 30. I mean, like, the... Yeah. Okay. And then now, I should be able to leave this turn if I want to. But I'm not. I'm stuck. That's a little weird. Oh, it's weird. Oh, it's weird. I don't understand. Okay. I'm not gonna try to no-slide now. I'm just gonna not fight the turns and just slide. This car wants to slide. We're gonna slide. Yeah. I want to, I want to escape. Thank you. This car almost seems to get stuck to plastic in a way. Okay. Oh, Nadeo. That's not author metal. Okay. All right. I thought I'd succeeded. I was already celebrating. How about this then? Boom. Yeah, now this is good. Oh. See, here I'm just sliding on purpose. I don't think I can prevent it. That's top five. I don't think you can prevent the slides here, guys. But Wet Rally is not going to be my favorite style, that's for sure. Couple of days isn't likely to have Rally. Oh, it's very likely to have Rally. 
that uh, they've said that both track of the day today and tomorrow will contain something with the new update. And here we have ice. Ice rally. Which also feels quite nice on analog. On joystick. This is the turn from the trailer. And then there's a right turn over here. Honestly cool. Wait, I am so slow. People have a 35? Wait, wait, wait. What? Now this feels keyboardy. Yeah, maybe this is more keyboardy. Not that keyboard gains time, but like quick steering movements. Maybe Ice Rally is uh, where keyboard at least is equal, if not um, maybe even better. Like, touching the snow even just a little bit costs you so much here. It's also something I'm seeing. Thirty-five is insane. Is this author? That's gold. Yeah, thirty-five. Is it all Tona maps? I don't know. I think the author times are all Tona. Driven. So it might make sense that it's his maps too. I mean, is there any trick? Any speed strats? Maybe where you can, you want to straighten out. But then when you're sideways, you want... ...the slide. It looks like that, yeah? Like on, on straights, you want to just... ...straighten, and then on these, you want to get the, the flick. So here, straighten. Yeah. I think that's the play. That at least feels better than what my PB currently does. There's gonna be a second ahead, and so that means in this downhill, I can gain a ton if I just straighten at some point. If I straighten now? Oh, but then I'm somehow not angled right for the next turn. Is this a new car? Yeah, this is officially in the game now. This is uh, here to stay. It's not a mod, it's officially added. And it handles quite uniquely. Do a 360, I don't think it will ever pay off <laughs> with this car. Unless you have like a very specific Circumstance that requires it. This has to be all the time because I said so. It's not. And I'm still three seconds from world record. Okay. All right. Good to know. Lots to learn. That's the way you gotta see this. If you ever feel so far behind like this, you just gotta think, Damn. I still have a lot to learn. Could still get a lot better at this. Okay. Good. Good start. 
I do want to see this world record though. I kind of wanted to wait till the end to watch all the world records, but let's see. So better no slide and then... Okay, better start. Waits very late before activating this instantly to flick. Straight line here, more speed, okay. So this is just a better strat for this map in particular. And then with that, he just has more speed, I guess. But you see the straightening? This I did pick up on. The straightening is very important. Use action key 1, 3, 4, and 5. <laughs> the future really is here. All right, Rastic, Rally Plastic. Let's see what this is. Uh, has this map been shortcut? Because Hugo is an eternity ahead of Roa. And Hugo is a really good khaki player. There's also a map from the trailer where they did this. They did this exact movement in the trailer. Let's see if that's the case here. If you want to do the same. Yeah, it's the same type of a pattern. Like you, you no slide where you can, and you do this to get through a turn. And then it's back to no slides. And then here, probably. Wait, no. A ah, wall hug. Okay, I see this. And then you go sideways. And then back to straight. Ugh. <laughs> okay, that's comical. Comical plastic bounce. What about on a wall? Same thing? Kinda? And this would be a what? A 43. Okay. Tag, thank you so much for the 22 months. No, this first turn is just a full no slide. I am not seeing things. Keyboard in 2024. Gain two seconds. Ah. Okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Just gotta give you guys an insight into what this gameplay experience is like. So with my left hand here, I am activating action key. So I'm gonna go for action key number two. Maybe with action key uh, one, sorry, you're fine. Let me see. Nope, okay, so you gotta go action key two, guys. If you're playing this on keyboard, action key two. And then it's a very simple process of just getting a no slide. One sec, one second, gotta... I think tap a little bit quicker. You see, like, if you just do this, you can actually no slide down the hill. It's not even that, that hard. See, you just do this, and then you save, like, one second. Here I slide. We don't want to slide. It's unfortunate. And then I'm wondering. Yeah, okay, so you do want to, I think, full sear through those. And then simple process here again. Tap, 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 tap. And up. And we're probably getting a silver medal for this amazing performance. It's a gold, okay. Now for comparison in the start, the joystick. Let's see which we would, would rather want to play. Instead of having to tap like a maniac, I think I can just cruise this at like 30% searing. Uh, if I get into the no slide angle.
Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, it's like it's like at 24, 25%, so it's actually not that trivial to get. Yeah, it's still better though. <laughs> but then this turn is harder. Because this kind of stuff I'm not used to. Oh, that's better. Okay. Just one sharp movement and then insta straighten. And then in these you do have to like full steer. And then I mean these are these are hard. I want to get... I just want to see the speed difference with a perfect no slide. Yeah, that is significant. Although I missed it a little bit still. And then you can flick out and yeah, you can still get even more. Okay. Yeah, now we're so much faster. Uh. Okay. Slower. I mean, it's just not close. I could not do that on keyboard. I don't think. And if I spend a week learning this, I'll be even better. Oh, it's almost holding. Just gotta get a little bit of a better angle down the hill to get more space. And then this will work. Yeah, look at this. Surgical. Ah, and then I missed. Is it really that bad on keyboard? Th this first no slide feels super difficult. I can try again. Maybe I had the wrong approach angle. But I don't know. It feels so bad. <laughs> it feels so bad. With the action key piano, you can maybe get it. Yeah, maybe you actually can. But I think I like uh, joystick better. You'd have to flick between action key 2 and 1 to get this on keyboard. Nice. Oh, this is suffering. Oh, this is suffering. That was painful. Seems quite hard to stick the car in the right, like, sideways angle a lot of the time. Don't think that was no. The no slide is definitely easier on this. Also here, just look at the speed. Like, that is gorgeous. It's just these ones that I struggle with. <laughs> Getting around these turns. Yeah. Can you only access 20% increments on keyboard? Uh, yes, you cannot go to 30%. You used to be able to, but uh, they removed five action keys. So at the start, it was 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Percent here, and then they went to 20, 40, 60, 80. Removed five of them. And a lot of people have now asked for the other action keys back because uh, that would actually make this a lot better. It's one of the simplest things Nadeo could do as well, I think, to give keyboard players some more control. 
and then you just bind the ones you want. Like, you don't have to bind all of them, even if there are 10 that exist. So I don't necessarily think that's that bad of a suggestion. Cool. I tried the rally campaign. Why does the stadium car feel so unresponsive? Is it the update or just your brain? I think part of it is your brain. But if you play the new um, dirt blocks, it does feel different. I want to see. So Hugo does get this no slide. I think he might be keyboard. This looks like keyboard taps. Is it? I think it's keyboard. Oh, this turn was so good, though. No, no slide here. Oh, and then no, like, flick at the end. Great run. Okay, we shall see. We shall see. We're on to the black tracks, guys. We've already been playing this for, like, two hours. But is this new menu music? I think it is. But we've been taking our time, checking out the maps. We've got only five maps left to check now. Let's see how these work. Uh, the records here look really close. Oh, is this the one from the trailer? I think it is. With the reactor flights and stuff. Oh, okay. This is unique. Precise rally. In between a bunch of mountains. Oh. Okay, I need to respawn this. What is going on here? It's the same kind of movement. Question is if you want to break. And no slide. Okay, let's see if we can enable the metals widget thing. This altar metal, I'm suspecting, might be a 41. It is a 41. Okay. All right, these altar metals might be tough, guys. Like, whew. Yeah, these altar metals might be really tough. 41-4 on the record right now is a 41 flat. That's, uh, that's quite strong. So you do gotta get good no slides everywhere, it looks like. If you set up wide here, maybe you get this better. Let's continue. And then here, I was thinking maybe if you go here... Huh... Ah, oh, battery spawn. Why the no slide could work. But yeah, guys, getting all awesome mouse, especially if the last map is like this level of driving in three minutes. Whew. That's gonna be tough. Let's see. Set up wide. Slow down. No, there's like no way to keep this car, um... No, so you just have to flick into the turn. It, it looks like. Oh, 44. Okay. Okay. The gold is very doable. The author metal looks messed up. That's kind of messed up. It's kind of a messed up author time. Is that allowed? Good no slide. So here I'm just gonna... I mean... Yeah, like this, right? Yeah, okay, you gain two seconds there. And then I still need another second or so from somewhere else. Let me first see if I can... I can't really gain much in the start. The start is just like a big auto-scroller. 
takes like 20 seconds to get an attempt here. Where I can gain a little bit with a perfect no slide. And then flick. Okay. But the, these author times are significantly harder than regular campaign ones. So if you're trying to go for all author melts in this campaign, do you know that you're in for a bigger challenge than the usual Nadeo campaigns? I can get half a second here. Okay, that's actually quite promising now. Then here, flick. Okay, not the greatest flick. Oof, crashed a bit. Yeah, one second behind, okay. Getting there! Especially on keyboard, yeah, maybe especially on keyboard. I wanna see if I can full speed this next turn. That would actually help a lot. If I just take a wide, smooth line here. Is this somehow faster? Not really. This was a better flick, although I crashed. <laughs> okay, intense map. We are one second behind the author time. Uh, 26th world, okay. One full second to go. No keyboard today? I I've tried a little bit, just to see what I prefer. But for maps like these, where the speed is like quite low, and despite my inexperience on joystick, I can just do smooth turns, this is so much more pleasant. I, I really prefer this. To... To keyboard. Right now. That might change though if I get used to analog keyboard more, but... Got a no slide and then one break tap and no slide this. Still lots to gain. Am I using action keys right now? No, I'm just using the default steering. So far, I feel honestly like it would ruin my muscle memory to try to <laughs> learn and focus on enabling the new action keys to change my analog range. But uh, later, I want to experiment with that. Good start. Point seven to go. Point six. Don't ask, know how necessary it is for stick or wheel since you get so much precision anyway. It's true. No, it, it is true. Like, um, the device is already really precise. And it kind of messes with my brain, as well. With all the car changers that are going on and stuff. On other maps. What we need to beat this off metal, by the way, is a flick into a really wide setup here. You want to be out here, because then this, you might be able to get a better no slide through. I'm wondering if you can full speed the end. It's almost, it's one break tap. Instead of reactor flick, slow down to keep grip will be better. I tried that and it actually doesn't seem that easy to do. So I do like the, the flick more. For now. I think it definitely has potential to beat this author time. And that's... I mean, maybe it's easier without, but that's what I'm going for right now, just getting the other time. Oh, it's point 0.3 if I don't get that little ledge. Significant. 
Okay. It's so slow, oh my god. Well, this is a, a map particularly built, I think, to showcase precision. The car can be a lot faster. There's a full speed rally map earlier in the campaign. Hey Virtual, what is new in the game? So this car, about 240 blocks. Uh, action keys have changed slightly. And the snow car, which we haven't even gotten to see that much yet, has no landing bugs anymore. I also want to check that out after a couple of the day, probably. There's plenty of things to discover today in Trekmania. Have there actually been campaign world records that have been beaten already on snow car maps? Because I don't think it will take long. I think it will take a few hours after people start hunting. Yes, 17 was beaten already? Oh my god, okay. That's funny. Yeah, that's a huge change. Oh, the slide, okay. Progress, 0.9. 08 is free now. First try and you got champion level. Okay. That's hype. Yeah, I think 14 is a map I want to try more. Because the shortcut there now without landing bugs will feel a lot better, I think. Are we already on flight stick? Yeah. Yeah, I'm doing all this with flight stick. I can show it again. This is what I'm trying to learn for the new cars. Just like a pilot going left and right, cruising through, trying to get no slides. I touched the wall, but not in a, in a bad spot. Oh, that is nice. Point two away. That was really nice. But do you see how much smoother I can be with this? I don't know if I'll try to learn this for a stadium car. Because I'm already like... Um, very content with what I can do on keyboard on stadium. But to keep up with the rally boys. Gotta learn a new instrument. Ow. How do you like new action keys? Haven't tried them much, actually. There's gonna be a long YouTube video, Rip Buckley. But think about all the people who now have like a one plus hour VOD to fall asleep to. Do you have YouTubers that upload a video like that and then you get happy? It's like, oh my god. This man just uploaded the greatest sleep aid. This is medicine. This is modern day medicine. When a YouTuber uploads like a two hour video essay with a calming voice. Or a campaign discovery, maybe. <laughs> ah. Love the nails, thank you so much. Uh, that is probably the first and only time in a while that I'm going to have my nails painted. I thought it was fun to try it. We, uh, we all did it. Me, Janik, Anna Kramling, and Annie Fuchsia when we were at the Stream Awards. So I'm just going to let the <laughs> nail polish fade over time and then uh, maybe the next Stream Awards. When is couple today? In one hour. Which, honestly, projection-wise, I'm not sure if we're gonna finish this campaign before couple today. But I don't mind. Sometimes I feel with new campaigns, it's like, oh, I beat the author medals in an hour, what do I do now? Here we have a real, real tough challenge. Nice. No. Oh, but that ghost has a good start, so this is not that bad, guys. That ghost has a really good start. Oh. 
Ooh, 4170, okay. The flick was good. I did tap break a bit too much after, and I also oversteered into that no slide. Okay, more, more on the ledge. Map 23 is sick. I'm looking forward to it. I do want to do them all in, in order, though. For as long as it's possible. What is nose slide? This is one of the most common misconceptions, and I honestly wish there was a better name. But it means uh, no slide. Not sliding. When you hear Trackmania players say this, we're saying that we want the car to not slide. It's not the nose on your face. It's no slide. And basically what it means is if you if you look at this car, if I start getting these skid marks behind the car, you see that it loses speed automatically. The rally car really thrives when you connect the skid marks at all times behind the car. So if I start like steering sharp, just these two movements, I have less speed. So that's why smooth steering on this car specifically is really overpowered. Because you you stay in the state where it's not sliding and you just gain speed. <laughs> through here too, gotta steer very smoothly to prevent this from happening. And through this next turn as well. The more you see those skid marks connected, the more speed I gain behind the car. But with rally car specifically. <laughs> A stadium car, it's sometimes opposite, where you want the skid marks a certain width apart, speed sliding. It's a uh, complex game. Are speed slides a thing on rally car? No. For most old environments, it's not. I know it's a thing on Island, one of the oldest cars. And on Canyon, it's a thing. But for most old Trickmania cars, they all have like one thing in common, and it is no sliding is king. It's the main strat to gain time everywhere. <gasps> oh, I was risking. Wait. Okay, 4146. Okay. Now I I made the right call. Look, I made the right call. I was risking so hard. It was close. 4146 no respawn. Is there reactor zoops? I don't know. We're going to check the Trekmania Reddit after I think because um Already, people have probably figured out a lot of things about this that I have not. Where do you see the time you would have had if you didn't mess up? It's a plugin. It's a plugin called No Respawn Timer in Open Planet. You can only have it on PC. No plugins on console, but yes. Reddit will be a war zone. Yeah, but you know, I also think there will be a lot of people who are like, damn, this is kind of fun, actually. Like, if you've played it, if you, not if you've just watched it, but if you've played it, on a scale of 1 to 10, how fun do you find the rally car? Fun factor. Not competitive factor, but just like, is it fun to, you know, dabble into a bit? Or do you find it straight up not fun on your device, or just in general? Because I think for most people it scores over 5. For now, you know, it might not stay fun long term, but... For now, pretty good fun factor. Honestly, it's fine after having gotten used to snow? Yeah. You have to drive 08 so differently now, it's insane. I'm, I'm looking forward to seeing it. If you think you have something cool to show, 
we can go through it all uh, later if you like found something cool on a campaign map or saw something cool with the rally car or landing bug update. I want I want to know it all, you know. But I first want to beat the campaign. I want to know what's going on. Stay in the up to date community. Oh, and then just. Just gotta not bounce so much on this. Sorry. Is that low speed? I'm only like a car length behind and it's point ton. <laughs> At such low speed. Like this is already point two. This is a crazy uh, difference. Try to come back from this map. How do you steer this car on ice? Uh, you just go sideways. If you go full sideways, 90 degrees, it starts to turn on its own. And then you just gotta stay in that angle. Oh, my PB had this turn mint. Oh, and that was almost a great turn there. Perfect start, I think, for, for what I can do. Yeah, but then I got caught up too. Okay, still really good here. Oh no. No. Down the drain. Good end though. How many points have gotten this author? I think about 25 at this point. Something around there. Oh, this is beautiful. No. Oh, that was sick. Ow. Can we see your beautiful face again? Yes. I just think it would be cool to get this with the joystick cam. But maybe we maybe we switch back for a little bit. Hello. Hello, chat. The great thing that uh, using this camera on the joystick provides is that I can just go full serial killer face. My focus face when I play is just straight up uh, murderous. If you see murderous intent in my eyes, it means I'm driving well. Like, there, there have been world action stuff I've set off stream where I've recorded my face and I have been scared of what I've seen. I have been scared of what I look like when I... <laughs> when I... <laughs> when I compete at this game. <laughs> but, uh... But hey, good times. Oh? Nah, oh, we didn't get the bump. The reason going on the ledge there is good is because you bump over a bit of grass. So you spend less time on a surface that slows you down. Why not drive with the world record ghost? Because it's more fun to discover a campaign on your own. Instead of copying world record lines usually. There will be plenty of time to hunt this against the world record stuff, but for now it's just... Just figuring things out. On my own. That's solid. 
Oh, small boost there. By going on the hill. Oh, so wide. Otherwise, like a really, really ambitious approach. Which could have worked. And then not. 48 mil to a couple of days, yeah. I think I'll play it on joystick. I'm not that consistent that joystick yet. If it has car switches though, I don't know. But I really do wanna play it on joystick. It's just like, I feel I'll get Division 5 or something <laughs> on joystick. And keyboard is maybe a safe Division 1. Ooh, beautiful. Okay. That was nice! That was really nice! We got the other mill. Still with some drifts. That was really clean. Ooh. Let's see world record. I am quite confident, by the way. I saw so many people suggest maybe you should break and slow down in that reactor turn. I'm quite confident in saying that the reactor turn is quicker. Sliding with the reactor is quicker than slowing down. Because you just flick out of it instantly into a no slide. Oh, he just slides here and that looks good. And then he gets this boost that I noticed. Yeah. And now the flick. No. No, really? That is interesting. Is it faster? I mean, the setup you get with with what I did was so good though. Huh. Ooh, I mean that no slide is hot. Yeah, mine wasn't perfect, but look. This turn is still better than what he can get with his line. I wouldn't be so sure this is slower, guys. I would not be so sure. Uh, it, it's not by much. Because you still have a better setup for the next turn. But okay. Second black map. Mixed stage. Uh, that is worrying already. Because <laughs> if it's mixed, that means car switches and it means chaos. But okay. Up here. Again, another ridiculous author time, I gotta say, but it's fine. We're, we're here to learn. So no steering in the bobsleigh. Yeah, I see I see tires work the same. They do make you slide out. And then what's here? Wood again means... Honestly, wood with rally car is the most satisfying thing so far. It's like you have a little bit of a shield and the slide out area is only around like 60% steering. Oh, I thought this was a hug. It was not. This is a hug though. Okay. Cool map. We get silver. I'm using the flight stick. <laughs> It's gonna be my new input device for, for this car if I can learn it. If not, I'll stick to action keys. And I think for stuff like couple of the day and stuff, if they just add back 10 action keys, so like you have all 10 instead of five, then keyboard will be perfectly fine. But I think right now it's just a little worse. Go high there to prevent that. Don't slide here. Small slide here is maybe okay. I mean, this turn looks difficult, and it is. 
Oh, wow. Still two seconds. And I'm top 37. Still two seconds, guys. Like, come on. This is insane. That looked good. Like, I didn't, I didn't have that many slide outs. I think maybe there's time to gain here by cutting across a bit. And more speed through here. Like, that's a second. On to the next one. But now here. How was this? 0.8 still, okay. Ow. Yeah, if I can get that with a lot more speed. But this is a suspicious author time because it's 55 flat. Did Tona actually drive 55 flat or was it just put like this? Is this just a modified author time? A little suspicious. Oh, this is good. Yeah, there's going to be a second ahead. getting caught up to <laughs> I, I don't understand where I'm losing two seconds yet even three to the world record basically 2.8 or 2.7 so far it's so unbelievably far but a little bit of time Small improvements, and we'll see how far we get. Wide setup here for more speed. Yes. I accidentally released here. Can you wall bang this? No. <laughs> okay. Also, are we getting tired of the original soundtrack yet? Because I am. I want upbeat Kirby music to cure your sadness. Beautiful. I am happy now. I was sad thinking this map would take me 30 minutes, but now... I can listen to 30 minutes of Kirby. Playing my favorite racing game. In its new form. It's different than the game I fell in love with, but it's... Uh, the soul of Trikemania is still... Is still here. Okay, so we got a... That's good. And then I gotta carry it. And then I got. Uh, okay. Yes. Oh, that was such a bad underwater part. 56.2 or 3. Okay. Progress. Speed split's not working. It's uh, it needs to be updated, I think, for the new patch. It's okay to be slower here because we still need to get downhill good, and then I'll oh, push here. Almost. Guys, this is fast, I think. Maybe I can still gain a little bit more in the start, though. That felt good. No. 
Because then I can see, like, that would be 55 mid pace with a good end. And so I just need a little bit more. Oh, beautiful. Here, just left, and then slow, and right. Now carry it. Ah, oh, we went into the barrier. Okay, close. You double dog dare me to get this AT? Now I have to do it. I was already gonna do it, but a double dog there is a serious bet. Can't turn down this challenge. Minus 40. Everyone relax. That's the only way to drive this car. To be a sensei. Mania Sunset, you just gotta be so smooth. Good speed. No! Okay. Like, you actually just have to be... You have to find your inner self with the rally car. Just breathe. Breathe and sear. Smooth. Hard author time, people still crushed it. That's the thing with hard author times. It's that, especially on a map like this. Like, for example, my, my map in the streamer campaign. I put my author time at a pace that is now 1.4 seconds behind the world record. And still only like 20 people got the author time out of 10,000 players. And I thought I was making it easier. But if, if a map is very technical to begin with, then getting pace within one second of world record is super hard. So what about this? How much is the speed gonna matter? Because we're equal? Oh no. Death. And then virtually got this run. Switch play, think of the two dollars. You're better breaking than trying to drift in corners and rally? Yes. The greatest sin you can commit is to slide. So uh, for, for the most part. There are exceptions to every rule. But the main thing you should always look for to gain time is steer smooth and prevent the car from sliding. Like here, if you can get this downhill and then this uphill without sliding, you're gonna gain a lot of time. And this next corner as well, we have icy tires, so we gotta go wide, slow down, and just just like a like a breeze, like a wind. Just a gust of wind through the turn. I slowed down too much. Oh no. Okay, so there I just played badly. Flow like water, move like the wind. What an ending. Okay guys, this is gonna actually be a lot easier than I thought. That's weird because drifting is a rally thing to do. It really is. It really is. Like, Rally looks insanely cool in real life when they drift through a dirt turn at like 200 kilometers an hour. It's absolutely mental to watch, right? So it's a little weird that it's played opposite to real life Rally. Is that water? Yes. Energy water to get us through this. But this is how the rally car has been. 
Uh, and Trike Mania. I think Nadeo would, uh... Wouldn't mind if drifting on dirt was faster, but... This is just how the, the physics of the car is. And they didn't want to change it for the release of this game. Or, it's release in this game. They wanted to keep the original feeling to celebrate 20 years. And I kind of thought about it, like... Um... These are the very first cars in Trackmania. And so like, okay, you could give them a modern gameplay feel, which they have done to a certain degree, with things like ice and how this acts and wood and stuff. But I also don't think you would want to change it much. Like, if you made this car 20 years ago, you have a lot of nostalgia attached to it. Like, this is where your game studio started, you know? This is where you, uh... This is your humble beginnings. And so you look back at this car and you think, damn, okay, it is a bit wonky, but we got a lot better. Like, for me, it would be like going back and revisiting some of the first videos I made, and I don't think I would do them, like, want to remake a video and do it very differently. So my first ones. on the same topic. Need to gain here? Yeah, if you push that, I mean, that's what they're doing so well, I think. They just dare to push that turn. With a good start, before. Did they update the snow car hitbox? Uh, yes. So we're gonna experiment with that later. As well. Scrappy the 53.5? Okay, that's nice. It's a nice time. Would you not revisit an old video after 5-10 years if the world record history progressed massively? I think there's just so many more topics to cover though. Like, people often say like, oh, virtual. You made a 20 minute video about AO7, and now it got beaten by 100th. You should make a new video about this. And like, what would I do? Tell the same story, but add one record? You know, it's like, I kind of prefer making videos, at least for now, about stuff I haven't covered yet. There's no, there's no shortage of stories to tell. But maybe if there's like huge discoveries that, you know, are interesting to talk about. Oh no. This was so beautiful. Maybe? Yes! One more in the bank, three left to go. Whew. No slide heaven. Let's go next map. And guys, we still have 16 minutes left of Kirby music. Life's great. Oh, snow car. This car is a jump scare now. I'm so expecting the shape of the other car that this car feels like what is going on. Please don't put the stadium car. Only the new cars. Make it joystick playable. No new car. No, no stadium car. Because so far, I'm a big fan. Yes. A lot of people ask what's the difference between Rally and Snow Car. And they're honestly not extremely different. It's just Snow Car, you have more room to steer without sliding out. I mean, this map's wild. This map is really wild. Okay, I got only six seconds behind.
Snally. We are not gonna call this style Snally. We need the naming police to intervene. That is the worst name I've heard for a map style. <laughs> Our Renau is probably better. Although it's horrible to pronounce. I think you cut the sand here. Because there's no way to, uh... How do I see myself? Oh! Making it through there. Do you think they will add new cars after this? They've already announced one more car. So if you think this is... If you think Snally is, uh... Is difficult, wait till we get... Snallert. Snow, Rally, and Desert in one map. You can be a Snallert pro if you want, but this is not the style that I'm gonna main in this game. Okay, so I gained a lot of time here. I'm getting more and more used to the sharp movements you have to do. Which is nice. I do not know if I'm ready for a couple of the day with this. Or even beating this all the time. Oh god. Okay, and then last turns were here. And you want to stay on the inside so you get this line, okay. <laughs> oh my god. Do you think... The snow and rally car will destroy Trekmania or split the community. Uh, no. Uh, destroy the game? No. Because if you don't like it, you can just not play it, hopefully. That's what I really hope for. That's how it was in the old Trekmania games. And I do hope that maps, for example, and campaigns that feature them won't have obnoxious author times. Of course, this is a discovery. It's okay to have a little harder author times, I guess. Official campaign though with a snow or rally car map, I think should be easier. Really just to give people that don't want to play them an, an easy out. Just like, okay, play the map once, get all the authors, go. <laughs> and make it more fun for keyboard players. That's really what it's about. It's not so much like make it... Maybe it's make it more competitive, but I still see competitions being mostly just stadium car. But really make it more fun, you know? I think it should be priority number one. Because it's not fun to not be able to no slide with this car. Okay, can I full speed this? I can with a good one, okay. And this almost, okay. Picking up the pace. I mean, this is one of the hardest author models I think I've seen. Am I tripping? How can I be four seconds behind with a run like this? Okay, it's only three, but still. That is insane. There's point two here. Did I touch the wall here? I think I did in my- No, I didn't even. My FPB. So what do we do here? That was better. Oh, maybe this is significant. If I- oh, You can't even keep the speed. 
Wow, guys, this is tough. I didn't really expect this when we went into the campaign today. That the other times would be this tough. But I do welcome the challenge. It's just, this is gonna take a while. <laughs> Definitely gonna take a while. World's most obvious shortcuts? Don't think there's a shortcut here. I have not spotted one. Like, you can uh, track limits a bit. And that's all fine, but... Did not spot any big shortcut. There's nothing here. You have to no slide down here. Go up. No slide, no slide. Oh. Yeah, no slide through here. No, there's nothing. There is nothing. It's just pace. Hmm. Just pace. I mean, if I'm gonna gain three seconds, then I gotta continue into the later part of the map and get good at that. So here, slow down and get like a clean, no slidish thing here. This turn is important, and then this next turn as well. Getting the maximum speed out of that sets you up really well. Okay, good progress. As in like the first 20 seconds, I think I have it pretty much figured out. But the last 35, I'm not sure about. so far. It's so still a second. Still one second away. But okay. Let's get start. Hold up. Is he playing on a joystick? Yes. Yes, I am. I tried a little bit earlier on with keyboard and analog keyboard and stuff, but I realized this is the way to go. For the no slides. When you play Snally, you really need the, the movement. Old school? Yeah, this is old school. A lot of United players back in the day used to use joystick. And it is actually quite... Um, Quite comfortable to control the car with. PB so we know that you're legit? Okay, okay, okay wait, 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 I'll try. If I don't PB now, does that mean I'm a cheater? Is this the cheating test? 
It's not looking too good for me, guys. It's really not looking too good. Can I no-slide this? Like, this entire thing. Oh, you can. Oh, that's so difficult, though. Could you add an extra camera for your stick? I would want one for the joystick and one for my face. But I don't have that. Yet. Uh. Would you ever consider trying wheel for content? Sure. I think that could be fun, but I cannot see myself using it competitively. It's just too much of a hassle to have a steering wheel on my desk. All times. And then like, t you know, screwing it on and off. If I want to play one map on keyboard. Okay, so one second behind. But then I got this a little better. Full speed through here. Huh? Yes. I hesitated a lot here in PB. Oh. Gain point four almost. Merge, can you finish campaigns? I don't have to work all day. What is this? Buckley, it's so difficult. I don't think you understand. It's so difficult. Uh, only 13 people have this author time. This doesn't happen in campaigns. Okay. Ah, still fine. Oh, that was nice. Wow. I mean, just wow. This author time, guys, if you're going for all the uh, rally discovery author times, do put off some time for this. Like, if you're sitting down and trying to get this in a quick session, it it might not be that quick. I could just be skill issued, but seriously, this this feels like one of the hardest official in the day author times. Like not user made just in the day, but wow. I can gain like a 10th or 2 in the start. Uh, maybe I just need to be more aggressive in this turn. And in these two, like I should be ahead of this ghost. Unfortunately. Even though I'm always behind there, I should be ahead there. To have a realistic chance of this. Because I gained so much in the start. I do it properly. Okay, so here, here. Yeah. Oh, but this angle is just tremendous. Oh, God. No release there. Full speed of the snow car. Six. Can maybe gain here. Not happening. Okay. Oh, 
I'm starting to like tense up in my hands too much, I think. That was nice. I tried. It's still fine with the crash, actually. So close. Oh, okay. Sag. Now it's not fine. 0.5 into what? I mean, just wow. You got a Wooting employee question for me. What? Love seeing the Lecker Edition on your desk with the new rally car. Is there any updates or changes you want to see for the utility to make it easier to use? Disclaimer, I work for Wooting. Uh, first of all, lovely keyboard. Uh, I, I really like the, <laughs> the, the keyboard. Um, thing is, though. Thing is, though. I do not know, even with the new changes, if making, if changing my uh, sensitivity curves in the Wooting software is now allowed by Nadeo. They are a bit stingy about this stuff. So I do not know. Um, but if, if, if it is allowed to make changes there, then I think the software that you guys have is already great. Would again be nice to have clear rules about this, but we have uh, waited for three months. And the rules are not any easier to understand, so. Yeah, it was a 57 low. I mean, it was a 57 low. I still need so much more time. But good progress. Maybe we can get this before a couple today. We got 10 minutes. Why are we not boycotting the crap cars? I mean, we gotta give them a chance. If the last time you saw someone is 20 years ago, they, they can change a lot. Maybe the snow car is cool now. Maybe the rally car is cool now. So far, I like this as like a... It almost feels like playing a different game. It's like, I feel like I'm a good Trike Mania player, but I'm not good at this, you know? But it's similar enough that a lot of skill is transferable to the new cars. Which makes it fun to try to learn. So I think what I realized is I have to break late here to get this downhill better, and then... Yeah, it's still 0.9. Still 0.9 to go. Wild author time, but there I go, uh, PB, with, with joystick camp. Do you believe me now? I am a legitimate player. Progress. Tiny, tiny bit of progress. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. He's back. Are you guys excited for a couple today? Are you gonna play today? They have announced that it will contain the new car. Or new stuff. But I'm guessing the rally car will be in it. It makes a lot of sense to put the new car in it the day you push the update. Also, hello.
No. Kids still fine. Ah, uh, pain, pain and suffering. How am I gonna beat this land? Well, that was actually potential. Now though, not so much. Okay, point four behind. Still a good run. I think that's one thing I wanna um, wanna do as well. I can't just be fast. I gotta be consistent for a couple of days. So let's try to drive some runs and actually finish them. Ooh. Oh, if I had one wish, it would be that these turns were not so... Um, it's like you play bowling and you have the railings up. Because that kind of thing happening in a cup would be just disaster. Just disaster. I like the idea that you can grace a wall and still keep going, but here, <laughs> it flips your car. Slower, but better turn here, maybe? A little? Point three. Oh, ambitious. Can you guys ping me when there's like five minutes left? Pick up. Or, sorry, two minutes left. Because then I just need a small mental reset. <laughs> just not look at the game. Because I've been staring at this game now for like three hours straight. Okay. Big jump. Not necessary. I think you can release... Yeah, you can release there to get a little bit better turn. What time is couple today? It's in f six minutes from now. At 7 p.m. European time. Oh, beautiful. Okay. What's the timer for? It's how long I've been playing the campaign. So I started playing the, uh, the Rally Discovery campaign three hours ago almost. And we still haven't gotten all the author times. But these uh, black track ones are really difficult. Like the, the most difficult Nadeo medals I think we've ever had. Except for Trek Mini Turbo. As an exception perhaps. If I could twist that, it'd be amazing. Would be amazing. Where are you losing time? Everywhere. That's the thing. Every turn on this map, I can do like two tenths faster probably. Uh, not at the very start, but everything else. With a perfect no slide. Like if you can perfectly no slide the snow car and the rally car throughout this entire thing, you can gain so much time. Like here, look. Oh, almost. And then here again. It's not one specific turn, but it's just controlling this car throughout this entire mess of a map. But it is so difficult. Because you see, if you look at the steering values, I'm never really exceeding like 40% with this car. 40, 50 maybe in the slowest parts here. So you're just constantly trying to uh, just smoothly push the car to the brink of where it's gonna slide, but no further. Three men, three men. All right, guys, we're gonna take a break from this. <laughs> I need like a small just rest of my eyes before a couple of the day. A couple of day in three minutes though with the new car. Let's pause the timer. Let's continue after the uh, couple of the day. 
But pretty good start. I mean, look. Look. We've gotten to here. That's a good start. After th three hours almost. Uh, they called it Snolly. So Snally or Snolly, okay. And then we have two more maps after. I could get gold on these quite quickly, I think, but getting the authors is, is tough. And the power stage is apparently like a three minute map. Three minute nap? Yeah, I'm just gonna... <sighs> just gonna rest up. Couple of the day will be on a, uh, a new, like... Something in the update will be in the couple of the day. I don't know if it's the rally car, I don't know if it's the new blocks, maybe both. But guys, I'm gonna quickly use the bathroom. I'm gonna put on some calm and relaxing Kirby music while I'm gone. And then a couple of days starts, alright? I will be right back. That was perfect timing. All right, Castle Special Stage. I see the Rally Car logo in the distance. The Rally Car released today, and it's very likely going to be featured on this map. Is there a normal car as well, or only the Rally Car? That's a bit loud. It would be fun if it's only the Rally Car. Let's see, I might play this with a joystick, guys. I have not played a couple days with a joystick before, but if this is the rally car, then I want to do that. This looks stunning, though. I just hope there's no stadium car. I see a risky finish. Sorry, is this not sad? Let's go to this. <laughs> okay. I see stadium car on the start. Camelot. Super ultra mini map. Here we go. I need to turn off cars. Oh my god, I need to turn off cars. <laughs> Jesus, this is laggy with all the cars on. Let's quickly reach out. So this is the new car. Uh, it is very sensitive to your steering movements. And you can fall off the map. Okay, that's my respawn key. Uh, you can fall off the map if you slide out. I wish those walls were not curved. So there will be a lot of mistakes on this map, I can guarantee it. Because people are just today learning this car. So, uh, uh, the sand. Okay, so here and then low no slide. And then... Dirt, okay. So far, I really like how much rally car there is. That means I will probably play this on joystick. Holy, okay, break there. And this is the risky finish. Honestly, nice map. 
Nice map. Just gotta figure out the lines. Could watch DPS. Could be a good idea. But let's try a bit without first. So you have to no slide here and then get... Okay. Where's my... Okay, there. If you want to see how this looks, by the way, I'll soon turn on a uh, joystick camera <laughs> so you can see it. Uh, it looks a little odd. I'm steering with like a flight stick, essentially. But it does give me a lot more control in certain turns here than a keyboard would. Nice. And down through here. The dirt turn. The yeah, let's just cane, okay. Fix that next one. Keep going. Goes through here. Drop down. No slide. Oh, this turn is rough. So, goes up. You break top. Down this on the inside line, I think. And then a smooth turn gets you the risky finish. Okay. I am with it so far. One more attempt here before I... Show you guys what joystick gameplay looks like. I'm honestly fine with just slowing down there, as long as I guarantee myself the no slide. That's priority number one on this car, is always to prevent sliding. And then afterwards, you can try to push it. A little bit of a crash again. But let's not forget, there was a sharp uphill here. So break a lot here to get this line. Chat, how are you guys getting along? How are you liking Rally Couple today? You like it? Is it stressful? Is it weird? Here's how it looks for me when I play. Looks fun. It is very hard to control. But it's satisfying though when you get the hang of it. Oh, this turn, I mean... Yeah, look at, like, I can get so much more speed through here if I'm... ...here. One more? So if I'm here, I'm done. How does this work? Oh, I mean, this is so tough to keep control over. And probably wide here into this. Yeah, that would be like a 48 low. That would be probably enough already. Almost. Although I see they have 46, so I don't know. Yeah, let's not touch the grass. Everyone knew Granati was good at the snow car, but he's also good at rally. <laughs> Several thousand hours on Trackmania United, where these cars were first introduced. Goes a long way. Nico as well. Yeah, let's try to get a clean run. Here. Ah, oh, man. Not good. Not good. I need to not bounce there. It's so tough. Granati 46-4. Okay. Let's ignore Granati's time for now. I gotta get to a 48. Stop looking at the 46s. I need to get a 48. That's what I need to do. Uh, half my time is up already. Maybe a 47. But I'm struggling to get out of the start right now. 
kind of lost the feeling. Nice. Well, that is a little annoying how it wobbles. Okay, better. Forty-eight secured. Okay, definitely a forty-seven though. Forty-seven, definitely necessary to uh, get to Division One here. Ah, uh, that's a bad start. Okay. Lacking the control for this. But it's not impossible to get Division 1. Oh, maybe just inside line here. That felt really good. Get to the right no slide in the ending. It's still progress. I mean, this is getting very laggy for me. No cope. But it's still playable. Just having like extremely low frames in some parts. I mean, like, should I turn on the frame counter? I have like 30 FPS. This is crazy. Why is it so laggy? is a lot. Tell me you are bad at video games without telling me you are bad at video games. You need a lot of frames to, uh, to see the racing lines in real time. I'm not wrong. <laughs> it's like at that point you're playing Minecraft and having fun with 30 FPS, but this is different. Two different worlds. Playing Minecraft and running away from a creeper and getting Division 1, two very different things. Okay, it's law. So tough to drive. Okay, PV. 
I mean, like, I need a 47 low even. Don't know if we can get those guys, unfortunately. It would be easier without lag, but even then, it's still so tough. But just like 40 FPS on this is actually unplayable. Like, it's just stuttering all over. Hundred and six. There's still so much in the start that I'm missing. Wow. I'm trying my best, but I don't know if I can get there. But still though, for playing a new device, guys, this is my, like, first day learning this for Rally Car. It's honestly pretty good. Last couple of runs, maybe we can get through. Oh, well that's too slow. But I am very curious, whatever division it is, to see if I can be consistent with this or not. Last try. Okay. What? It, like, how many frames was that? That was like 10. Unreal. That, I, I gotta see that clip. That was like 10 frames per second. We're getting Div 3, guys. I have no idea. That was insane. That was literally absolutely insane. Enable force. Does this help at all? It doesn't even help to turn on Tweaker. Tweaker doesn't even help. Ridiculous. I'm not recording. It's only streaming. Okay, we'll hop in. I, I just gotta deal with the lag. I don't know why it's lagging so much. Ugh, it's annoying though. It is annoying. Just gotta deal with it. I should unbind retire. That's- I'm, I'm gonna do that right now. Cause I- On keyboard I have muscle memory to never press this button. But on... Joystick not so much. That is something that- holy. No guys, I mean, look. I don't think I can do that well here. 
I really don't know. Oh. I swear it's the servers too, because I think if I open this map offline, it's not going to be laggy. Like, if I open this in single player, it's not going to be 10 FPS. That's a problem we've had, um... Sometimes a couple of days. They lag insane on server, and then you play them offline, and they're perfectly fine. But if everyone has it, or most, like, many people have it, then yeah. Then it'll be a battle. Let's see who we got, though. Div 3 on the new rally car. Quite a lot of familiar names. But this is definitely going to be a battle of consistency, more than anything. Throwback to the snow car bugginess? I don't think we'll see that. I don't think we'll have the same bugs. I say this with... A lot of optimism, guys. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if uh, if the server counts our runs. But yeah, look at this FPS counter, man. This is with tweaker enabled, by the way. Which should give me more frames. Like, that is just... I don't know. Oh, I gotta turn off map rank. This is really the 2003 experience. Wait, what are these numbers? Is that how 25 is spelled? <laughs> Wait. The numbers are mirrored. So if, it, if you're in the 40s, it goes four and then four backwards. On your car. Not 44, like... Like, now it might be 50 or something. I'm still 40, second. Okay. Is it, is it an outside line there? Or maybe it's an outside line. Maybe I missed that. Wild. Uh, map rank off. Hide window. Let's do this. All right, cup is starting. We're div three chat with joystick. We're up against tough opponents regardless. Look at this, it's five then five backwards. The only measure here is consistency. Can you drive this 23 rounds in a row without crashing big time? I don't know if I can, but this is the first knockout round. This is- this is mud. Okay, we got 1-1 one, one on our car. Now 2-2. Two, two. This is at least a little bit more of a... fun bug than the snow car one. 3-3, three, three, okay. Noted. 4-4? Four, four? Not good. Holy. Do you want to check if this like an out- almost an outside line? Okay. They mirror the first number, yeah. Yeah, that's how it works. Still plays with a joystick? Yeah, we're trying today. I don't know if I would have a better chance at Division 1 with keyboard. It's possible, but still, I think I would not with the lags. 
Like, after this couple of days is over, I really just want to open this map in single player and see if I'm tripping or not. With the lag. Ooh. So, is this gonna be enough? To make the root, yeah, it is. Almost PB, I didn't crash. What does it say, match three? It's a great question. Um, <laughs> Cause we are in match three. All right, one of the fastest players and WK was out. Oh no, this feels horrible. Stuttery. <laughs> uh, no, I think we're out, guys. Oh god. Okay. 5-5. Five, five. Not good. Although, hang on. 4-4 four, four now. Yes. Yes. Okay. In the orange, that's fine. Completely fine. <laughs> we saved it. My my one hope is that the more players that get eliminated, the the less like the better my frames get. That's that's my one hope in winning this is that people get knocked out and I get more frames. The less cars that the server has to load. Because this has happened in some previous couple of days where I've just accepted like the first couple of rounds are lagging, and then it gets better over time. But I'm not sure if that will happen here. There's so much more speed I can I can obtain there. Gotta keep that in mind. Here. Here. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that's fine. Small hiccup. Granite, Granite drives 45.5? I mean, that, that is still insane. Even if I had perfect frames, that is still insane. Yeah, they're gonna fix the numbers. They're not intended like this, obviously. I think that's just a uh, little oopsie. Okay, very bad start for me here. Oh. Oh, yeah, help. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, still fine. Just went off my usual line. I'm releasing so much here. Oh no, it's so loud. I don't know how many frames this is. Not enough is the answer. Not enough frames. Oh, that is a slow jump, but we made it. Ninety-nine percent sure that's a design choice. I think it looks cool. Well, it's inaccurate. Like you could be, you could be eleventh or nineteenth, and it displays as eleven. It's it's clearly wrong.
Like, I am 0-0. Zero, zero. <laughs> That's weird. That's what you want to see. 0-0 zero, zero is a good sign. Ooh. This round felt more playable. If I go out now, it is because I'm bad. Because now I feel the game is running smoother. Almost PB. Servers crashed for you? Twiggy? Peaked at 78 frames? That is... Wow, that is a luxury. That is, uh, we're, we're living lavish with 78 frames. Minus 10 players and plus 10 frames. Let's see if we can, uh, if, if 70 feels playable. Feels again if I play ah, a little worse for a moment. Okay, solid. Solid for rounds. PB. Tiny PB. Music almost as bad as Scrappy's? How dare you? This is a jam? We're going on an adventure. That's what this feels like. Ooh. Oh, it's so much more playable. This round was really nice. Like, frame, frame rate wise, this was really nice. Big PB. How is this couple of day rally card in this car released today? Yeah, so now they will probably commission uh, Kaisla and Shorty to build a, a rally card map for this couple of day. And it does feel nice. I just wish I had. Uh, a little better PC or better server. <laughs> Probably PC though. Maybe I'll have to get a new PC. Especially since Twitch now allows... Wait, I'm a bit slow here. Uh, Twitch now allows you to code at AV1. And code with AV1, which is... Basically, you don't need to know what it is, but it's just more frames. Uh, looks better. Better bitrate. Better compression. But for that, you need a high-end graphics card, like a 4000 series. And I think I have a 3000 series card. Or a two-PC setup, yeah. It's unoptimized trees. I get this FPS on a 4080. 
turn world detail down and fix it. I can look into that. I can look into that. World detail. I mean, I already turned on tweaker. Which should unload things that are far away. Oh, heck. Almost crashed. No, no, no. We're still fine, but this is slow. Like, plus two. Turn. Uh oh. Please. Ah, we're out. We're out in 20 second. And my first rally car couple today in Division 3. But still a pretty good result. Just couldn't recover from this terrible start. But I still, if you know, this is a good starting point. That's like what? Top 140, I think. Yeah, top ah, 150. The next rally car, I will do better. But I do want to see, after this cup ends, I, I really want to see in single player. If we can break, like here, you know, with all the cars enabled, 30 FPS. Cars off, it's a little better. Single player, if I can get a hundred, holy. I'll learn to appreciate the good frame rates. I will learn to appreciate them. Do we spectate Div 1? Maybe it's a little... Uh, I mean, it's just the way it is, right? Like... It's just a little... Div, Div, Div 3 is cool and all, but... The 45.5s are being driven uh, somewhere else. Let's see. See how Granati does it. In camera 3, no less. Okay, even the stream is lagging. Maybe it's just my internet. Oh god. Okay. It's loaded. Ooh, that is so nice though what he's doing there. And that Mario's is close. That this is just a really good map and the other rally come. Also, Rumbal, thanks for the 10 gift subs. I can't go. Good audio. Thank you, thank you. So, confusing. Alright, let's see it, let's see it. If you on your car, you think you can save, then you have to run one, and suddenly the run one becomes red. Let's see what Gurani's doing. Yeah. Full run. I'm not so confident this is chicane. Gurani has 2k viewers. Guy here I can bar. just go. 2,000 hours on rally car, and they pay off like eight years later. That is really cool from. But yeah, in camera three. Oh. Let's see. He oh no. That's not good. No, he's gonna catch up. He's gonna catch up. Also happened once for me. Yeah. Happened for the second time already. Is this is sub alert? Yeah, I was like stuck to the wall. Yeah. Okay. Ping, 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 ping. That sucks. Really good. Yeah, you're safe already. Ping, 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 ping. Marius, you have to risk. Don't think you can make it this I can save. It depends on your line before, of course. Like, how much yeah. What is yeah, the girl yeah. saying? Yeah, the point is definitely scary. Ping, 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 ping. Ba, 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 ba. I thought I was just messing that up. Did you know that you were thinking that? Ping, 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 ping. Uh, Nobody knows? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Like well, people also say, going have the same t-shirt as Gnati. You guys can't really see it. I, we have the same t-shirt. I got this one from Nadeo. The booster t-shirt. It looks really good. Oh, that is so much speed. Insane. Oh, oh, and want to set up. Okay. Now the lines that he's doing <laughs> <This> was <down. laughs> are really good, guys. Don't hate him so much, Maxim. 
These lines are really clean. Yeah, yeah, I, just, I just love with. Oh, with and it. just full speeding through here. Okay. With the with control, us. more than anything, is just insane. Let me also make this so I, that you can't I, I, hear Division 3 sounds. It'll make it a bit better. That's I fast. How much I can push the last turn. Ooh. Okay, Roa.6 as well. Yeah. It's not gonna be easy. Holy. <laughs> you played 08 for a couple minutes and you got 22.2? I, I, I gotta try it. Yeah, I always try 47 low, 46 high. I'm wondering who his like, biggest opponent is gonna be. I didn't even see the other people's times. But uh, we'll see. It's hard to improve also if you don't have like minus or plus. Oh, Samifying's doing well as well. Really fun to see. I mean, pushing this outside line is madness, by the way. Ooh. What was your PB, Shorty, by the way? Was it your Yo, I think already at this checkpoint, he's like minus one second of what I was getting. I could have driven like 0.4.5 faster, maybe, if I would have like really grinded it, but... Yeah, I, I think it's a good... But what I don't understand is how he has such a good feeling of the... The slide out angle in camera three. Yeah, would have also taken me quite a lot of tries. Like getting the minus and surviving it until the end. A roll at the point seven, okay. So they're both up there. Dude, Sammy literally just wow. played the car for the first time three hours ago. <laughs> they're both up there. Good. Some Athos as well yeah. <laughs> in these top 10. 15,000 hours in Trackmedia United? <laughs> sure, I mean, sure. Like, but it goes a long way. Yeah, you play United you know, for yeah, thousands yeah, of hours, it's gonna pay off. Really but. Like, I don't think content. the rally experience that Insane. I had like three years ago is helping me much right now. <laughs> For example, if you would have grinded the snow car a lot now, Lars, yes. and you would have like gotten better at smooth steering, you would have instantly been better at rally as well. Because it's just That's so true, similar. Yeah. And this I is mean, crazy. Again. <laughs> so satisfying to watch, especially if you've played the map and you just yeah. get appreciation for how difficult what he's doing is. And it seems so casual as well. recorded in like two, three, two or three tries, Lars. Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's not a surprise though, is it? Yeah, but like, Sammy Fang took like 30 hours on that world record. Yeah, well, but he, yeah, but knew, he knew. Yeah. I mean, he, he knew that there's gonna of. be an update. I mean, he knew that it was probably, he Sammy. was uh, like hoping a little This man out here fucking eye racing, racing like, yeah. Maybe the bump was actually giving you speed. You know? Yeah, of course, no, the he, bump uh, giving, is knew. giving you speed. The thing is that the bump is now equally lost, fast, yeah. maybe even a little bit faster, and then the ending landing bugs uh, are just non existent anymore. So you just gain like 0.3 in those, basically. Yeah, I'm kind of rooting for Samifying here. If you guys don't know Samifying, yeah. he's a Geometry Dash yeah, YouTuber. Is he streaming this? I maybe should have played a bit more probably probably before guys. starting. No, geometry Dash probably. YouTuber who's picked up Trackmania in the last years and he's so good. Such a nice map. He so is. Fun. I really feel like people like Renny more than Snow. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Oh, he is. Yeah, because it makes more fun. Go, Sammy! Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Holy, there's a lot of things going on in the stream, too. So many things on screen. No! No. Nine! Damn it! Nice try. Nice try, right? Okay. I don't know why. Unlucky, unlucky, unlucky. I would landing box people would have liked it more at first. First time playing rally car ever. And also with top eight division one. one. That's that's really I impressive. I don't know if the different action keys for snow really would have mattered. Oh. I mean, Forty six But the other time. Yeah, for. Plan, I didn't try to curse him. The discussion that that people. Had I was rooting for him. Snow car was mainly keyboard, so that would have probably could have been even worse. Is anyone gonna beat Grandi? Okay, this is actually really fun. <laughs> Ildu, thank you, and Giggity, thank you as well. Spam me off the rally at 21, 2015. Spam me off the rally, 
Yeah, spammy off the rally at 2050. Ooh. Could be fun to play actually if you guys want to. I don't have enough time, so I mean, I'm already streaming for seven hours. <laughs> no. So smooth. Last man standing. Just casual 45 every round. With the rally car. Oh, I, I just, I don't know why, but I just full braked in the last turn. <laughs> Almost didn't make the risky. Casual 45. Stupid. <laughs> like, you kind of have to see this from a spectator point of view to appreciate it. Maybe we spectate spam spectate division one if spam got there. Because then you really get to see it as well. Oh, spam is building. Okay, so we spectate scrappy spectating division one. To get the full... Because now you can see, Granati's the blue car. It's time to go fast! Granati's the blue car up front. You see, cool kid. Oh, weeb music, okay. He's trying to. Ooh, the people like? weren't lying. Okay, Jan and Marius, Marius has a lot of experience on this, by the way. He's, he's played a lot of United. Bad speed uphill, Marius has to release though. <laughs> even. It's close. But then you see Granati's just casually, like, look at this. You see that blue car? 45-7. Or 45-4? Bruh. Thank you for the 44 months, Lisa. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. 45-4. Campaign gonna redeem. Yeah, you guys can't wait. Yeah, you love Casual. It. Was our Share that sub, FFS. I slid out and almost flew over a wall. And that was Hi, big, big fan. Okay. Can't do anything about that. <laughs> okay, so we got Roa, Grolomax, and Granati are like old school players. Wizzy is a steering wheel player. Yeah. You see why you're the big fan? You have 45 months in my channel. I have 44 months in your channel. That means you are the real fan here. Yeah. <laughs> Always one, one step behind, behind oh, eh? <laughs> it's very close. It's very but, close. um... Oh, we see a crash but, by Wizzy, but, but I don't think it matters. I was gonna still, say, yeah, it's like the old the school ending. players versus the new. And with Everyone's Yon going out now, it's only vibes. steering wheel yeah. and boomers. Yeah, oh, I'm always one step behind, man. Can I say? Is Yon no, this A12 TNF guy? ATs, man. D12, but yes. A12 as well, maybe. That's a good one. 45 months. We're just, Cute. We're just a real fan when you both sub. That's true. We're just taking that juicy 30 I wonder how much money we've given to Twitch by collectively what used to be subbing to each other. Thank God they had some. 45 months? Some different things and like $2 a month each going All to right. Twitch? Also AT on this So $4 map. a ah, month. Four times. Rolling. We've given like Twitch $160. Okay, well, Four fast players now. After Jan is out, this is gonna be a battle. Gorolo Max. 180. In last yeah, 45. Here, 180. Fast, but this turn here is very decisive. Oh, that's a bad line from Roa. Uh oh. Oh, that was not in the wall. Yo, Hotu just subscribed. Wanna see okay. the ending? Thank you, Hotu. Like they stopped yeah, steering just done. at the peak of that turn. Wait, oh, where's Wizzy going? Wizzy, Wizzy man, what is this? Yeah, Oppa. that's not how you do that turn. Okay, oh, three boomers. It's, it's all boomers. <laughs> Unlucky. All right. That means uh, we have our uh, TMU final here between Granadi, Roa, and Golomax. These guys all have thousands of hours I in United. Wizzy played the old game. So it makes know. sense. But uh, yeah, here we go. That these guys are left. These three definitely have experience with this card before. That's going to be a release here. Roa, they, they do. Clips. Clips again. Not the best Effortless start. Effortless from Granati to go up that high on oh, the that's a outside. Set up there. Interesting. From oh, is it lagging? Granati with the most speed. Is oh just my god, the stream is lagging here, now too. Roa okay. With more speed through this. That is going to be huge. Okay, is it better? Very important at the exit. Very good lines from Roa. Okay, I think I fixed it. Back into second. This is very different. I Golomax is slightly sliding, but not really losing, but... Oh, oh Granati! Granati! Granati missed! Out! Granati missed the risky finish. Uh, Didn't have the speed, I think. Um, yeah. So, Granati is not winning today. 
He bonked. I don't think... I think he would have still made it. I, I'm not sure. I didn't see his speed, but... All right. Grolo Max against Roa in the it final It did here. look like Pink he was going to make it. Thank you for the step. With Rhyme. All right. Okay. Here we go. Finale. Roa is pushing it again. This time makes the turn, but still has lower speed here. Ooh, that's nice. Look at the difference line. He... he Slide versus... Okay, now they both slid, actually. All right. Uh, maybe maybe I was wrong. Maybe it is sliding. All right. They're only like 0.1-ish behind pace Granati. Same speed. This is a close battle. It's a good Roar pace. full inside line. Does he make it? Yes. Oh, that, that is, is sick. That, that is sick. Now, two tens in this end is... He should have very, this one. This is a good time, too. 0.5? Unless there's a mistake uh, point, in the last corner. Point seven. Let's see. Roa seems clean. And Roa wins. That's a good time. The first ever. Rally That's a really good time. Top of the day. Yep. GD to G Roa. G. Okay, oh, guys. Granati, Granati, is Div 3 still Grat going? Is Div 3 still on? Oh, we just have a winner. It's another French player. You can't see it yet. I don't know why it's not loading. Holy loud. Wait, the game is not showing up. This is weird. Okay. Oh, now we go. Okay. So, I had 30 FPS on the server. If I load this off uh, offline in single player, I had 30 to 40. I, sh I feel like it should be like 80 or 90. It's 90. Which is playable. Lower is terrible. But this actually looks playable now. Ah, maybe it's a little, a little laggy still, but this this definitely helps. They just throw the car into this outside line. And I'm breaking too much here, so... 21-1 was the checkpoint they had. Yeah, I'm having like 21-6, 21-5. And then just full no slide through here. Smooth through here. And then like the, the crazy thing is how they stop steering just at the peak of a turn. But it could also be that this is just a laggy map in general. Do you have car reflections on high that kills FPS? Low. Are the reflections on though? I don't know if any anything of this is gonna kill FPS. It's uh, and, it, and it has to be poor, you know. Slow mo blur. For when you play in slow mo. World detail. It's not even a setting. But the guy said, turn world detail down. It's not even a setting. Shaders high. If you put this lower, it actually removes a lot of edges in the game. MSAA6 is insane. Okay, so we put Musa to number two. What does that do? We put Musa at two. Two X Musa. I don't feel a difference. I do not feel a difference. Discernible difference? No. It's still pretty bad. It's not as bad. But it's not as smooth as it's supposed to be. But okay, guys, we're not going to play this laggy map. We are going to complete the rally campaign. The rally discovery campaign. We got to map 23. We're two hours and 40 minutes in. And we've only gotten this far. Why, you might ask? Well, as it turns out, 
these author medals, Nadeo have hunted them to oblivion, especially the black maps. So to get author time on this map, you need top 15 world. And I so far have only gotten top 25-ish. I'm still almost a second behind the author time. But maybe now with better lines we can get there. Use keyboard or joystick for this? I use joystick for this. I tried a bit with keyboard earlier, but I think what I want to do is learn joystick properly. I also need my restart key. But yeah, if anyone knows what it could be, um, do send me a DM. I'm not going to do tech setup on stream. But please uh, DM me on Discord or something if you know anything that I could help with the frame rate issue. Because it is annoying to have. Because uh, I do want to have better FPS, but I hate doing setup on stream. But maybe we'd have it fixed for tomorrow. My plan right now is to stream like the next four days in a row, basically. Uh, so there's going to be a lot of streams. What kind of GPU? I think I have a 3080. I think that's the GPU I have. There's a list of components, I don't know. I am not a PC guy. <laughs> that should be plenty, right? It should be. Let's, let's focus up. This map, if you haven't seen it, you seen me play it earlier, just requires super smooth, no slides. I saw some people ask earlier whether you can speed slide with the new car. You cannot. <laughs> the, the best way to gain speed is to not slide anywhere. So that goes for both the snow car and the rally car. And you just have to uh, turn really precisely for that. Always staying with full grip on the road. Never turning really more than 40%. And then you will gain plenty. So that's the big challenge here, is just to stay smooth. Enough. Some mobile planet plugins broken for the update? I think so, yeah. Like speed splits. I'm gonna try to play a bit without the ghosts on, just to focus on my my own lines rather than the ghosts lines. And see if that helps. Sometimes ghosts can be a great visual help, but sometimes they can also just be distracting when you're trying to drive fast. For me, at least. Oh, that was not good. Okay, so we're ahead. The ending on this map's hard though. That was a bad turn. A little bit of a bad ending, 0.7. Like a second slower. One second slower. Okay. That's nice. This good. I wanted to push that so much, but it didn't work. Great start there, though. That That is motivating to see the pace. Let's put on some more, not not like uh, cartoony music, but like, but like um, hype, and then we'll get this. Put on this. 
sub four hour prediction, I think it's gonna fail because the last map is three and a half minutes of the same kind of thing that this is. So I think sub four is dead. We will see. There's still a lot of rally carring to do. But you know you gotta take it in stride. You will uh, you will learn a lot from playing these maps. It'll be great. I'll be better at uh, rally car after this. It's a little bit bad. Wow. Going to TwitchCon? I think so. Uh, I haven't decided yet, but I think so. I've been to every TwitchCon since 2022. And I'm, I'm, I feel like I've kind of seen the conventions now. Like I'm not so much going for the conventions anymore, but it is really nice to, uh, to meet the people. Like I feel like I've seen everything with like the booths and everything. But seeing people and talking to streamer fans and going out with them, it's great. Just like a great place for creators to meet creators and fans. Oh, that's nice. So right there, I can definitely take a better line. Seeing the lines people drove in the couple today makes me feel like my lines here are so bad in comparison. But that's just part of the learning. Okay. Like there's just a layer of control that they have that I don't have yet. People like Renati. Got a 5806. Not bad, not great. Go again. Nice. So close. Alerts are muted. Yes, they are. Bruh, need the $2. Sorry for Optopic. Has someone here as a contact to Discord because writing a month with a bot will drive me to the grave? Uh, you can. My, my DMs on Discord are open. You can just DM me. That is not a reason to DM me about stupid things, but <laughs> if you have something you want to reach me with, it's possible to reach me. Ooh. Rest in peace inbox. No, I simply just don't answer if it's not like... Not something too relevant. And even things that are relevant, I often don't get to. And then they just end up in the unread list. Getting longer and longer. I should not release there. I should just full speed. That's good. Oh, double slide instead of double no slide. Horrendous art. Yes. Could be PB. PB. 5740. We have about 0.8 to go still, though. Progress. Getting closer. Do you feel the new cars and surfaces make it harder for new players to start learning? Yes. Uh, yes, absolutely. 
No doubt about it. It's kind of like trying to learn League of Legends when there were 15 champions, or 16, in 2010. And trying to learn League of Legends now, and there's like 140 characters, and they all have their own abilities. That you gotta remember. Like, the more things you add to a game, the more steep the learning curve will be. But it also might make the game more interesting. Though I think in the case of League, I liked it more when there were not that many champions. There's 185 now? I mean, isn't that so doomed? Should they not start removing champions? <laughs> Remove the least played characters? There's no way you need 180 characters. Just keep adding more? Yeah, I don't know. Every year, the only League of Legends I really watch is the World Championship. And every year, I'm more and more confused when I see like, Oh, what the hell is this character? What, what do they do? And then I just see like five teleports and two invisibility things and I'm like, okay, cool. I'm so clueless. Okay, it was still only a small PB. 57.2, but that's still progress. I had some good pace in the middle there. So we'll take it. Best run yet. Can you speed slot with Rally Car? No. The uh, entire attempt to go fast with the Rally Car is just to not slide at all. So this looks like a speed slide, but it's, it's slower than just having full grip. Having the lines behind the car connected. Nice. maybe okay good okay good wow oh that was so fast oh that was regrettably fast what's oh, the skybox so messed up we're using a plugin called tweaker to reduce lag it, it changes the render distance in the game that's why it looks a bit different Yeah, the middle of this run was, like, pristine. Honestly. It's 0.5 pace. I think the Rally Car would be cooler if it made you faster the more you slide. It would be. But it would also be complete chaos, wouldn't it? But that would make the gameplay, like, distinguishably different from the Snow Car. Last time you upgraded PC? I think early 2022. Like that. Five minutes on Winter 08? Yes, later, later. 
do want to remain focused here on the uh, campaign. So I'm really in the in the zone with this. That was good. No, let's release a bit. Did I not touch? Wow. Oh yeah, okay, we can still be PB here. Not great. Oh, zero three behind. We're getting there. We're getting there. I'm feeling a lot better, guys, about this. I was uncertain, but now I can see it. It's just so much precision. Will you guys try to go for all authors on this? Is anyone else trying to get the same author battle right now? I need to know that I'm not the only one struggling. Because this feels so like... Whew. Need someone to validate me that I'm not the only person who's extremely and severely skill issued with this car <laughs> so far. Oh no. Okay, maybe. Oh, close. Is this the final track? This is track 23. 24, I don't know if it's probably hard. But 25 is a three minute track. That probably only like 10 people have the author time on so far. This one's like 15. But if, uh, if you're struggling, we're all in this together. We will try to learn this. I was thinking when I, when I get a little bit better at this car, I'm gonna make a tutorial for it. Things to look for. You're never steering over 60, you can use Action 3 for more precision. I guess I could. It's just my muscle memory is so um, locked in right now. But I feel like I'd have to, like it would be harder now to do that than to just kind of learn the, the angles. Or to just use the angles that I know now for each turn. Because, like, you have to think, if I, if I put on an action key, every turn I'm going to have to move this more sideways. And a lot of it is just physical memory of where my hand should be as well. Not so much only visual. This is how it looks like when I... When I drive. The next map, I think we can try that. Oof. I see, even with a crash, this run is fine. Wow. You're lacking a month, yo, Scrappy! You are, you're one, you're one singular month behind. We calculated that together we've given Twitch about a hundred and what? Hundred and eighty dollars? To this platform? By subscribing to each other. <laughs> so not bad.
Yeah, I'm trying to learn the joysticks. Oh. No, not ah. slide. Oh, PB, but yeah, only one hundredth. Still need like point six, guys. Still need point six. That was a great start, though. That start was definitely on pace. Ooh. Using action key or no? This is no action key, yeah. I think I'm gonna try to learn it eventually. But for now, I think I just confused myself if I enabled the action keys. Because I have a pretty good feeling for how this... Like, how much I need to hold. For each turn. Need to steer sharp. You haven't tried it at all yet either? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The confusing thing is that it doesn't apply to a uh, stadium car as well. That got me really confused. Like, playing a map with that on earlier, which had a stadium car in it too, was just like, complete brain rot. Because you steer, you steer like at a certain angle and you expect a certain volume, it's different. What is a strat for bobsled with rally? The best I've found so far is just to not steer on the ice. Try to have a straight angle. But uh, strats will probably develop over the next days. The action key change doesn't apply to stadium car? No, only snow and, and rally car. <laughs> Are people getting timed out for suggesting that Virtual should restart his PC? Yes, I think so. But you're also stupid for saying that. Because the uptime is at 30 minutes. I, well, I, I restarted my PC 30 minutes before stream. It is clearly something else. So Stadium will be alright for keyboard? Well, Stadium has always kind of been alright for keyboard. It's never been too terrible. But, uh, yeah, the new cars being integrated into Stadium is what's got people, like, a bit worried. How are you enjoying the new car so far? Honestly, it's quite fun. The difficulty, I think, can discourage a lot of people. But I almost treat it as like learning a different game. It's like I know the stadium car well, but this is... You know, a very similar game. It's like learning... I think if you play one FPS game, it's like learning a different FPS game. And so I appreciate the challenge of trying to apply the same principles I know from Trackmania to this car. To gain time. But that being said, it's really difficult so far. Wait, eight, I just want to see the end. Oh. Oh, that could have been... Yeah, I mean, I'm gaining 0.3 in the end, and that could have been even more. Probably 0.4 in the end with a good arm. I love this song. In your opinion, is this campaign even beatable without action key and only on keyboard? Uh, beatable as in, like, all other times? No. 
Uh, it is not. But I don't think people should... Like, if you play keyboard, I don't think you should... I think you should accept action keys as, like, a tool. Like, it... I don't know how to explain this. Uh, like, you shouldn't expect... Uh, like it, it, For these cars, you need smooth steering. <laughs> you need to steer, like, 40%. That's just how this car works. So if you always steer at 100%, it's not gonna be. But that's not really a problem, because you have a tool that lets you steer 40%. The problem is the values in between. And I wish they gave keyboard players more action keys. But having it action key free would be impossible. While the car has these gameplay perks. And a lot of people have said like... Okay, so... If you only steer between 0 and 40% with the rally car, for the most part. Why do you have so many values above that? And I think that's really where the, the skill in these cars comes through is that there is so much room for error in your steering. Like there, I just oversteer by a little bit. And if they optimized it so that a full steer would just be a perfect no slide, I think it'd be boring. But the no slides that you get really feel rewarding when you have to like, work for them. So close. Oh god, he's one of those nail painting lads. No. I thought you were different. I cannot believe you have paint on your nails. <laughs> I thought you were better than this. I've been a fan for so many years and then I saw this and... No. No, virtual, not you two. It's not that deep. I just got my nails painted with friends because my, all my friends at the stream rewards were getting their nail painted. And I was like, okay, I'll, I'll join, I guess. So Janet got his done. And then Annie Fuchsia and Anna Kramlin got theirs done too. And I was like, well, I'm not just going to sit at my hotel alone all day and not hang out with my friends. I, I guess I'll join. <laughs> it's not, that's about the depth of it. Would you recommend getting a joystick? Uh, honestly, maybe. It's fun. It's very different. It takes some getting used to. Uh, but I'm having fun on this. I think, though, um... Uh, it's not a must. As in, the results you can get on keyboard right now are, are still quite close to what you can do with analog units. I think it's only like certain maps where you start to see big differences. So don't get it and think it's automatically going to make you better at the game. But it might make you enjoy it more. Because it is a fun way to play the game. That would be the reasons I would get it.
Honestly, that slide is okay. Oh, what an ending. Whew. We're getting somewhere now. Top 24 world and less than 0.4 to go. Progress, progress, progress. Started out six seconds behind this, like an hour ago. But now I can finally start to see the light. It's like, this is 0.2 already here. PV after PV though. 56, 86 guys. Oh, I was holding my breath there. I was getting excited. I thought we were finally done. What a challenge, man. What a challenge. Just got a full send. Your top 98 world, you don't have gold? How many how many people have played this now? 1,000, oh god. <laughs> oh, this is this is wild. So only uh, only like a hundred people have a time under one minute so far. Have I tried out the snow car changes? I have not. Not yet. Wanna see if I can complete this uh, campaign first, but it's really tough. Difference between snow and rally car? Rally car slides more, and as you noticed, it has higher speeds. It tends to go a bit faster. Am I gonna top 0-1% this campaign? The snow car- uh, sorry, the rally car campaign? I could try. But, uh... Depends on the player count, because uh, with 1,000 players, that'll be getting world record on every map. So I need a few more people to play this map first. And all the others. <laughs> Cannot really realistically world record every map to get top tier 1% world. It's 58, I still wanna see this. I didn't get a perfect no slide here in PB. Or did I? 86? And then... Yeah, that's like a tenth in the end. So I need to be minus point ten-ish before the ending. Okay. I guess I just got a full send more. Like, I think I'm hesitating a bit too much in each turn because I'm not quite comfortable with the pace yet, the speed of this car. But like, the top record is probably just full speed through here. And they probably just full send this one quite early. And then full speed through here. Okay. Oh, 
No! Ah, oh, I didn't get the no slide. Last checkpoint? I mean, this would be a fast land. 25? Last checkpoint? With a different line? Okay. Holy... Wait, I can do a really good time here. Just need to improve my last checkpoint line like that. It's not going to save the full 25 with the setup, but it's still a big time save. Done. Yes. So like here. No, I crashed. Okay, okay, okay. The last checkpoint line is so much better now, guys. That should be the final piece. But wow, hugging the wall the entire way up the hill, and it's 81. Okay, we're getting this, we're getting this. Continuable. <sighs> What's the timer for? That's the total amount of time I've spent on the campaign so far. And a third of it is just this map right now. Oh, too much steering. Okay, still okay. Ah, oh, that's so bad. You're still on this? I just got back? Yeah, we're closer than ever. Which map number is this? Map 23 in the campaign. All the ultimates are quite approachable, but the last five, the black tracks, are... Whew, Entirely different level than the other ones. How is vertical one second faster? Clean lines. Clean, risky nose lights. Get every no slide perfect, you gain so much. This part. Is this the moment that keyboard players must switch? No. Uh, the thing is, you can just... You can't keep playing keyboard, you can be competitive at it. I think Mime on keyboard got second place in a couple of day qualifier today. Like, it's really not terrible. But, um, I think for top precision record hunting, on specifically snow and rally car maps. So you're already very specific categories. That's where keyboard just isn't competitive. Mime was playing controller. Oh, he is? Okay. I thought it was keyboard. That's impressive then if he's learning controller that quickly. Total gamer. Can you try to do the 11th map? I really just want to focus on this one right now. But, uh... Hopefully, if I finish this today, we'll do a video on how I did uh, all the maps. Have you seen map 25? I've heard rumors that it's a 3-minute map, so... I'm excited about that. gonna really test my uh, consistency with this car. As long as it's not just so much precision. Because this map, the, the one thing that makes this really difficult for me is how every turn is so tight. There's not a lot of room to no slide. You have to steer and you're always close to a wall. 
Like, there's never a time where you're just chilling with an O slide. Also, PB pace. <sighs> okay. New end line? No, I missed it. Yeah, I missed it. Okay. What? Are these splits? Oh no, I crashed. How did I gain 0.4 in the start? That's sad. My start there was mental though. Point four ahead. I even crashed, but because I had such a time save in the start, it didn't actually matter that much. I wonder if it's just pushing that full speed. Yeah, I think so. So like what you want to do, this is something, it's not... It's. It seems like it's not good to only no slide here. Like this next corner, it's better to just full push and then catch the no slide on the way out to the right. But to the left there in the chicane, you can just slide. But the pace is really good now. Like it's a matter of time. It's so like here, slide, and then no slide. Missed it, still fine. Guys, it's so close. It's so close. I slid out in the last corner. This track does not look fun. I'm getting the hang of it, and it's actually like you feel like a pro going so close to the walls all the time when you get the hang of it. But in the start, it's like despair. My first couple of runs on this were 103, 102. And then when I saw the author time was 56, I felt just... Yeah. Not motivated. <laughs> but now it feels fun, after an hour on this track. No. Oh, that is so bad. Okay. Maybe it's fine. Point two. Point two. Carry this through here. Yeah. How did I even do this line in the ending? What did I do? I slow down, I stay on the black line on the inside, and then I get a no slide left. That's what I gotta do. This is snuck. I don't have to risk here. Okay. In your honest opinion, do you like the new car? Uh, yes, I think so. I don't think it's a terrible addition. I just think people need time to adapt and get used to it. But I quite like that it 
the gameplay of it is really different to the stadium car. And I also like the look of it. I think the car looks cool. Looks like a race car. Uh, I do wish it was easier to play on keyboard though. And sounds cool. Yeah, that's a nice, uh, nice sound too. The gameplay of these cars looks not smooth. I think it's more the blocks here, the the, the map, because this edge on the inside is a little slanted. So your car often ends up bumping on these corners a lot and going through. But that's rally IRL too. <laughs> I mean, if you see a ra if you if you see an onboard point of view with a rally driver. Their head is literally, like, constantly vibrating and shaking. Like, the amount of force... Like, rally, rally tracks in real life are not smooth. Oh god. Crash, but let's continue. It's not the worst place to crash. Point two. Less speed. Good no slide. Point four. Nine forty-five. Okay, just want to see the end. Thirty-nine. See, that is a good end. That was a nice end. Rally drivers, IRL are insane. You can die at any moment. Yeah, it's crazy. And I think it's crazy they have a map reader. And sometimes you can really hear the fear in the voice of the map reader. The cars are so safe. That's crazy. I've seen this clip of a rally driver literally just falling off a cliff, spinning. The car spins like four times, crash into several trees, and the guy just sits there chilling. Not even moving, like, at all. And the car absorbs all the force, and he's fine. Oh, man. Go. Nice. Also, do you guys prefer, now that you've watched it, do you prefer face cam or joystick camera for these, these things? Like, I think ideally I'll have both, but right now I only have one camera. Is it more fun to watch, like, the movements or my expressions when I'm driving? Oh, this break tap was a little too much, but look at this line I could have had. Ah, uh, plus a one. Yeah, there's a pull in the Twitch chat. There is a pull in the Twitch chat. I do think seeing someone pogging out of their mind when they get an author medal is more interesting than looking at a man handling a stick with painted nails. But you guys can vote. This is so death. 
I had that way too much speed. Face wins with 77% of the vote. Hello, Twitch chat. We are back. We are so back. Let's put it like that. Or like this. Three hours 40 played. Three cameras are ideal. Hand, stick, and feet. Yeah, I don't know. I think, uh... I think we'll stick with one camera for now. Alright, Virtual, I gotta go somewhere for two hours. I expect you to still be grinding this map by the time I get back. I hope to be done by then. <laughs> Oh, I'm... Um, okay. I wanted to hit the break key and I hit the restart key. Oh. So close. It's any moment now, guys. It's any moment that we get this. Oh, just gotta... Full sun through, straighten out. 2.8k people on YouTube and no representation. Twitch chat is the, the the easiest polling feature, I think. But I, I I will I think just the best is have both. Or maybe the joystick camera isn't really needed. Always blue splits there. It's very motivating. It's always blue splits in the start. Rate the difficulty level of this campaign from 1 to 10. If you're trying to get all author medals, Nadeo campaign wise, this is the hardest one ever. If you're, uh, except for Super Solo, but that wasn't driven by Nadeo. Uh, if you're just trying to complete the maps, the cars are pretty hard, but you can have fun. Uh, five out of ten, maybe. Like, none of the maps have insane speed checks or anything. Is this Nadeoko driven? Yeah. But it's driven by Tona, who is a really good player. Who works at Nadeo. I need to break more there. More and late. How's your hand after four hours? Is there any force feedback on the joystick? Yeah, so look. If I push it to the side and I go, it insta snaps back. So it's always trying to center the, the stick. So, um... So yeah. There is some force on it, but it honestly feels quite okay. Because I'm not applying too much force on it. So I have to be very done too much, I think. Oh my god. <laughs> Snally Snally is beaten, man. What a man. Holy, this was so difficult. Th this is so difficult. 
I hope you understand, like, what? My- my middle part of this run was insane. I did not think I was gonna survive the, um, the middle snow cart turn, I'll tell you which one. But yeah, it's just No Slide Paradise. Had a really good start here. Basically, no sliding the entire thing. And then... This turn was a little mid, so was this downhill. And this next turn was really bad. But then, the only reason this is AT is because of this snow turn right here. Look at this one. Ooh. Ooh. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And then my end was complete hot garbage. This is bad. I was stressing out. I was stressing out. This is bad. This is bad. Just totally stressing out. Let's see, uh, Sander. Also plays joystick, by the way. This world record is driven on joystick. I think I'm ahead of the- No, I'm not. Okay. Whoa, what a turn, man. Oh, that's so much speed. One eighty through here, okay. He's actually insane. Two hundred and ten down here, okay. He just pushes that, okay. But like, how is is every no slide? How is every no slide perfect? How does he have so much space that looks so comfortable? Ah, uh, he does push the inside, okay. And a little bit different end line, but just God bless. God bless. Guys, two maps left. Let's move on. Two maps left. I am speed number two. Progress has been made. How does the new car feel? Fun, honestly. But quite challenging. So this is the map from the trailer, I see. Yeah, we saw this in the trailer with the cars like flipping out of control. Okay, let's see how to control this. So, smooth, smooth, smooth. Is this just a full speed rally car map where, yeah, the tilts are pro problem. Okay, so if you do a good start, you're so gonna flip out in this turn if you don't slow down. I like this mechanic a lot, though. And I mentioned this earlier, but if you're just getting in, I'll say it again. The wood, like the rally car on wood, honestly is really cool. Because the threshold for sliding is lower. But there's also this tilt going on, which is uh, honestly the most unique part of the gameplay with this car so far. 44.65. Not bad. Did you expect to need four hours for this? No. The other- the snow car campaign was like two hour discovery or something. Maybe a bit less. I think it was two hours. But that, that previous author time was... I mean, maybe I'm just bad. But I don't think a lot of people get it. This map looks awful. <laughs> it's a little hard, but it's not terrible. Just gotta do very gentle movements. Need top 20 for it, and that is with, like, a lot of good players in the top 20. Like, that author medal is essentially like a Trekmania Grandmaster time. Whereas author medals usually are... a little easier than that. That's a good start. Oh, you can so full speed this. Let's try again. Can you? Wait, can you? To be very careful. Maybe you cannot. Without losing speed, I question it. Okay. How 
How come that I only have author times in the rally discovery where the rally cart isn't used? Just means you're better at saving, I guess, but... But you can learn rally. You can all learn rally. Hug the wall in the NASCAR turn? I think you just slow down a bit and then inside line. It's my gut reaction, my intuition. Maybe you can, hmm. Like I'm consider one of these tilts, it eventually tilts your car so much you slow down, right? I'm considering just getting one of these tilts and then after that having proper speed. Okay, and then I forgot the rest of the map. Mm, sort of. Okay. That's gonna be too slow. For PB. Yeah, okay. And then up and finish. Okay. How does the new car drift on road? Drifting with it is slower. You only want to prevent every drift you can get, basically. Anytime it slides, it's not accelerating. As much as when it has full grip. Oh. How's it going today? Very laggy for me today. I hope I can fix it for tomorrow, because tomorrow will also be Rally Car Cup of the Day. We got 150th, so I gotta practice, and then tomorrow maybe we'll do better. Practice and fix the lag problem. Yeet! Okay, we're struggling. Do you think all of times are possible on keyboard? Yes, no doubt. But you do gotta use action keys. You like that you can be more close to the usual edge when the car tilts? I guess like an ideal turn is, is tilting on the side and then having those wheels on the edge of the turn. Which yeah, can look really cool. And the edges here are also quite forgiving. Did they really kill keyboard? No. No cause for ultimate doomsday concern. Yet. I think it's harder on keyboard. But I definitely think it's playable. And competitive enough. But I think um, for a lot of precision maps, analog is better. So. Oh, I need to. Yeah, almost. A reach author time on keyboard to prove they didn't kill the keyboard? Alcon is already doing that. And he got a better time than me on the map I spent an hour on. If they didn't kill keyboard, why is keyboard Mr. Ross using an analog stick? I am learning joystick because I wanna. <sighs> Quite simply. Whether or not they make keyboard more viable, it is not a bad thing to know how to play with an analog stick. It is uh, not a bad thing. On some maps, it will be beneficial. Okay, I'm gonna slow down even more here. Oh, almost. Have I tested snow car yet? I haven't. Because I've basically just been doing this campaign for the past four hours. Why not a regular controller? Because I prefer controlling the car with my dominant hand than with my thumb. On my left hand. Or on my right hand for that matter, but I think you get more control by using your entire hand than just a thumb. 
So that's just my preference. To here. Yeah, I'm losing so much speed. Oh, <laughs> 38. Okay. Getting closer. Thirty is still really quick all the time here, though. I don't even know if I should slow down this much, but that's when it's controllable. At, like, 300. At above 300 is when you get this, like, super uncontrollable car. Like, at this point, I'm so fast that this next turn... ...is just terrifying. Almost kept the grip. Should not be PB. Oh, it is. Virtual, would you go crazy with your new PC to flex on all of us just to get AV1 and no tweaker? No, but honestly, I, I really want to stream in, in better quality. So I think it coincides pretty well. Like, if I need a new graphics card and everything to get AV1 encoding, then, uh, then I think I want to do that. Okay, better start. Ah, yeah, this uphill, I gotta be very cautious with steering. That doesn't happen. Oh. Okay, now we're slow. This is gonna cost a lot. Ah, I'm dead. Or? I'm still dead, <laughs> okay. Music kinda cool, it's very different, but... It's part of the Fury soundtrack. Wait, I kept 340. Let's listen to something else. This song a lot. Okay. Are the new action keys already in-game? Yes. I'm not using them yet, though. I could try on this map, actually. Should I try? Because I really don't need a lot of steering here. Right now I'm using the new- Oh, wait, this is- Oh. Wait, this is really smooth. So I'm enabling action key, just to, just to show this. This is with action key 3 enabled, right? And now, to get 60%, I have to move the stick all the way to the side. But do you see how much control this gives me for the input values? Like... This is a lot easier, and then if I turn it off, to hit 60%, it's... It's here. And I can still go all the way over here. So it's, it's a better range. But I'm wondering if it's gonna help. Okay, for the start here, definitely. The, the slalom here in the start is a lot easier. Yeah, I'm much less at risk of uh, over-tilting the car. How to enable you still got the old ones? It's only for the new car. It doesn't work on stadium car. Still using... Keyboard for full uh, Steam Chrome apps? Yes, Drew. So I'm not gonna try to switch to joystick yet, at least for Stadium. Stadium is completely fine on keyboard. No real advantage to switch. Okay, wait. Gotta use this. The only thing is, near the... Um, I need to disable this action key in the uphill turn. So I can do it here, but then the brake a bit. Oh my god, I mean, this is insane. And then... Yes, and now enable. Oh, oh, I have to see a lot, okay. I still over tilted. I still tilted a little bit. Oh, I still overtook a little bit. That's PB. And that felt a lot easier. How does the action key work on Allen keyboard? Uh, the same way. Just gives you a better range. 
But like, look at this. How is that possible? That is so cool. And then enable. Done. So I need to start the tilt early enough that I have space to solve it. Okay. Makes sense. I am almost sure that Sander and people like that can full speed this next part. Like this right here. I think they do it full speed. <laughs> but I'm gonna hit break. Like one break top and I can kind of maneuver past that. What is the model? This is a T16000, I think it's called. But I'm not perfectly happy with this one because it, um... The one problem with this joystick is when you're doing a slalom, there's like a... I need to show this one, it's on the desk. There's a point when you're moving this one. Oh, I'm tilting the camera a lot here. Sorry, it's like a second. <laughs> camera is like off angle. Here. Okay. One problem with it is when you move it past center, do you see that it, it struggles to go like smoothly? Because there's a spring in the middle which kind of wants to center it all the time. So this this movement is not smooth and it's very hard to make this smooth. That's one thing you should know. That's one thing you should know. So I would want one that can do that a bit smoother. But this was just one I got on a whim, so. Don't all of them do that? Maybe. Maybe that's what you need to to uh, to make a joystick uh, work like this. Oh, thank you so much, and thank you also, Tombi. If you guys don't know, alert some meter today. While well, we do this campaign, but I appreciate it. You can clamp the spring, but that's hardware modification. Oh no. I'm only learning joystick for new cars, yeah. No drama 2024. Could you not uh, adjust the snappiness? There's no like screw to tighten or loosen that I could see. Oh, okay, almost. Render this is a thing? Uh, it's a plugin. <laughs> it's not official. Why not try wheel? Because it's it's not like driving a real car. In this game, it's a lot more like physical movement. It's not relaxing at all. And you have a massive wheel on your desk that you can't quickly remove and you know replace. I think it's less intuitive to learn than something like a joystick or a controller. Oh, okay, so then... Man, okay. Let's continue. So now I need to steer sharp. Yeah, nice, okay. No! I didn't have space. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I mean, that should be full speed, and that's one second, and then more speed, and ooh. It's hard to survive this map, but that is cool. Just... <laughs> Boom. Boom. 
No, I think this uh, this change to the analog curves is like huge. For for snow and and rally car, I can see basically everyone using this. Trying it a bit on a map like this now, it's like night and day. Like it's night and day what I feel like I could do on keyboard with this already compared to joystick. And then it's like night and day what I think I could do with or without the uh, new analog stuff. How many maps left? Only two. It's this one and the three minute map. Oh. Like, look at that. I need to see her sharp there and then ease out. Insane run. Haha! <laughs> I feel like a gamer god. Aye, aye, aye. That was wicked. No. Death. If competitive- if keyboard had adjustable steering rate based on an action key level, could it become co competitive? At this point, I think just give keyboard custom action keys. I- I don't mind. <laughs> would be the most base thing that they could do. Maybe a small break tap, yeah. Maybe I am too fast for that part, I don't know. But it does feel more and more like I can't survive that without the car tilting. Actually, for every 5%. See, that's too dank again, I feel like. But if you know that one turn you slide out at, it's like 45%. Put it at 45%. Because the reason that they made this change, right? To uh, controller stuff is... They don't want people with custom curves and a $300 analog device have a... Huge advantage versus people that don't have it and have like a $20 controller. Because there is uh, inequality there too, based on what analog device you actually have. And so following... Oh, five hundredths. Okay, insane run. <laughs> Huge. Huge PV. Following that same reasoning, I think they should... Think about doing the same for keyboard. And it wouldn't even make keyboard broken, I don't think. And I think at the very least, it's it's worth an experiment. If, if the analog curves are worth an experiment, I think this is worth an experiment too. Like, give... Just, just give keyboard players custom action keys and see if it fundamentally makes... For... F you could do the same, you know? You could do so that they only work for, for snow and rally car. You don't need them in stadium. Or give back the original 10 action keys, either one. It's a really good change. Yes! One map left, guys! Big PB. I am 1.4 seconds behind. I think Sander must have almost full sped the map. 
We're four hours in and with one map to go. Okay, so he did just carry 400 speed through the first corner, did not wall hug. All right. Okay, that's kind of insane. Is he just gonna full speed this too? Okay, that's hot. Okay, that's hot. Ooh. Just the way that man controls his joystick is is doing things. I want to do that. I want to get a 36-8 at this at some point. But we ain't got time to hold up. We got one map left, guys. One map left. It's called Power Stage. 3 minute 24 second author time. It has 1,000 players already who have finished the map. And how many people have the author time? Let me let me check real quick. Yeah, so currently there are eight players with the author time. Eight players have this author time and 1,145 do not. Let's get to learning. Sixty-three checkpoints. Yeah, it's, it's four minute map. <laughs> oh no, and it is actually quite laggy. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna turn my render distance even lower. I think. Okay, so trying to remember the map. I'm gonna need to do like three or four runs through this. No reset, just to learn it. Oh, don't put. Not too much stadium car. Else, I don't know what to do. Tona, I trust you that there will be not that much stadium car. Thank you in advance. Okay. Alright, I'm more comfortable with turns like this now. Yeah. Hmm, you know, I could actually start using the action key stuff here, too. Because I am noticing I'm not steering that much. I wonder if it would help. I'll enable it now and check. Is there? It's almost 60%, I think. Oof. Okay, now here I need to disable it. Straighten, then flick again. Straighten, back into action key. Oh, what is this? Okay, action key off, so... <laughs> this is wild. All right. The author time seems kind of ridiculous. Like if I can only lose like five seconds of pace on a good run, I mean, whew. How long will this take, guys? We'll be done before six hours. Hopefully. But I don't know. Oh, okay, respawn. Let's 
see what this one ends up being. If this one is like, um... 3.38, no respawn timer, then I'm feeling pretty confident. That we can get there eventually. It's not. It's slower. Okay. <laughs> not by much, though. That was bronze metal. Alright. Go again. Do you guys remember the map now? Because <laughs> I don't. At all. I have no idea what I just played. At least, like, I don't, I don't even know. So it went like it's, there was a stadium car road here somewhere. Here. It down this, and then there's a stadium car somewhere. Yeah, here, okay. Okay. Need to get that no slide clean. And not too much here. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, reset. Using the flight stick, yes. Although right now, I think if I played this on keyboard, I'd probably perform better. Because I am much more consistent with keyboard in general. But I am trying to learn joystick, because I think my peak with that will be higher with this car. But who? I mean, <laughs> I thought the other models were already t tough, like this. This, this is going to be extreme to beat for a lot of people, myself, I think, included. Let's go here. Oh. Okay. It's a great challenge, though. I like that in some way they're not just making all the author times free in every campaign. And maybe they have a bit more wiggle room with like a <laughs> new car campaign too. Okay, that was terrible, but let's continue. To remember the second half. This I have all forgotten. The only thing I remember was that weird feature with like the zigzag around holes. Oh, bad place to crash, okay. Oh yeah, the ice, okay. Coming up to the ice. Down. Yeah, this I need to be wider for. Okay, I can see the line through here. Not terrible. The car sideways. Straighten. Sideways. Straighten. No. Something like that. Should be good enough. Around. Down. The plastic wall. Wonder if I... Oh, it's so... 
precarious. You have to be... But if you can set up a little wide and get a no slide through there, that's so fast too. Big splits though, minus 30. Could be a huge PB. But just remember to go near the end here. A little bit blind. But it would not be author time. I can guarantee you that. This is probably still like a 3... Uh, 330 no respawn timer, if I had to guess. 329 maybe, but... Would be very surprised if it's lower than that. This run had a lot of mistakes. Oh no, why is, why is the no respawn timer plus 12? Okay, all silver. Oh, silver. Silver medalist. Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. And I've again forgotten the start. Okay, wait. There's a road turn after this one. There's a road turn. Sure. I mean, we were gonna need one more run, for sure. Here. That's not full speed. Let me try with the action key thing. Don't know, I'm not convinced. I'm not convinced on this map. Because it's so intense, it's so sharp. Although maybe? Maybe I am convinced. 63 attack points, yeah. The final boss. Any info on deep to two? Uh, no, we don't know yet. For the spring touch, if you hold the stick forward to not let it center, doesn't it help? It, it's, it feels so awkward. Because it also tries to center you back. Like, if you push the stick forward, it wants to go backwards again. So then you're just applying force in two directions, and it's worse, I think. So, um... I'm just going to stick with uh, what I've been doing so far. Okay, bit of a bad no slide, but still a successful one. Oh, hello. Now we're getting some pace. Not bad. One second gained. 15 to go, guys. If you consider the no respawn timer we had. There's uh, like two seconds here. Or is there? I thought my PB failed this part. Guess not. <laughs> okay, this is not good. Tona, what on earth is this author time? Here I failed. Okay, there's time to get in here. That's like two seconds. On a better run. That's fine. Wide line here. To get this, and then wide line again here to get this. Wide line here, disable action key. Oh, it's a bit sudden. I slide straighten here. Straighten. Yep.
Not promising, not promising. What about this turn? Can I get through here? I feel like I had the break. That is gonna help a lot though with pace. Oh, here I really gotta get out of the action key, okay. Yep. So we're gonna gain time here, but not against true pace, like no respawn timer. Why, 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 why? It's fine. Just forgot there was a sign there. And finish, guys. We are <laughs> 10 seconds behind. <laughs> Top 44 in the world, by the way. <laughs> 10 seconds behind the author time. My god. Is the song right now kind of annoying? Uh, it could be. Did you think about static pressure controlled joystick? Uh, I do want to get one that's maybe easier to control than this one. But I don't know what that would be. But for today, we're just using this one. Yeah, I think this might take two hours. <laughs> That's my early prediction is... Because there's so many turns to remember. Like, there's over a hundred turns to remember how to do here. In a row, in succession without fail. Just, just be aware that this can take a while, chat. Yeah, I need to push that. Okay, let's continue. Bad crash, but it's fine. Uh, also a bit of a bad crash, but... Like, we can... We should be able to gain 9 seconds on this, to beat all the time. <laughs> For that, I need to do more runs. Um, yeah. Okay. Wow. Ask Sander which one he uses. I think he uses a pretty old one. But this is like asking Granati what steering wheel did you use? And then he says, yeah, I used Microsoft Sidewinder. Which he did for his first, like, I don't know, 12 years of playing steering wheel. And it's like a steering wheel from 1999. So it's like, you know, just because someone is good at a device doesn't necessarily mean they're using a great device. They're just using what they're comfortable with. Ooh. 
Yes. Good speed. Ah, okay. I mean, it's not the worst, because I still have to slow down here. Two seconds. Wow, terrible. <laughs> More speed onto the ice. No, I slid out. Okay. It's fine. Ooh. Okay, it's fine. Great speed onto the plastic. Not sure how to best keep it though. Okay. So not that high. Yeah, and then here we slide. Disable the key. Go here. This turn. Okay, so that one is sharp and then smooth. Smooth. This is the one I crashed. Pillars. Right turn up. Uh, grass? Yeah. I mean, this turn is so crucial because the speed you keep on to the penalty. Don't hit the sign. Don't hit the bridge. This is still PB pace. Okay, my PB is quite trash. Uh, this is, should not PB. Alright. Learning a lot. And, and what I'm looking for as well, by the way, is, is it's very hard to put everything together into one run. But for example, there I had some really good segments, and I went up like two seconds on PB. And then I lost it again, I crashed. And then I have another segment, I went up like two seconds again. These are like the healthy signs that this is possible for me. So although the PB is not that good yet, the potential is really good. That's that's the main thing that uh, is, is motivating right now. Definitely have to get the full uh, dirt hill here. Oh. No, no. Three minute map aware, yeah. Now, this is a really big uh, challenge, uh, you don't know. Very challenging map to get all the time on. Ooh, got a split on. Can you wall bang with Rolly? You can, but it's slow. Often very slow. Like for these tight turns, it looks like, oh, let me just wall slam, but. The exit speed is always just so much greater when you, um... 
sorry, when you um do a smooth turn. Keep our head up. Do consistent, no reason runs, and and look for uh, look for pace. Here, could actually get almost like here. Yes. Then full speed. No. Worst place to crash. Plus one. A oh, plus twelve only. Weird. Maybe I didn't have it that good on PB. Oh, this is terrible. But I want to continue. This turn slid on a lot. Full flick. Ah. They did fix the snow car landing boys, guys. We haven't gone through everything we want today. There's like snow car things to look at. There's the action stuff. I want to play some precision maps and see if I can feel the difference. But priority number one is to beat this campaign. <laughs> so we'll go through all of it. And if we don't get things done today, we're going to stream. Like I'm going to stream the next four days in a row. Oh, wait, it feels weird now. I really want to try it out. Just, just bear with me. Right now, we gotta keep our mind on one thing, and that's beating this. Because I start thinking about other things, then I'm gonna lose motivation to play this. Because I'm not particularly, like... I mean, I like the challenge of this. Ooh. And I feel like I should beat it. But this would never be the campaign map I would want to hunt. <laughs> if I could choose. I'd much rather hunt the short ones. This is the last campaign map, yeah. Still fine. That's uh, it. Oh, okay. Expected a crash there, but we survived. Short turn, short turn. Gotta get a feeling for that. Slightly ahead, okay. Ah, this is terrible. Here. And then it's up. Oh, that's laggy, okay. Survive. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That is discouraging. So many good turns, and then just up oh, one missed, missed turn forty-eight out of a hundred, and yeah, <laughs> death. Oh wow! Oh wow! Is it disrespectful to look at the world it goes? Not disrespectful, but it's just. Way more fun, in my opinion, with any campaign, to uh, beat the records 
on my own and then check the records. Because it feels like solving a, a big puzzle. Finding all the racing lines, figuring out what type of trajectory you want to go for, like understanding what's good and what's bad. The world records are not going anywhere. They're always there to check when you uh, to finally beat on all the time. Okay, that's good. This is good, and then can I fulfill this? No. But still a good speed here. One of my better starts, for sure. I don't believe, I really don't believe right now. That you want to slow down so much and no slide that? I think that's a slide. That just. There's something off about that. Like, you sacrifice so much to try to get a clean no slide when you could just slide a bit and then you have the line. I think that has to be better. Small break top there, okay. And then down, oh, through, wide, up, oh, that's, okay. The ice, and tap, 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 tap. Oh, <laughs> okay. We can already feel how slow that works. This is good. Nice. That was slow, but maybe I can set up here. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. no. Gotta disable the action key to get through here. And then here, wide, slow. The turn I crashed, followed by pillars. Up, up left, grass. I understand why rally drivers need map readers now, because I am my own map reader. I am my own co-pilot for this map. Uh, sign, yellow sign. Okay. Honestly, good one. We're uh, getting closer. Top 20, guys. Top 20. <laughs> so stressful map to play, though. We need to find five seconds somewhere. Five full seconds. That's gonna be tough. But, only way to get there is to try. So this had a pretty good start, that's what I remember. And then some mistakes on the ice, the ice was terrible. Uh, a little bit before the ice was also terrible. And then, yeah. I don't see an easy five seconds, my friend. Easy, no. Definitely not easy five seconds, but... Five seconds? Sure. I don't need it to be easy, I just need it to be possible.
Okay. 0. 0.7, I mean. Sure. Just get me a run going out of the start. So this turn, right? This next one, I just... Everything in my body is telling me that this is a slide. But it's not. Okay. You got top 72 world 08, basically press forward. Yeah, that's crazy. That is quite crazy. I have like 8 hours playtime on that map and you probably beat my time. From before uh, they patched landing legs. Point seven. Seven again, less speed. Oh. Okay. Sharp, sharp. Gentle, sharp. No break taps here. Next time, no break taps there. Full sun through. Couple of break taps here to get this. Then full. Yeah. This part was really bad in my PB. This entire section really. I did it bad here too, though. Okay, survived. How much can I gain from here? Oh, the, the, this turn was really bad, wait. Let's hit this right to go up and then dive. Maybe not perfect, but still better. Has to be. Okay, slightly. Better speed across here and then slow. Yeah, if that is a no slide too, now we're kind of talking through this part, and then... Oh, here I confuse myself with action keys. Uh, here? Still plus point four. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> Crazy map. You think rally skips will be worthwhile ever? Sure. But you need a big inefficiency in the map. Like here there's 63 checkpoints for 183 seconds of driving. Or 100 and a little bit more, 200 seconds of driving. But basically we're averaging one checkpoint every four seconds. And there's just not any place I've seen where there's, it's worth to skip. Try to do a run at least. This is what I've been trying to learn today and lately for snow and, and rally car. Oh, really slow here. Nope. Okay, let's continue. Want to get a run going, even at the cost of. Point seven start. Great turn here, I think. Sharp, sharp, and then gentle for the next two. I can get a second in that part alone. 
Wow, this is slow. This was too much break. Okay. And then I lost a second. Okay. This has a lot of space. And then full speed through here. If you make that, you gain like a second too. But yeah, for people wondering, I'm still gonna play keyboard for Stadium. This is not a permanent change. This is just because I think it's more enjoyable to play the new cars with this so far. But I might change to analog keyboard eventually. Plus one. Can't believe this was worse than the start I crashed. That's racing lines for you. Sharp. Sharp. Gentle and sharp through this. Break less. Send it. Send it. A little hesitant there. Better. Oh. oh my god, we were so close to falling off the map there. Whew. Yep. Good segment. Disable the action key and then try to get a good eye slide. Oh, the second one was bad. Great exit speed, honestly. Happy with that. Happy with that, too. No. Ow. Oh, that was such annoying. Is there so much space afterwards? Oh, the one I crashed. Okay, the one I crashed. Pillars. And let's see here. So... Go here. Um, no. Okay, it's almost not even a big mistake. Oh, this probably cost me a bit of time. Yeah, I'm losing like every split here. <laughs> Three twenty-seven, top fifteen. Still three seconds to go. Progress. It's starting to feel a lot more possible, isn't it? Wow. Okay. This all the time should be 10 seconds slower. It really should. It's kind of insane. Don't think you can speed slide with Rally? You cannot, no. 
But there was, I mean, there was a crash, like, there's a huge crash in this one. Plus some bad parts. At this point, I'm kind of remembering the map. I, if, if you ask me to recite every turn now, I could not tell you. But when I see something now, I know what comes after it. And my brain sort of remembers what to do in each turn. Sort of. It's getting better. I only see a part and remember what movement I have to do after. I, I could not tell you the route. Yeah, I feel like I really have not refined this map yet. My, my lines and everything. It's probably like a point two ahead start. Point three even. I released a lot more than I had to here. This is fine even with the crash. That was still a good start. I'm ahead with a I am half a second ahead with a crash. Wow. Okay. Ow. Oh, man. Okay, still ahead. Because my personal best is apparently just utter garbage. Top 15 world, by the way. This car is not at all hard to control. I wanted it so bad. Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. Stop hitting the walls. Just let me through. Just let me through. Just let me through. Coming through. Point three. Point four. I am has to- I- you stop tapping brake. I'm tapping brake when I don't know what to do. It is a button of hesitation, not of like actual action. It doesn't help me. This makes the turn more awkward. Here though, it's kind of necessary. Okay. So if I'm two seconds behind here, what can I do with this? How much closer can I get? in the last part. Oh, I can stay low. This is so much speed. Unfortunate crash, but th that, that was a good turn. I'm gonna start doing that. And then what here? Because this I face planted. 287, 276, but it doesn't tell the full story. So I can still gain a lot more. Yeah, probably almost a second in that turn alone. Done with the no slide. And there's a huge crash somewhere here too. Was it that wall? No, it was this wall. So not crashing this wall could also gain me further like 0.7. So I think the mindset I should have going, and I, and I had a mistake here too. The mindset I should have going into runs is like there is so much time saved late into this run. I should not restart unless I'm like plus two at like one and a half minute. Because then I can still gain in all these checkpoints here. All these checkpoints. You see I'm gaining? I should not reset. Remind me to not reset, guys. Because look, we've almost caught everything back. From like plus 3 to plus 1.2, I think, in the finish. Alright, so we're not resetting. I gotta rest my hand just a little bit. Someone asked me earlier if I'm feeling like straight in my hand. At this point I am. I think you can see it even. Do you see this? <laughs> I'm feeling a lot of straight in my hands. And some of the red stuff you see is from bouldering, I think. It looks like it's uh... Yeah, I think it's just um... From bouldering. Oh my god, my camera's so tilted as well. But yeah, here. <laughs> I just need to rest it a little bit. Five hours. Five hours of grip and a stick. And we're soon there. Oh, it's actually seven hours. 
camera is tilted, you know, I see it, but it's kind of hard to fix on the spot. This is how it's set up. Maybe? Maybe? Don't, don't break, don't fall. Okay. I think we're fine. Whew. Wait, Janik, are you here? Just woke up from a six hour nap. Yo, Janik. Dude, I went climbing the other day. I went climbing. That was good. I'm getting into it again. <sighs> okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Wild sound. Good to hear, yeah? What grades do you climb? I climb the easiest at my gym. It's, it's color based. So white is the easiest. And then it's green and then blue. And I do mostly whites and greens and some blues. But the blues I don't really complete. I try and I fail. Please use face cam instead. For this one, I need documentation that I am a master of the arts of joystick. I need to uh, demonstrate my control over this. Expect you to pass my grades next time. You got the climber build. It's honestly not fair. Because there, there are boulders I climb. Where just raw height makes it, it's like a cheat code. Like being tall and just skipping five holds. Don't reset. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, let's not reset. Let's keep going. Not with that crash though, but, but yes. Also, last thing I'll say before I focus up here, Janik. This map is really difficult. I mean, really, really difficult. So... Don't make the same mistake as me and go for all author times in one sitting. It is... Uh, very difficult. Okay, so we could be one second ahead of this, but let's continue. Oh, beautiful. Yes. Sharp. Sharp. Gentle, sharp. A oh, little, okay. But that's honestly fine. Because I usually go way too slow in this turn. And now I know my limit's better. I push this. Oh, beautiful. It's a beautiful day. I gained no time, but I got the strat I wanted. By pushing that turn more. Okay. Could still PB here, guys. Although it looks really bad. On the splits. Stay patient. Good things will come to those who wait. Uh, not this time. Giga chat first time chatter. What does this even mean? What, what, what he wrote, what does that even mean? You could just say hello as your first message. That's what I recommend. Recommended first time message is just to say hello and I will say hello back. Hello Krantz. Hello Chompa. Split. Hello. Immaculate music. That's a great compliment to the artist and to my music taste. Baldor. First time chatter. Hello. Also Capitan. And what up? See, now you've started your chatting journeys. You said hello, now you can type Joel, you can type blah, you can type all kinds of emotes. You've begun a new chapter in your life. Of Twitch chatting. 
Also, KK, I see you. I'm just greeting greeting the new friends. Do painted nails help you drive faster? Yes. This is something that not a lot of people know about. But it's true. Okay, it's not reset. Don't reset. I hate this run, but don't reset. Oh. Oh, this run is truly, truly horrendous. Like, I, I can be a second out of this. <laughs> but no reset. Oh, beautiful turn. Sharp. Chill. And sharp. Good timing, honestly. And now watch out for this one. This one. That one. Nice. Okay. Continue. Lord have mercy. This is so stressful. This is so stressful. Okay, we're fine. Okay, turn off the action key and go here, here, and... Good ice part. That was so close. Okay. Don't panic. You gotta be a calm Trekmania Zen Buddhist when playing this car. Calculated clean gameplay. Great turn here. Small brake tap. 34%. Easy clap. Not too fast, not too fast. Yes, 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 yes. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Full steer. Beautiful. Three point five seconds, guys. That's what we need, done splits. So we gotta push here a bit. But this could be it. It's a good end. <sighs> no, no, ah, the checkpoint was sticking out a bit of the wall, else this crash would have been completely fine. Yeah, that is so unfortunate. I mean, it would only be a second faster, it would not be the author time, I don't think. So we can be a second ahead of the start, right? Was that what I said? I think it'd still be a second ahead. At virtual, would you ever consider kissing a guy like me? Uh, I don't know what you look like, but I kiss all my guy friends. In a... You know, appreciation way. Not in a sexual way, just, you know. I went out drinking with my, my IRL friends the other day and yeah, kisses were flying. That's just what it is. Platonic is the word you're looking for, maybe. I mean, which countries do that? I find that really wholesome. The countries that, like, you meet someone, and then you give them three kisses next to their cheeks. Wh which countries do that? Norway doesn't. 
But there are some countries where this is like the... Um... So I can't read chat right now, just so you know, but tell me after the run. <laughs> That's a really cool practice in my opinion. Near death experience, touching the wall there. Minus one. No, what is bro doing? Okay. Little bro. Okay, we're fine. Okay, it's fine. Greece, Morocco, Italy. Okay, France. It's cozy. After playing this map for a bit though, guys, I think the auto time is actually quite doable. But it's just, uh, like, 20, 21, and 23, I think, are harder. It's just the idea that you have to learn a three minute map to beat this auto time, that is... And all the turns with it, that is the hard part. The, the pace is actually quite forgiving. Like, the quality of your run is maybe, like, 90... 2% accuracy to beat this, and like 95% on another map. For a second I almost forgot what was my break button and I would have crashed. Still not really used to this. Ooh. Yeah. That was so nice. Oh, I've almost made this mistake so many times now. No, touch the grass a bit. Oh, a little bad. Still fine. <sighs> ah. Oh, no, the lead. What happened to my lead? Okay, there's a one second crash in the end. I still need something here though. I'm risking. I, I, I'm gonna crash somewhere. Plus one. Oh, it's gonna be plus two. We dumped so short. Oh. Yep. Okay. One more should be enough to get this, I think. One more good run. Ooh, good speed. I mean, 64 is not a good split, but good speed. Oh, just the worst crash, okay. 
crashing is honestly fun. It's still possible to crash. It's just I need to take risks elsewhere. And this is already looking quite rough. Maybe though. Oh, okay. Plus one. Let's see. One more mistake and we're calling it a reset. Not over yet. Okay, one more mistake and we're calling it a reset. It's just okay. Yeah, okay. There, there, there. It's over. There, there's only so much I can take. <laughs> Before it's not possible anymore. Great split here. Slow down too late. Okay. So we lost our entire lead. We still have a run. No. Okay. Saved it. Okay. Such a bad place to break. Nice, finally good turn here. Split out. Oh, can you go any slower? Okay, this is disastrous. So possible. Frick. <sighs> One more, surely. That's the crazy part, you can do like 90 good turns if you have one where you fall off the map, you have to do it all again. Starts now though. Another minus one here. Oh, that was nice. Okay. Okay. 
That's enough. I think it is. I think it is. Yes. <laughs> oh, finally, five hours and 20 minutes. Oh, and my camera just disconnected. Wait. Yep, that's fine. Oh my god, hello! 5 hours, 22 minutes! Floppa, thank you for the 20 gifted subs, dear god! Thank you so much! YouTube chat, thank you for the GG's. Twitch chat, thank you for the GG's. That was so stressful. What a map, guys. Couple of mistakes, but... Whew. Three, three minutes of, of snow cart, like... My hand is still kind of, um, tense, like, the muscles. Because I sit and just, like, grip my fist for so long, so... <laughs> but that was good! That was really good! Nice! Let's- let's end the timer, that's like 5 hours and 23 minutes! Uh... Yeah, cool campaign, is my thoughts overall. Uh, really cool car as well. I do think, though, having played this now, <laughs> everyone's gonna need a lot of time to learn these things. Like, don't get mad at yourself if you're not uh, mastering this immediately. Because that's just how this car is, I think. But wow. Map 23 took like an hour. Map 25 took like an hour. Whew. Watch world record? We could watch most of these world records. Oh, Eddie with a huge time on this map. I also do want to hunt these, but guys, I'm really fried today. Like, I, I am really fried now. That was a lot of, um... <laughs> a lot of concentration to beat these. Snow card checks? I should do that. We should do the snow card landing bug tests. I think that's what we'll do. And then tomorrow... So, I'm streaming four days in a row now. Tomorrow... We can uh, watch all the world actions, hunt these maps a bit. I think that's what I'll do. But I first want to check the landing bugs with the snow car. That sounds uh, really fun. So I think let's do that. But yeah. Um, if you made it this far. If you made it this far in the uh, campaign playthrough, then I hope you enjoyed it. Because I, uh, I enjoyed the campaign, but it was really difficult. lot last and then we just cut this in thank you so much for watching and uh subscribe to uh make buckley happy and then you can get to work buckley we're done we're done with the campaign all right campaign is done now just gotta get edited let's let's hop into 
some landing bug testing. Let's hop into some landing bug testing. So I built these maps, guys. Don't judge my mapping. I built these maps for scientific purposes, okay? Just before the patch. I like to do this, every patch. Uh, so let me see where they ended up. Yes. Okay, starting with... I, I just wanted to test this first. It's a press forward map. And I just want to know if pressing forward now is the same as before with Snowcar. If there's any acceleration change, if there's any change to how the car behaves. We should get 14683. No. Interesting. I wonder if that is because the hitbox is different for the finish line. I don't think the driving is different, but I think because the hitbox is changed, I think you touch the finish line sooner. Kind of interesting. I thought I was stupid for building a, um, a press forward map, but I guess not. Okay, I need to compare this. I have both replays. One second. What's going on here? Replay editor, wait. Snow car test. But it's the wrong map. Did I overwrite my autosave? If so, then I do not have the, the replay. One sec. I don't think I have the replay. Okay, we can't compare. All right, let's do the other one. Let's do the other one. That's interesting. I, that, that's the, my best guess. That's my best guess. That the hitbox in front of the car is just better. This replay we do have for comparison. And what this map is, is a landing bug test. It's literally just a huge drop. I pressed forward to get my author time of 12.861. What happens now? That kept about 20 more speed. That, that is a lot faster. That's just both press forward. So the car, the hitbox now is better. And can you actually make this even better by landing like this? No, what? So is the flick thing not a thing anymore? So that was a bad landing, wait. Wonder if, oh, it is. So you, that's cool. You still want to do the flick, the left, right on an edge to kind of air brake the snow car. But it doesn't landing bug as hard. The hitbox is way more, yeah, consistent now. What is wrong with the music? I, I don't know. I, I don't think there's anything wrong with the music. Snow car test number three. Several landing bugs in a row. Press forward time here was a 27. It was a 27. And it crashed the wall. This might crash the wall too. 27.5. And the 26.4 was me trying to reduce airtime. Oh my god. Okay. This is a little busted. This is a little bit busted. And that's without doing these flicks like I talked about. Which I think for the most part should give you more speed. Oh, the press forward looks strong, man. Okay, but this is- everyone has to agree, this is positive, right? Did you guys find the landing bugs fun? Do you miss them? Okay, I think I can already tell. For a huge drop like this, if you land a little bit on the front tire, it looks really fast. Like you aim for the, let's say, left or right front tire. This is five seconds faster. You have to play 08, yeah. So you, you aim for the, the front tire now. 
I think I had only one bad one, and that was this one. Yeah. Oh, this one was bad. I think. <laughs> yeah, it's literally like four, five full seconds faster than the best I could do pre-patch. Let's compare these real quick. Oh man, it feels so good to not play a three-minute endurance map. I, I love the campaign, but there's something like when you're already playing Trackmania for five hours straight, and then you get to the last map, and it's five, it's it's three minutes rally endurance on joystick. I was so discouraged. I was so in disbelief that that was the last map. This is pre-patch versus now. Wait. No, sorry, this is not. Th th these are two recent replays. Wait. Uh, pre-patch was... This one. This was my best run pre-patch versus now. Music too loud? It, it looks okay. Okay, sorry if it's loud. Sorry if it's loud. Okay. This is my best run pre-patch right now. You can quickly tell which one is pre-patch. <laughs> okay, so it's this one. Alright, let's have a look. Th this is a good run, by the way. This car right here is a good run. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> Where's the difference? Guys, let's hop on 08. Let's hop on 08. People are saying you can basically PB on 08 with press forward. I used to be top 20 on this map. I it can't be the case anymore. I might still top 20 here. Maybe I am. I'm playing this on keyboard, by the way. I am enough joystick for today. Let's see if I remember this even. Try booster ramps at the start. They seem to be just as fast as the other way now. Because <gasps> you don't landing bug. Is that so? Wait, this is faster. What? That is weird. No, that is... Sorry, that is weird. I mean, what? I landed in an uphill and kept my speed. It feels like I'm using cheats. Oh, I see music's loud now. Okay. Don't report me. Do not report me. This is valid. But I mean, this is even faster too, though, is it not? I still have to do the left, right? Because it does give you more speed. But 1649 check, that's just not right. Could the booster path be better? I think so. You still need a good uh, last landing, but... I don't think you can beat Old World anymore? Oh, really? Why not, Link? Because of the nose down? Can you not get the nose down anymore? Uh, world record is from old, old physics. You can't? Oh... So the- wait, I'm not- so the one map everyone was like, damn, this map after the patch could actually be impossible? To beat? That would be wild. It's like you can- I mean, you do get- maybe not the world actor no dive, but you can definitely no dive. With the old strat, you can definitely no dive.
So I'm not sure I agree with the uh with the assessment. Also, I think uh booster sword is slower, but it's not much slower. That's my feeling so far. Let me try um top eight time was that an hour ago, okay. Yeah, that's still like only a, that's that's still like point one behind World Record though. Yeah, you can get like free really good starts here by just just driving. And then you have to get this weird nose dive. Take the map that is easily faster. 17 is actually crazy. I can check 17. So I want to see if I can get one good uh, attempt on this. Okay, no nose dive. Your ears are gonna die. From what? Ten minutes total time on this map. We went from author time to champion medal in eight minutes. Yeah, no, the the start does solve a lot of things. The start bugs. I also wonder if O3 is faster because of no bugs. But okay, um, I want to try 14, which seems like it has been improved, and map. Okay, so 17 is what, 39, 28 now. Okay. Okay. So this could be pretty fast. The thing about this map, if you haven't seen it before, is that it has a jump in the middle. Uh, which lets you carry ridiculous speed if you don't landing bug. And it was very hard to not landing bug before this patch. But now, you can just jump and I'm assuming you get 430. Yeah, 438. Okay, okay. So this is the world record, like the old world record speed, but you get it every time. Okay. It's a little bit weird getting used to keyboard now, not gonna lie. But I could not drive this on... Could I drive this on joystick? Could I drive this on joystick now? Maybe I could. I do want to see it, though. Oh, it's action key 3 to get the wood wiggle. Okay. So it looks like I'm just slower, but speed on wood, when you're over 430 speed, is ridiculously important. I can be plus one second if I just have like five more speed entering the wood here. That's gonna snowball so hard. It's not funny how much this matters. If you're just faster for the ending. So just trust, trust the process. I'm going for the consistent start now to see if I can PB with it quite easily. Then we can do the shortcut after. So here... Oh, I'm actually almost missing. Only 595. You can get over 600 here. Now I'm slower. Okay. Actually, key three there. Actually, key three. Plus point six is fine. I'm gonna see this landing. <laughs> Be like perfect. Five ninety three only. You should get like 6.30. The, the speed that the world could get at the snow is 6.30. Maybe more now with the new records, but... The old world record had 6.30. At that point. This has a lot of potential. Just gonna start wiggling early.
We're not taking the first shortcut, just so I can try to jump every time. And actually have more speed. It's not faster, it's slower. But just for consistency. Just to try out the, the new speed gain. That's the only thing I really want to try today. And then I can always get a better PB here later. Yes, yeah, 614. Now this is flying. Oh, should not hold. Let's tap. Oh god. Okay, yeah, very fast. Uh, Ryan was taken, Black Eagle, and Lockbomb. Thank you guys all. The way I have my alert set up now is really finicky, so... Uh, I think if I enable them now, they're all gonna play from like the last six hours that they've been off. Which we could do. But they wouldn't make much sense anymore. <laughs> Just six hours of straight TTS. Or six hours worth, rather, not six hours in real time. Uh, we can do that. Just, you, you know what you're in for. I uh, think that should be what's going to happen now. There were a lot of things we missed. So we got Florian. Thank you for the sub. Six hours ago. <laughs> oh, who are you? Wait, wait, it's cut off. How do I play the trumpet? Oh my god, it's loud for me. It's loud for you guys? No? Okay. Edwardish, thank you for the 30 Rally, months. rally, rally. Okay. You thought they were all coming at once? That'll be chaos. They're just going to play one by one. Things is like we usually mute alerts for things like campaign discovery and stuff. But we did not expect this one to take six hours. Did you guys expect that? Six hour rally campaign discovery? It's, it's wild. rally time. It, it, it was, yeah. Maybe we can hear some wild like this is a time capsule now, you know? Maybe we can hear some takes from six hours ago and see if they were right or wrong. The messages are like... Greetings fellow teammate 07. I didn't see who said that. Probably possibly the only person if so high. Also, six speed. Oh dear. Croissant baguette. <laughs> oh my god. That was quite the take. Don't know if I agree with that that take. Shorty needs to calm down getting WR on every map. Well, he tested the maps, but yes. I think he tested the maps. This should be pretty fast. 438, and what is the oh 619 again? I mean, it's crazy that action key 3 is not sufficient there. And you'd never landing bug these jumps. I forgot to think about this. You'd never landing bug the end either. Okay, let's do the start cut now. Let's do the start cut. Yay, rally car. Because I can very easily PB here, I think, now. So it's just here. Oh, that was not bad. Ah. Licenser. World record hunt? I am not at the level of uh, Sammy and Granati on this. But I do want to succeed at it. Get an EPB. I mean, this should already be over, I think. If this just lands moderately clean, it should be over. Yeah, I think it's over. 
back when I was playing Trackmania original I used to hate Rally so much and many years later when I finally decided to play with controller I learned to love Rally so much. Yeah, Rally Rally is fun with uh, with analog input. I really think so. If you just do digital 100% taps though, it's, it's not. Do Discovery medals contribute to prestige levels? Uh... I don't know. Also, PB? No! As if I touched... When do you think Nadio plans to add Slater car and Renemy car? Oh my god. Thing is, at this point, keyboard is getting pretty bad for this map, because you're going so fast... ...that I would Tell honestly... Tell plug-in for that. These messages sound so wild now in the past. But, um... I wonder if I'd do better on joystick, because... That... You don't... Like, 80% sears too much. And 60 is too little. Was up. No, here. Okay. Let's try with uh, with. Uh, yeah, balls. What is this? What is this device called? Uh, joystick. First message: Throat go at fifty-four. I think I'm in love with you. Uh, welcome to the stream. How is the new car? Okay, I gotta get. I like the new car. Yes, we're wondering. Now we're trying the because this is a part of the update as well. Snow car landing bikes have been fixed. Can you welcome me to the stream, Kawini? You are most welcome in the stream. Play with the stick. I am. No, I am. It's it's a little tough to get used to, though. But it has to benefit me on this map. But I can predict my consistency on this first shortcut is just gonna go down drastically. And then the next part is that um, wow, the wood wiggle stuff. That's gonna be hard. So maybe it's not easier. Congrats on the awards win. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Exatira. Okay. EA almost three years. I mean, I, Our time flies. I cannot lose 0.3 in the start right now. I just cannot. My brain <laughs> cannot. <laughs> we need more pace. Adding new cars, Keyboard then first. adding new controls to make them feel more like the old ones makes it feel just like the old cars with extra steps. Good day. Yeah, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Easy PB. Easy PB, that didn't even take that long. But getting more speed is gonna be very hard. Okay. Love is temporary. Scandinavian jokes are forever. Happy streamer. Small PB. I'm guessing Sammy kept like 640 speed. Change to joystick during the big jump? You might just be a genius. Dual wheel trackmania. Six forty. How is the rally car so far? Six forty-five. Wow. 
Holy, and then clean. Oh, what a setup. Hey, Wirtul, what is your opinion on the car so far? Is it good? Whew. That's really sick. Uh, I'm getting so many questions from earlier, but yes. The new car is good. It's good. It's a good car. Um, so this map is not that much faster yet. 14, though, I wanted to try. Try to actually use the joystick a little bit. And then Wirtul got this run. Five hours ago. Five hours in the making. Do you landing bug here now? Oh, you don't. Should be beatable. If you just get a clean one. Have two joysticks for maximum precision. I'll see how that would help. How bad is it for keyboard? Keyboard is fine. Keyboard is still alive and well. Keyboard is playable. You need not worry. But, um... Analog is probably the better choice. That's just what it is. And with these cars in the game, that's maybe what we have to accept for keyboard. Hey, just got here. How bad is the new car? But like you just, if you get used to the idea of using action keys, then you're going to be okay. But yeah, you need to spam a lot of action keys. Action key three and two mostly for rally. Action key three and four for snow car. So you can still land badly. I guess that makes sense. You can, you can of course still land badly. But this is more consistent. Hey, what you will how is the rally car? Yeah, like just, I mean, the start I had my PB felt really good, I remember. And then it had a weak uphill. I don't know if I can beat that weak uphill now, but this uphill is seriously weak. This turn to the right. And so maybe if I start playing this on joystick, maybe I can win. More easily. Damn 14 months. <laughs> Minus six hours. 14 months, a big yield. Thank you for the prime earlier. Hope they bring back sunrise at some point. Everyone's focusing on sunrise, but what about sunset? Life. Or do you just wanted to know how the car is? I know. Guys, I'm honestly so fried. I've been streaming for how long? Eight hours. I need to get some food soon. I think I'm gonna call it a night here. It has been Keyboard great. On 24 and 25 it has been great. Is insane. I wanna play more tomorrow. We're gonna stream four days on Rosa Sun, at the very least. So, yes. I think I'm gonna call it a night. And then uh, get up uh, at a reasonable time tomorrow and, and stream some more New Trek Mania. Definitely want to hunt the rally maps. See if we can get some like top fives, maybe. Maybe a world record. I don't know. I don't know how tough these are. Check My tomorrow what I can do. Gone ten months on bread and water, but ain't but, no uh, way I'm, I'm gonna call it a night. Ads. Jared, thank you for the twenty-three months. Thank you, Cheeto. Thank you, Wood Serino, Rose Dot Live, Cookie Dough, Egg Zorn, Chef Couch as well. Thank you guys all. And thank you. You. For watching. Uh, it's been great. It's been really fun today. Do follow the stream on Twitch. Do subscribe on YouTube. I'll be live again tomorrow. Let us... I think I want to raid Samifying. Guys, you saw Samifying had the world record on that map? He is uh, currently streaming. Hunting some... Year, uh, it oh, went by one so by the looks of it? Go say hi in him. Uh, in him. In, in, in him stream. <laughs> Do that and uh, I'll get some rest, alright? YouTube chat, that is Twitch TV Samifying. Hello from P1 France. France. Bye -bye. Do you prefer the rally car over the snow car?
Yes. Ah, uh, no, actually, uh, rally car is fun. Uh, you, the snow car is better, though. But bye bye, everybody. Love your content, great main channel video. Thank you. Bye bye. Hey. I have an idea that might help keyboard to be more competitive by having binds reducing the rate the rotate to the side at. If you don't mind, what are your thoughts? I don't know, to be honest. Uh, good night, everybody.